Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Zoe Street. I must say, I feel like I'm starting my birthday show early. I thought it was all weekend anyway, so I'm going to pretend it is. We've got Debbie Moore Designs this first out. Can you tell? The samples galore. She's flown in from France, packed full of samples. She says, I haven't even bought any clothes with me this time because I wanted to bring all these samples. There are so many amazing, amazing brand new panels that we're going to launch this hour. So we better get on with the early bird nice and quickly so that we can get Debbie on now. We've got something that we all need. If you're starting out in the sewing world, if you're starting out in the quilting world, I know a couple of days ago when I was on um, doing our first, you know, sample of quilting with Totally Patched, this would have been ideal. The price on this is going to be amazing. It is one of the most used products here in our studio. We use razor cutters day in, day out. Um, you know, we all have multiple pairs of scissors, don't we, as, as crafters? I know lots of people who also have multiple rotary cutters. Maybe you don't want to change your blade for when you're doing foundation paper piecing. You know, if you're cutting into paper, you could have one for your FPP, one for your fabrics. You could have one for your classes, one upstairs, one downstairs. It's so perfect to be able to make sure that you have extra rotary cutters. And we're going to make it worthwhile today. Now, it's going to be a busy, busy show. We've got a lot going on today. I've only got one hour on my own. So, shall we start the birthday weekend? I'm just saying it's my birthday weekend. It's actually officially my birthday show tomorrow, but we're going to start it with a bang. Uh, today, Rotary Cutter, by the way, this is a really great one as well because it's got the safety catch. It's only $5.99. <laughs> Ben's back off his holidays. Ben is back with a bang. He likes to call himself the deal fairy, yes. Um, not one person messaged him asking where he was. He says, I've, I, I was waiting for all of the messages to flood through. Get your messages in now. Get your messages in now to tell him you've missed him. Please do. He's very needy this morning. Just £5.99 for your 45mm rotary cutter. It's got your soft grip handle. Um, it has got the safety catch there. It's already got your 45mm blade fitted. And, I mean, you can pay that for a replacement blade, let alone a whole new rotary cutter. Loads of you getting involved for these. Enjoy whilst they are there. As I said, it is going to be a very, very busy morning. We've got two whole hours with Debbie, and we've also got Dave from the Green Machine, who is back. He hasn't been on for ages. I think we haven't seen him for a couple of months. So um, I think it's been since the birthday, actually. Since Sewing Street birthday. Good morning, Margaret says, have a great weekend. Good morning, Christine. Oh, thank you, Christine. Christine did make sure everybody was aware that it was my birthday this weekend. Did you see her post on the Facebook page? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> £5.99. Loads of people who have got these in the basket. We're just giving you a bit of a chance to check out before we get Debbie on. Remember, look, I mean, have a look around. Have a look on pre-order. We've got a lot to show you in this first hour. So everybody get your rotary cutters ready. We've got panels galore. These are going to be so useful for your panels. I would just have one ready for any classes, any workshops that you're going to, instead of having to pack a whole new tools bag, um, if you're going out and doing a workshop or a class, it's ideal to just have a second one, isn't it? And don't think that this is a second one. I'm just having a look in our, in our box if there's one that is open there, because um, this is one that we use quite frequently. We do like so simple. And let's face it, you could pay it at 20, 25 pounds for a good quality rotary cutter. Don't think this is any lesser quality. Oh yeah, Debbie's found one. Oh, we've got loads. They're all open in the studio. Thank you, Debbie. Um, so here you go. You've got your lovely soft grip handle and you can see you can use it as a left hander or a right hander. You can actually spin the blade around completely as you've got the... Um, as you've got the, the, the uh, screw on the one side here, so you can completely change this into a left-hander rotary cutter if you need to. But it does have your blade. It's got the safety grip as well. Um, just £5.99 is a, it's a blooming bargain to start your Saturday show, isn't it? He's back with a bang, our bed. He's been on holiday to the Netherlands. 
He's been sampling all of the alcohol-free that Amsterdam, uh, alcohol-free beer that Amsterdam has to offer. Did you find some new faves, Ben? He did, he did, he did. <laughs> Under six pounds for your voucher cutter. Remember, once you've paid your postage and packaging, once you've paid your PMP, um, that's it for the day. Thank you for finishing my sentence there, Ben. I forgot what I was going to say. It's there for the day. So you fill your boots today. It's going to be a great show. Right, keep going through for your So Simple Rotary Cutter at 5 .99. Today, coming up, as I said, we have got brand new panels from Debbie Moore. And, oh, my gosh, she is like a bottle of pop this morning. So excited to launch these new... I mean, look at that dress. I didn't know that we had dress panels, and actually, we don't. They're, it's made out of a tote bag panel. It just shows you how creative you can be with Debbie Moore's panels. We've got brand new toiletry panels. You can see a tablet stand there. We've got brand new variety panels. We've got panels that have got um, fabulous rectangles on to build up your own quilts. So much coming up in this first show with your vintage spring floors. Oh, and by the way, it was only last month we fast-tracked these three productions to be able to get as many back in stock of the spring fairies as so many people missed out. So don't panic. Get them on pre-order if you want. Then coming up at 9 o'clock, I've got new tapestry, velvet and canvas fabrics. I say new. Loads of them are brand new to me, so they could be new to you as well. There was William Morris tapestries in there. Love them. They're coming up at 9 o'clock. 10 o'clock, uh, we've got Bella and Debbie back with Birds of a Feather. More brand new panels to bring you in the 10 o'clock show. And then it might be slightly later than scheduled, just depending on, you know, time running over. But we're going to do a full demonstration with Dave Green and his green machine. We've got brand new Diamante uh, hardware as well coming up in his show, so stay tuned. Any questions you've got, get them in. Right, keep going through for your early bird. Debbie, 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 Debbie. Hello, hello, hello. hello. It's Hi. lovely to have you mm. back. Thank you. With two kisses from France. Oh, mwah. how are you? I'm very well. Very excited. I love mornings. Hi, everybody. <laughs> um, but yes, I, Bella and I are so excited to be here because obviously we are now dived into the world of sewing uh, and you're absolutely <laughs> loving it aren't oh, you oh my goodness yeah you know, i can't believe we haven't done this sooner because there are just so many well, you doors are now opening you have to think thanks Stuart, because he's been going on to me for years debbie you need to do fabric debbie you need to do fabric and obviously we started last year and essentially bella and i um got together and think right okay i have never sewn and i'm still not a good still learning, sewer, and yeah. still learning. every every day is a, is a school day yeah but literally i i'm loving it because you think oh you can do this you can do different things mm -hmm. and as a beginner it's so easy yeah. with the panels it's like yeah. You can create something, and this is what amazes it, which is why we brought all new panels. Yeah. Yes, you've got the tote bags and the quilts and everything like that. I mean, Bella. Hello, is... Bella, by the way. Lovely to have you back. Here she is. She has been, obviously, on it full time, unfortunately, because, obviously, I'm in France. Yes. And renovating a chateau, which is... How's it going? Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Uh, still finding things and garden at the moment. You wow. Know. My poor husband, we, uh, have a, we had a ride on mower, but it broke. Oh. So he's used an acre, <laughs> an acre of using a little lawnmower. Oh, my word. Oh, yes, because it broke. But um, at the moment, it was 26 degrees last weekend oh, in France. Fabulous. What a shame. But, yeah, so uh, <laughs> I'm flying over every few weeks. Um, yeah. And so Bella's got my sewing machine. And when I say my sewing machine, I have to be honest with you, uh, we started, was it last July? Yes. Last July, we started this journey and we're loving every minute. But somebody gave me a sewing machine uh, four years ago. Yeah. And it hadn't been out the box until the month I started here. <laughs> <laughs> and that is the first time I'd actually sewed. Before we know it, you will have you knocking up loads of things. Oh, in I have the so many ideas. You'll have quilts yes, galore, I want to learn. I want to, I want to do a whole chateau collection. Oh, wow. So, yes. yes. But anyway, for now, Likewise. it's all about spring. Oh, and vintage and florals. The vintage florals are absolutely beautiful and perfect time of year to be launching these. So, 
tablet holders as well. This yes. is a new design, isn't it? Well, have you ever tried to put a tablet on your knee? It just keeps yeah. falling over. Okay, so the vintage one is this one here. So we have got, because we're doing the vintage one, yeah? Yeah. So this is the spring one's coming up soon. So this is it here. That is brilliant. Now, the vintage florals, Bella's had so much her met. She loves anything vintage. <laughs> I mean, I do as well, but we can't, we had to split the collections to be working. Otherwise, we wouldn't have got them all done. And yeah. we're going, oh, that's nice, isn't that nice? Yeah, oh, absolutely. So she has had so much fun. So this is a new panel that we've oh, designed. Oh, brilliant. So essentially, you just cut it out and you make this. Now, Bella, technical question. Are our seam allowances included in this? Yes, it is. So all you do is cut out and then you stitch in a quarter of an inch from the edge. And the designs are beautiful. You've even, I mean, you've even included some spare fabric there. There's of a course. bit of room on there. And we've done the instructions as well Brilliant. and a little diagram showing you how to put it together. Uh, and honestly, it, it's, it's amazing. I don't know why I didn't have one before. Oh. Now you can do bespoke ones. Do you know, exactly. This is going to be really, really useful and a lovely gift for somebody. You know, if you've made lots of cushions or lots of tote bags, it's nice to be able to think, actually, that's something else that I can yes. make. And is this beginner friendly? Totally beginner friendly. I mean, I'm a very um, inexperienced sewer. And actually, all I want to be able to, it's just enough of a curve that you can manage it. There's nothing complicated on there. And honestly, if I can put it together, you can put it together. If you've ever used a sewing machine, that it is very straightforward to do. And the diagram just shows you exactly how to construct it. You've even got pockets on the uh, pocket yes. on the front there. Yeah. We had to put a pocket so you can put your phone in as well. Oh, yeah. You know, yeah. it has to be. It could be. I mean, but Bella's Great put um, um, what's digital? Which uh, one? Uh, iPad pencil. iPad pencil. Okay. okay, but you can put whatever <laughs> you want to. And we've used. I think you've got the beads on. Yeah, the show. recycled. Um, but what we've done pellets. is put half of the pellets and then half of wadding. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, but then in this, you can you can use whichever one you want. But look how cool that is. That is lovely. And the design, I mean, I love, absolutely love your design. So this, this is, is a range, believe it or not, that was in the paper crafting world. Are okay. you ready for this? Eight years ago. <gasps> I mean, your archives are amazing, <laughs> aren't they? So... Uh, so Bella, what Bella's done is actually designed, um, she changed it specifically for Sewing Street. Okay. So some of these colour palettes uh, haven't been available in the paper world. So they're brand new for all you lovely sewers out there and crafters who are going to be sewers. Because I know there's loads of people, I've had yeah. messages who are watching that, have now, that we have converted, <gasps> haven't we? Yeah. Fantastic. That were following us with crafting and paper crafting. And now because... They love the tote bags, don't they? They've had so much fun. Yeah. So now, one of these. There you go. Uh, lots of messages coming through. A very important one. Welcome back, Ben. <laughs> Lovely to hear you're back. You've been missed. That's from Sue in Tower. Oh, that's Here nice. he is. There you go. Give everyone a wave to your fans. They've all missed you. He's back. He's back. So you can see here, look, they're all well spaced out. And you would literally just take a pair of scissors and yeah. snip around. You don't need to add any seam allowance. You can literally then construct it as it is which is brilliant because you don't need to um, work out any measurements no. or all the maths sort of been done no. for you. Yes. Yeah. We, we, and we've tested them, haven't we? Yeah, and it works really well because it's a very straightforward construction. It's basically sewing up four seams around the side um, and then you do the handle on the top, which is just a very simple, like a mini strap. Mm -hmm. um, and then it's just a case of sewing the top and the bottom in and filling it. I mean, it's really, really straightforward. We do have this in two colours, don't we? Yes. 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 We, well, actually, we have, we actually, this one that is in front, this one's coming up in That's the next show. Yes, but then we, we have in the, green. in the green. Love it. Thank you. Debbie's already found it. Um, yeah. So what I was going to say with this, ev nearly everybody that I know has a tablet. Yeah. Yeah. So if you're looking for that gift uh -huh. or getting somebody to introduce them to sewing, yeah. I think this is an amazing gift. So you've got the the kind of the lovely, what I would say, vintage uh, purple, wouldn't yeah. you? Yeah. This one here is the mint. Isn't it gorgeous? Okay. Absolutely gorgeous. They are beautiful. And this, as you say, is going to be such a great gift for somebody, isn't it? And then if you want to... Um, OK, I'm, I'm being a bit cheeky here, but if I wanted to recreate, you know, this in my own fabric then, I suppose I could you use could. this. Why not? Like, Everybody does it. 
as a template. You're not being cheeky. <laughs> in the crafting world, most people do that. They'll think, oh, I like that template. I'm going to use it for something else, you know. Uh, but what we're going to do is bring out more in these Brilliant. as well and different designs. Yeah, and because like you said, everyone's got a tablet, haven't they? So if you're thinking of a gift for somebody, this is a perfect design. And like you say, it can just sort of fall on its side. It doesn't sit upright. With the pellets, you can manoeuvre this so it's yes. comfortable and you can have it uh, whilst you're sewing. Definitely. Of you. Definitely. And that's the beauty about it. But because you've got all that on and we've got extra spare fabric. Brilliant. And then you can do something. You can make a little pencil case holder yeah. or something like that. With yeah, it. I was going to ask. I mean, look at me. Look at what you can do with it. Then use some of uh, Dave Green's little machine and then put them together with yes. the rivets. Absolutely, there we are. We're... Getting me converted. Today, it's just seamless, isn't it? Because Bella's been using, actually, the green machine. She's been using it in the green room just now. With Dave having a full masterclass because you bought a green machine, I didn't did, you, Bella? Yeah, I did, yeah, definitely. <laughs> and it's really cool. It's oh, really yeah. Good. Oh, it's going to be so, so Very useful. <laughs> £14.99 for your vintage vintage floral in the green. Um, should we do the the uh, recycled pellets as yes. well? So did you say that you use... So basically in this one here, so you've got, you can feel the weight. Do you I need... need to make a pellet bag to put them in or do you just put them I in straight haven't. away? Yeah, but you can. Uh, yeah. You can. I think with, if you're going to use a mixture of the pellets and the foam, then obviously I think putting the pellets into a little bag in the lining would be a good idea. Yeah. Um, but obviously if you were just using the pellets, if you were going to do a slightly smaller one for a, a phone or something but that size you can definitely use the pellets in a in a lining so yeah it, but it's I think that would be easier brilliant <laughs> now you get a whole kilogram bag there so yeah that's I wouldn't use all no, that though. no you'd no. be able to yeah. yeah you can feel if you want to feel the bottom of it oh yes yeah so the idea is the pellets are holding it in place and then you've got the you stuff want it in. squishy <laughs> Quite squishy, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but, but that's the whole idea behind it, okay? Um, it's like a stress ball, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's quite cool. Sorry, we, we're going to move on now. <laughs> we digress. Uh, right, shall we do... Is this, again, the same range, same collection? Same range. Uh, okay, look at this. How right. gorgeous is that? So this is like having a charm pack, basically. You've yes. got five-inch squares, 45-inch 40. squares. And there are 20 different designs, two of each. I actually really like that you haven't left spaces between these. Well, there is... I will own up. The reason we've done this is we knew to the sewing world. And anybody that makes quilts, I'm amazed. But we do quick quilting. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, you, we've got some um, Bella's where Bella is. She's done it on the pink behind. Yeah. So you can just go down. Yeah. Just and stitch we, on these lines, and it looks like you've pieced them all together. Yes, exactly. So we've given you that option. Um, and of course, you can cut it out yeah. if you want to yeah. and do whatever you want. Um, in our lives, we're just a little bit manic, aren't we? And trying to squeeze in the time to get everything sorted out. I mean, we love the flexibility of it. And coming up, you can even turn it into a dress. I mean, this is what I find amazing. Five inch squares. We talk a lot about, um, you know, charm packs and how how versatile five inch squares are i love the fact that these are fussy cut as well look if you were to buy fabric and cut them into five inch, inch squares it would be really difficult to to create exactly this that this is like a lovely border you've got your um, fussy cut flowers here the stripes the designs are absolutely so beautiful when we're designing the paper craft word we, we do layering okay so on here there's probably about four layers yeah. So that's why you've got the depth. Yeah. Okay. And that's why you've got, this is obviously vintage floral. So we wanted that kind of feel of old and aged. Yeah. But then you've got the brightness of the colour yeah. palette. And Bella's chosen these, although it's mint, it is a vivid green as well. Is this so a new colourway then? This is yeah. new. This is Love new it. for Sewing Street. So this is brand new for Sewing Street. Okay. And as you can see, you've got like a vintage feel throughout them. And look at the difference. This is this one that we've used. Here. Right. I see. So they all coordinate perfectly. This is the same print, but look at how clear it is, even in a smaller scale. Yeah, print. so we could actually do a quilt in this, and then you could have the tablet cushion. Yeah. And then there's more in the range to come. Brilliant. Love it. So if you do just want to do a cushion, a nine patch, for example, just cut them out, stitch between them. It looks like you've got a nine patch, you know, quilted yes. cushion. If you do want to do your patchwork with them, uh, then obviously cut them out as you would in, and use them as a charm pack. But as you said, think outside the box. There is the most 
Beautiful dress. We'll do the panels, the tote yes. bag panels soon. But somebody has created... Jenny. Jenny. Oh, I don't want to hit the camera. There we go. Jenny has created the most stunning Isn't that dress. gorgeous? I... And it's made out, it's overhaul. coming up, okay? It's coming up, uh, don't worry, we've got some more stock of this. This the is made out squares. of the 40 squares and the furries and the tote bag panel. Oh, my word. And then this, so uh, you can make a dress. <gasps> How cool. It looks like a designer dress, Oh, my well, gosh. It? Uh, well, it is. This and is the, is and then and then all you can do out of the panel is make, and we'll come to, when we get the panel up, because we've got it on today's show. Yeah. We can then show you that you've got, you know, variety. <gasps> Isn't that I mean, Jenny, gorgeous. if you're watching, this blow me away. What an amazing idea. This is exactly, you know, when you say, think outside the box, the reason you create these panels is to be um, creative. Yeah. I would never have thought of doing a dress out of a tote bag. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and 40 squares. Fantastic. So, but it looks like it was always meant to be like this. Beautiful. Because these lovely blossom sides are actually the lining of the bag. That is wild. I can't believe that. It looks uh, you know, so you've got the lining of the bag, and we will show you when we come to do the panel. Even the binding, it's all matching in. It's absolutely perfect. That, that is absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? And we're going to be doing those tote bag panels soon. But if you do want the 40 squares, that's what's used at the bodice at the top. Um, and they are just beautiful. Beautiful in the, in the spring fairies, obviously, there. But we've got them in the vintage roses at the minute. Um, so they are your 40 squares we've also got them in the pink. pink yeah so you know i love pink so i'm going to go for pink do you want it on the table or yes oh look at this 45 inch squares ready to go whether you're wanting to uh sub cut these down whether you're using them as part of a quilt i know lots of people are starting to yes. your collections to to make you know quilts as well and what we've done with this one, that we've actually brought in the vintage um, browns in this as well. So you can this this range. Yes, you've got the green and you've got the pinks, but also you've got the tones of the browns as well. Lovely. I mean, this is perfect for homewares, bag makers, dress dresses. Makers. <laughs> exactly. What crafts can you not use this for? This is going to be absolutely gorgeous. I'm thinking even English paper piecing. If you want to cut hexes out, you could probably get four hexes from each of these squares. Uh, Fourteen ninety nine, and then this is the one that Bella's used on the quilt. Oh, beautiful! So we've called it a lap quilt mm -hmm. or the middle of a satin of a quilt. But it's to show you how we've used the forty squares behind Bella at the top, and then we've got some feature squares that we've used coming up. Right, they're coming up as well. The four feature squares that you can see in the middle of that, but you can see how easy it is to just. Well, you haven't even pieced together those squares, Bella. <laughs> oh, I cheated. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 it's called quilt, quick, quick quilting, quilting. Well, technique. That's what we've just decided. It's, it's not very often that you get to say those two words together. A quick quilt doesn't yeah. really exist, but if you need so to do a quick that took a, um, that took her a, a day. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. Not even a day, From actually. From start to finish. From start to finish. And then we've used the cream, I think is on the show, on the back and around the edge. Yeah. yeah, so if you want to, uh, you know, if you, if you are making a gift for somebody, how great is that? Super quick. Uh, right, that's lovely in those beautiful vintage rose pinks. If you love that colourway, go for it. We've got the feature panels coming up. Uh, but they are your five-inch squares, 40 coordinating five-inch squares. For 14 99 can we just talk about the value for money, the amount of different prints you're getting? Yes, I mean, you're going to get 20 different designs twice. Brilliant. And on the, the cotton, it's yeah. just, I mean, you can see from the dress, the quality of the cotton and the print has come out so good. Well, this must have been your fear, you know, over the years. Oh, of, yes. Of Stuart saying, go on to fabric, go on to fabric. You probably think, well, I'm going to lose a lot of the quality yeah, and the fine detail. Yeah, I agree. And so, especially when we come to look at the faces, when we come to look at the spring, and yeah. even the birds, we've got birds yeah. coming up on the next show, you'll find that all the detail's still there. Yeah, and it's it amazing that can be transferred onto fabric. Yeah, absolutely. The quality of the, the cotton is lovely, and it's great to sew with, Bella, isn't it? It is, and it drapes really nicely that's really uh, one of the important things and also it, it hangs together well for a quilt but it also because it drapes nicely and hangs nicely for a dress it's lovely gorgeous absolutely gorgeous very very busy by the way go back through underneath us on the website and see what is available in the other colorways uh, ben are we going to go for one of the feature panels now which number 
QV61. Oh, that's right, the one. Right, now this one. is in the purple. That's the purple. Oh, see, I even thought when you were looking at the, the quilt there that you'd chosen <laughs> matching colours to do your borders. <laughs> no. It's done for you. This is brilliant <laughs> quick quilting. So, yeah, so you've got four different panels on here. So what you've done then, Bella, is added your uh, rows of, of, eight, of ten, of ten either side. Yes. Fabulous. Yes, literally. So... <clears throat> the only bits that are actually attached in terms of sewing seams together is these bits here and, and across but, there. So and obviously the there's, the 40 squ there's the four squares in the middle. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. And they have absolutely matched in the perfect solids as well. Yes. Well, that's the beauty about it. As we're designing and constructing the panels, what mm -hmm. we want to do, we actually pick the colour tones yeah. to work with everything. So when, because we've got other, we, you know, we've got a new variety pack coming up and yet that works with it as well. So everything has been designed so you can do a huge quilt, a dress. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think cardigan. I don't know what you can yeah. you know, for dressmaking as well as doing homeware as well. Brilliant. This is going to be the great panel on a, a bag. The finished size looks to me about a 12, 12 inch square if I'm not mistaken but you can uh, this would be perfect as a block on a quilt that you can build around if you want all cushions four cushions there for 9.99 I know good price really good price just £9.99 exclusively for Sewing Street as well am I right yes yes <gasps> Brilliant. You're getting these panels today, brand new in, under £10. I love even the butterfly. I've got a, I've got a, a feeling lots of people are going to hand embroider on top of these. Yeah, it's lovely. And all the detail, and even the inside of the flowers as well. Yeah, so these ones amazing. have a very vintage feel throughout. Yes, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. That's in the uh, purple and green. We also have the pink, which is the one, I believe, that's on the wall. Yes, so yet again, same, same designs. Well, actually, the designs are a little oh, bit different, but what we've done, four different. So you've got the same colour palette with the greens and the pinks. It's like a vintage pink. Mm -hmm. And you can see that we've layered up other collections or other layers behind it, so it will work with your 40 squares. Yeah, I mean, even your background, it's not a solid background. It's got lovely writing. It's got really lovely text. Uh, like you say, very vintage yes. feel to it. These would be really nice as big block keepers. You know, if you make a, a block keeper for all of your quilts, that would be a great sort of front cover, front cover or, you know, fabric sort of scrapbook. Yeah, book. no, definitely. We've really got nice. actually, Jenny's done a keeper of, with well, the fairies coming yeah. up. Yeah, yeah. Um, but if I get, oh. oops. <laughs> <laughs> Dropping everything, never mind. So yes, she's like done this. this with the fairy oh, panels fantastic. coming up. But you could do it with this collection as well yeah great idea oh uh, possibilities are endless so many people checking out on all colorways that's in your green and pink the same one that was on the wall behind bella this is the one that was used along with your 40 squares just nine pound 99 so i'm excited Which, I mean, if, you, if you actually work it out so when we ever do quilt kit we absolutely go wild if you've got a quilt kit under fifty pounds. Yeah. If you've got this panel and then your other panel is what fifteen pounds. And then we've got the new variety pack, which I'm dying to show you. <gasps> that okay, you'll be able to make a quilt with those. Which is crazy, isn't it? I mean, so far we're at twenty five pounds, and you've got this. You've got your coordinating fabrics here already, so you're just literally stitching your, um, you, you know, your forty squares around it, however you want. Um, yeah. If you use your variety pack. Which one That's are we going it. with first? Oh, do you want to do the variety pack? They are brand new in today. Which one are we going to do? The pink? Right, so, the purple and green. So you'll find... Oh, Debbie, these are amazing. Oh, two and a half inch strips and your five inch squares and your feature panels. <gasps> so, yeah, so with, by having the feature, yeah. the 40 squares and this... Oh, You'll yeah. be able to do so much with it. Oh, my word. This is really versatile. I am loving, look, with the buttons. <gasps> well, we did have to put the detail in. We do like using variety one, and that's why it's called the variety pack. Uh, so variety square range that we've done. And as you can see, we have done it so you can just cut it out, use it however you want. You have got smaller of the designs, okay, some more colours to go with it. But then if you lay all three of those panels together yeah they just work so well right this one's just 17 pound 99 
And to be able to get a whole variety, we have never done anything like this before, Debbie. What? Never. We've never had a panel that has got the mixture of squares with any design. Well, we do like to start with. We, we do. like. To, we do you don't like to stand it. out, yeah. yeah. We I mean, designed it so that it's versatile. And, and the whole thing is a new, completely new panel. I mean, normally we would have to say, right, you have to have your design role, but maybe you don't use always the full width. I mean, you have got here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You've got eight of those beautiful um, strips which we, you could use. See, these, we've sorts. deliberately done these because John was saying he likes the detail that we've now put on the back of cushions. So yeah. you could actually use those. So we're now thinking as a, well, not as a sewer yet. We're really <laughs> at those early days, but we're thinking what we would like to see. Mm -hmm. So the beauty of what, because we get to design it, mm -hmm. And, you know, Belle and I were like, well, we want this in there. We want these strips in there. We want coordinated colours and we want longer pieces of fabric that you can put round a quilt. Yes. So you've got those options. You could buy two of those mm -hmm. and then you will have all the areas that you would need. <gasps> this is so good. I I'm actually just thinking of loads of ideas that and you will be thinking probably the same at home as well, because then you've also got your. Uh, we've never, ever had any designer that's done this before where you've got your four feature squares well actually you've got six six yeah. feature squares here and then you've got your charm pack sort of five inch squares along with your strips as well that is a massive panel under 20 pounds absolutely huge um yeah we knew this would be really really but popular. i mean if you had i don't know if you can have oh if you had next to the 40 squares mm -hmm. and the features mm -hmm. that would be a good kit yeah, oh, absolutely. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So you could then have everything that matches because the squares are different sizes as well. Have you got um, a tape measure, Kat? And I'm just going to have a measure so I can tell you the size of these feature squares because anybody who is thinking, this is a brilliant quilt kit. Oh, it absolutely is. And they all coordinate in together. So with your border, you're looking at 10 inch, 10 inch squares. Oh, actually, just over that. 10 and a half inch squares. Yeah. Um, these ones, yes, are your five inch squares with the seam allowance, five inch squares. And then you've also got your strips, yep. which are which are two and a half inches wide. Absolutely perfect. So we tried to design it with that in mind, didn't we? You did it, Debbie. You did it. <laughs> Brilliant. <gasps> Isn't it? The fact that you have got, you're dipping your toe in. Normally, you see, Debbie, we would sell design rolls and you could pay up to, I mean, obviously for... A full set of design rolls, it can be fifty pounds. So if you're buying a design roll from a designer and a charm pack at fifteen yeah. ninety nine, well, you know, Bella, that yeah. it ends up most of our quilt kits are over, especially ones that aren't with solid fabrics. Yeah, are over hundred pounds. So what? This is the thing. So I don't know if we could just get that forty square yes. panel. Um, Kat, could you just pass me the one that you're folding up here now? Thank you. And then if you put that next to this. This so is QCUU12, by the way, if you want to add that in as well. So that will go with it. And then if I just get this one. So if you get the three panels and then you've got the squares, which is you then have the whole kit. Oh, you've got the whole collection of fabric that it's all going to be coordinating. And obviously we launched earlier on the Vintage Rose um, tablet stand as well. Have it all coordinated. Yes. What a fabulous and this, set. And this is, as I said, brand new today. Yep. And this is something that we wanted you, everybody to create. Because as we were designing, the uh, quilt, mm -hmm. quick quilt, mm -hmm. as I like to call it, we're thinking, OK, we need to have squares here, we need to have stripes here. And we've taken on board what John and Stuart mm -hmm. and yourself mm -hmm. has told us, because we are on this sewing journey. Mm -hmm. And so we thought, OK, we need to have this round here and this round here. And that's how we've designed mm -hmm. it. And as a designer and an early sewer, I'm stressing that to everybody, we want to be able to flex. In uh, Debbie Moore Designs, our motto is bringing inspiration to you yeah. with, through affordability and good product yeah. and design. And that's what we want to do with Sewing Street as yeah, well. Yeah, and I like the fact that you are catering to everybody. You're not saying, right, this has got to be this uh, very complex quilt yeah. and here are your pieces and it's going to cost you £300 for the kit. Whereas actually you're reaching out to everyone and saying, have a go, yeah. have yes. a play. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't matter, it's only sewing. But you've got beautiful designs that are going to look amazing at, at the end because you've done all the hard work for us. Right, we have got your yes. variety pack in pink. 
Yes, so yet again, it's the same principle, everybody. You have got your smaller squares at the top, then you've got the six ones in the middle. Mm. I mean, look at the fabric that you're oh, actually going lovely. to get. And the detail in all of it. Well, you've thought, uh, obviously, when you're designing these in the paper craft world, it's similar to the sewing world. You want different scales of print. Well, remember, this is all brand new. So this is not even in the paper world. <gasps> so this, we've, the design is, the, the, the mm. actual flowers, but what we've done is brought it into this new panel and then thought, right, okay, we want a butterfly there. We want to yeah. add that there. We want to add those colours. Right. These tones are not in the paper world. <gasps> Oh, how amazing. This is so, so we just thought we wanted vintage. We love the cut. I love pink. I'm always going to love pink. Uh, it's a lovely tone of pink, though, isn't it? It's not a pink, pink, pink. It's like a vintage rose. That's why we're going down. Yeah. And then all the other designs from it are from the collection, and we've toned it in to fit with the main range. So you have got here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten of your 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 squares, so you still can do uh, you know borders around your feature squares, where you're getting six of those big feature squares, and then you're also getting your two and a half inch strips as well, all for under twenty pounds. I find that absolutely fabulous. <laughs> I love 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 this one. The detail, you don't need to worry about fussy cutting or trying to get. It's just all suited. Yes. Designed perfectly for the panel. But yes, yet again, okay. everything works together. So if you're going to go with the 40 squares or even your feature panels, you can actually create. This is what Bella used on the back of, actually, you didn't use this one on this one, did you? No. no. But you could have. She could have made it bigger. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely. I mean, the cushions um, that we've done and the, the quilt, whether you're doing the dress, whether you're doing whatever, this is going to be perfect for that. Definitely. Absolutely. Right. What's they are next? your variety pack in pink. Oh. So, another brand new design and panel that you've yes. created. Talk to me about the toiletry So, we were thinking design. what we would like. <laughs> As, uh, what we would like. Oh, well, that's, that's the great thing. And so, then we thought, yeah. I, I, would like, I said, I would like a toiletry bag. And then I said, oh, I would like to have oh, a, uh, a water bottle. <gasps> So then that's what we designed. Well, I suppose now you're to and from with the chateau, and <laughs> then this is perfect for you, isn't it? So this is a brand new panel. Bella's designed this. And as you can see, you got right down from instructions to diagrams, how to put it together. And we've done it in it's two a different massive tones. Panel. So you have got, uh, if I just get you to get this one here. I actually think that is probably the biggest panel we've ever had. You've got all your instructions included, all your fabric there. For the water bottle, yep. the toiletry bag, yes. and a cosmetic bag. So you've got three yes. projects on there. Three projects. And I think there's some spare fabric as well, yep. isn't there? And spare fabric. So, yeah. So this has got... This is the water bottle. Love How it. Cool is that? Yes, that is beautiful. Yes. Water bottle in. Okay. And Bella will be able to go through what she's actually done. And then we have got... And we've used... Uh, Dave's green, yes. lovely little rivets coming up. So then you can have, look at that. I mean, you could turn it into, I, you know, I was saying to Bella, I'm going to turn it into a my crafting bag or a sewing yeah. bag, as well yeah. as a cosmetic one. So you've got the option on there. Lovely. And you can have this if you want. I know that you're excited with your green machine to have it almost that it sort of concertinas out as well. Yes. You could do it like that. Yeah. Well, I'll show you how to do that when I've She's got going to, to demonstrate that. Yes. And then we've got it in the lighter version. So we've, we've got... We've through these because we want to show you as much as we possibly can so we can jump into the demo as well. Uh, this is the vintage floral. Yes. It's Same three like... projects. Same three projects, but you've got a lighter tone with it, OK? So that we've got more white in the colour palette. So you've got... I mean, you're going to have so much fun with these. Oh, so you've got everything that you need for the hot water bottle and the lining. And, yeah, and the, with a pouch, putting it in and everything like that full instruction step by step brilliant message has come through good morning wow great designs debbie can't stop shopping <laughs> uh, got three new panels in purple and the pink one can make so much variety with them thank you that is from jacqueline in cumbria oh thank you jacqueline it is absolutely brilliant i don't think again i've ever seen i know we've done panels and we give you ideas that you could make toiletry sets but to be able to say right for anyone who's new to sewing yes that's you don't the thing. need to try and work out the maths of the pieces, cut them out, sew them together. So that's the plan. So we're designing panels that you just cut out and you do three projects. Or you can do um, 
for those people that are a bit more experienced, you've got obviously the variety packs and the feature panels so you can do quilts or even dresses like Jenny did. Yeah. But this, for me, is a great starting point. Yeah. Because you just cut it out and follow the instructions. The designs are beautiful as well. Now, I, I believe this is what you're going to be yes. showing yes. us how to do as well, Bella. Over to you. What would you like to show us, please? Um, well, I wanted to show you um, how to do the... Um, this is the bath bag. So, well, it's, it's either a bath bag or a large toiletry bag whatever you choose to do but it is really really straightforward there's nothing complicated about it and um, really it's just uh, two large rectangular panels but because you've cut it out of a panel and because um, you're not having to measure and cut yourself um, you're not having to measure it mm -hmm. yourself that makes it much easier in terms of if you were new to sewing like we are, we design for ourselves. So all I've done is I've actually just cut out the large main panels and then put them right sides facing and pin them together. And then all I'm going to do is, is sew around the outside edge. I've got my turning gap, which I've marked with double pins so I don't forget it. Yeah. Um, otherwise I'm prone to do that. And so all I'm going to do is sew around the edge. So. Um, I'm and this is for the toiletry bag. Yes. This is the so there's a large toiletry bag and a and a smaller cosmetic bag, and the idea is that they concertina up, and you can either sew across the bottom and hold it together so that your bag opens like this, um, and or you could actually put poppers in between the two so that yeah. the actual bag yeah. expands yeah. to fit whatever it is you want Great to put idea. in there. But it's a very straightforward concept. So are you happy for me to yeah, start absolutely. saying? Yeah. <laughs> so um, I'm, as Debbie said, I'm still very new to sewing. And the stitch I'm using is, um, I thought it was quite a, lar a large stitch, but it's um, three and a half on this machine, but obviously different machines and things. So, um, and I just go back over the edge and then it's just a quarter of an inch seam allowance and I'm all I'm going to do is sew around the edge and when we um, design these panels we're designing for our skill level so we really are they really really are beginner friendly yes. um, I, I must say I think that is the, the the most difficult thing when you are and the most daunting thing when you're starting out sewing is the measurements or transferring templates to be able to literally just cut this out and still have all of those flowers exactly where you want them to be like on the water bottle mm -hmm. they're perfectly framing yeah yes. aren't they? they're positioned i mean the thing is out. from uh, from our point of view as we are beginners in the sewing world it is very daunting mm. you know, where do you go you know we're learning new terminology all yeah. the time yes but we wanted everybody to be able to create this okay yeah. so you know we can create this at our level but obviously as more experienced they oh, might yeah. put detail around the flowers they yeah, may you know do it. different mm -hmm. things you can do different options with it and this is what you get with the panels is there a certain wadding or interfacing that you would recommend when you're doing a hot water bottle um it just needs to be um a good quality yeah. wadding yeah um there's um you don't have it needs to be thick enough that yeah. it's going to protect you from the hot water bottle yeah. and anyway with a hot water bottle you shouldn't put um, hot water straight in there um, you should it shouldn't be boiling no it should be hot it should yeah. be boiling so um, but the wooding it just needs to be um, a good quality wooding um, and in terms of inter you could actually put interfacing in these you could put like a very a soft or a medium interfacing yeah. in these to give it a bit more stiffener yeah. if you wanted to um, but I've left it plain because um, just because I thought it, it would work quite well. But you could put interfacing in the top part or the back part yeah. or the whole thing. I mean, you can, it's, it's up to your skill level yeah. as to how confident you feel in doing it. But as I say, we do for, um, for what we are, the level that we are at, because that's, um, that's easiest for us and we understand then what we're doing. Yeah, it's great. You don't have to be, you know, having a huge stash of different interfaces. No. If you do, and for the cosmetics bags, like you say, you want to add your fusible fleece, H640 would be that nice. Yeah. Or, but 
it looks great and you haven't used any interfacing. So no, on, so on you've the got the backs. different choices. You know, when we did, we did the uh, oven gloves, mm -hmm. I think a couple of months ago on the Art Deco. We used the, the heat ones. Yeah, thermal. So you, yeah, so you could, I mean, you put some of that if yeah. you wanted to in the hot water bottle. Yeah. But for me, I like a hot water bottle. <laughs> the hot water bottle, so by the time you've got the water in there, you'll be totally fine yeah. with that. But it's personal preference, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, but I mean to be able to create three three projects yes. for under twenty pounds. Yeah, with your fabrics, with your instructions, you're not just left on your own devices as well. You have instructions and images. Yes, uh, a diagram there as well of showing construction for nineteen ninety nine. That is brilliant. So this comes in two different colorways. So you've got this one and the deep one. Yeah, they're both lovely. Do you have a personal favourite? Um, I, I I'm liking the light blue. Right. Okay, only because um. At the moment, at the Chateau, everything is light blue, yeah. French blue. So I just think it's fresh. Yes. But then that looks very designery, doesn't it? It does. So you've got those with those pops of colour. And I love the pinks as well. Uh, Ollie is saying, I just love this artwork. This outline is So brilliant. this is brand new. Bella has actually done this, OK? Oh. So she, this design is totally brand new. So this is not available anywhere. Wow. And she's taken... Um, so I'll tell you the story behind this. A few years ago, um, unfortunately, when my mum passed, um, I grew some roses mm -hmm. from her wedding, um, not wedding bouquet, funeral bouquet, yeah. and re developed a range called Roses and Bloom. Oh. So Bella has drawn the rose. That's it there. Oh, that is amazing. Okay, so because I, I did a whole big range called Roses and Bloom in memory of my mother, and the roses are so beautiful. So we've drawn it from a real rose wow. from her a funeral bouquet. But this is the thing, because we are designers yeah. and we're crafters and now sewers, yeah. we look at it in a different spin-off thinking, yeah. well, why don't we do this or why don't we do that? So we yeah. think everything is possible oh, yeah. and we just need to learn how to make a dress. <laughs> Well, you don't. You don't need to because you're. If you keep producing panels like this and the artwork for us, yeah, leave that to you know. All our sewers out there are thinking, yeah, I can do this and I can do that. But we like to know. So the thing that we've found over the because we've now been doing it since what last July I think was our first show. Yeah. Uh, and then we did it every few months, but now we're coming on monthly. Um, we like to test everything. Yeah. And know what we're doing. Yeah. Because we yeah, have changed. Sense. Yeah. So even though I don't think I'll make dresses all the time, I'd love I'd to learn how. how. It is. So then I can understand when we're designing the panels, actually, if that was a bit bigger, yeah. then that could actually be used for that. And yeah. I think as, because we're constantly, you know, my husband despairs with me, you know, I'll go, he'll take me out to a restaurant and I'll go, oh, take a picture of that lamp. He's like, why? I'm like, I love the shape. I can do something with that. And he's like, oh, okay. So, uh -huh. you know, everywhere, picture, picture, picture. Oh picture. yeah, that's, as quilters, you see everything in quilt blocks, everything in yes. patterns, floors. I bet in your chateau, the tiles yes. and everything, you'll just well, see uh, patterns the everywhere. The actual floor on the entrance, I've already said we're going to make it into a quilt block. Yes. Because it looks and it's blues and it's just amazing so that will be you're already in. thinking that yes yeah. but it will take some time to design we're going to do that later on this year but the thing about what we bring every time is yes we've got new designs that have never been seen even in the paper crafting world but then we've got other designs that we mix in with it because yeah. we have that choice absolutely uh, and we're having so much archives. fun we're yeah. having so much fun with it and you know Bella's spending more time on it uh, so she's heading up the actual side of the sewing yeah. uh, and but we're both designing crazy we're working on new ones already well I love the fact that like you say there's a lot of people who are finding sewing street from your you know crafting and paper craft background and yes. they're coming in and, and discovering the sewing world and then vice versa lots of people who have you know watched us and, and I've never seen any yeah. of the designs before, so it's very exciting to be able to show them all off. How are you getting on, Bella? Right, so I have clipped the corners on my um, on my stitching, and I've obviously made sure that um, when I've turned it through my turning gap, and I'm just sorting out the corners, um, and then I've left the turning gap because actually when I sew the side pieces together, the turning gap is going to get sewn. Oh, okay. um, I think normally I would tack it, um, but for speed, I'm just sort of pressing it in and I might put a pin in it, um, just but that will hold get it together. But it will get, yeah. yeah. So um, the idea is then we can start measuring and um, folding it together. But it is very, very straightforward. It is like a concertina. 
And so this side is the outside and this side is your flap at the top. But when I um, did the measurements, I took the measurements from the flat end. So um, it's, the diagram is really um, straightforward because it just tells you how much you need to measure from the end. So on my diagram, um, I'm going to measure 16 centimetres in. So I will mark it with a pin. So 16 centimetres. But one of the things I was going to say about doing the panels is quite often, I think, um, people feel like they want to do something creative and they want to do a sewing project but you don't know what to do, particularly if, um, particularly if it's, um, you haven't got a lot of time. You want to get something done quite quickly. So I'm just going to pin this on 16. So that will be my first fold. And then I'm going to move it to 32 centimetres, which is the next fold. And... Normally, I would press this in between, but I'm just going to put it together to show you how the um, actual concertina piece works. Julie says, so. hi, Vicky and Debbie. These are all beautiful designs, decisions, decisions on what to buy from Julie. <laughs> this is the great thing is that normally you think, oh, well, I'll, 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 maybe I can't afford that today. Maybe I can't afford the, the quilt kit. But now you can really, the prices of really good well really we want good. to give you as i keep going on about good quality affordability yeah. and also creativity yeah uh, and by bringing these variety of panels different designs that we've got Very so if you're not everything. into vintage okay we've got spring coming up okay mm -hmm. if you're not into fairies we've got birds you know yeah. bella's so brought flowers them. there's loads of things oh we have got the spring flowers by the way we will be bringing those back very soon in a couple of minutes so uh, as we got on there, so Bella's so just done that bit. I'm going to fold and line up the pins on the side there. And then I'm going to concertina it up and Look line up the oh, pins I mean, there. Oh, it's so simple, isn't it? What it is idea? really, really simple. I mean, it, obviously I would press this um, before I then sewed, but I would put, as I've done on this piece here, I've done a top stitch around the flap. So that tidies that edge that. up and then you stitch it down these um, side pieces and stitch them together and that's what I mean when I say that your turning gap will be stitched closed okay so by stitching these two together you've made your front pocket is this where you could then use your um, snapper your press yes. studs or your you know yes rivets if you want so to. you could put a popper in here and yeah. here and so what that you're what actually poppering it together what Bella will do we will put try and put one in before yeah. the next hour. Oh, yeah. great. So we can well, I'll see. finish this off before the next hour so oh, that you fab. can see it all, all done perfectly. Love so. it. That's going to look amazing. Thank you so, yeah. so much. Any questions that you have, by the way, get them in, get them in, get yes. them in, because I know that we're showing you all sorts, but if there's something that you want us to recap, then let us know. They are the two kits that we have for, remember, three projects under £20. The water bottle, the cosmetics, uh, and the toiletry bag, all for under 20 They're your two colourways. Spring fairies, oh right. my word. It went absolutely wild when you were here last yes. time. Yes, uh, just need to find. Here we go. We got this it. One. Okay, this one, everybody. I love this one. So I was with you when we launched Winter Fairies. Absolute sellout show. It was brilliant. It, I think what it is, it's your designs with the, the faces. Everything is just so the detail. clear. So the thing that we were really worried about was the shading on the faces transferring to fabric. Okay. But then when we did Art Deco a couple of months ago, I can't even remember, it's all blurry. They came out amazing. And obviously the Winter Fairies also did that, but the Winter Fairies colour tones are different to the Spring Fairies. And so yet again, we're like, is this going to work? Mm -hmm. And when it comes out, oh my goodness, it is amazing. Right, so what, the, what is this going to make? So this will make, we'll put this on the counter. Yes, so I want to show the you the detail. detail. Yeah. Okay. So this is for the tote bag. So this will make this tote bag. But what oh, we've done, not only have we done a tote bag, we've done a reversible tote bag. And we've done it so you can make three out of one. Okay. So this is if you want to make a very expensive designer one. So yeah. there is two different fairies on both sides. But then if you look at the inside. Oh, you've even got lovely It's a reversible, <gasps> reversible bag. So then you've got... 
oh. with a pocket. Look that at that. That is brilliant. So then you've got the lovely blossom and you've got the pocket. Look, even... The... That is... Oh, my gosh. So that that's why I'm trying to say you could create one bag like this. Then you can create, because we've got some um, squares coming up, mm -hmm. you could use that for the inside. Mm -hmm. And then the outside, you've got two more different images. Mm-hmm. And oh, you can, you can yeah. create three bags. Do you bags. know what I was going to say? I would be just using, you know, plain fabrics from my stash and having three bags and yes. just using, you know, my, my scraps from my light for my lining. Because the straps are beautiful. They're all included. You've got enough, you know, to be able to do your bag. They are absolutely gorgeous. And if you have a look at the detail, it's just come off. You wouldn't believe that was fabric. Even like her makeup. <laughs> yes. Oh, her, her rings. They've all come up. We've even the twinkles. She's got a French her manicure. Of course she has. And oh. then if I turn this <laughs> round, okay, we've given you extra. So you've so got, you got extra. So these straps, are the pockets. Right. So these could be blocks on quilts if you want. Or is this the one that was then transferred? Yes, no, we've into... got it in pink coming up. But it, this that's is what's... the panel. If you want it in that's... yellow, you this could do the dress. This is what Jenny's done, <gasps> the dress. I need to show you this again, if you don't mind. Well, put the pink one up. We'll get the pink one. You can do it in yellow or pink, because this is the panels that the that your lady, remind me of her name. Her Jenny. Jenny has decided, right, do you know what? I can do this into a spring dress for a young girl. It's absolutely beautiful right so this so is what she's panel. done is she's used the feature panel and then she's used the squares at the top she's got the extra yes. fabric for the binding it's just beautiful so this is the tote bag oh. in pink and purple isn't that gorgeous oh it is so amazing so what Go jenny for it. has done <laughs> Way they're too massive, big. aren't they? They're too big for one person to hold. Debbie. So what Jenny's done is use these, actually, for the front and back of the dress. The side dresses, she's used that, OK? Yeah. And nice. then she hasn't used any of that. <gasps> or so you can create a tote bag out of it, or three tote bags. I mean, gosh, this is amazing. You have got instructions for your tote bag, for the designer reversible tote bag, by the way. That's your instructions. But if you do want to just use it with your own lining, you can. Then you've also got the pocket fabric. And that's the pocket lining, by the way. Yes. How <laughs> yeah. oh, amazing. And then this is spare coordinating spare fabric. Spare coordinating with fabric. With ladybirds and bees. It's absolutely beautiful. This is the one that I'd be absolutely going wild for, by the way. I love these. They launched... Literally a month ago. Seven. Um, literally launched a month ago and all completely sold out. So we fast tracked these so back in. So these, this is the bag in front of Bella. Oh, we're upside down. And Bella designed this backpack so you can do quilt it, didn't you, Bella? Yes, I did. So if you want, can you reach that bag? Yeah or yep. not? So the bag that Bella's got, okay, um, that's it there. Oh, it creates, no. So this is the bag we we thought we wanted a a, a larger bag. bag. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And if you take to the inside, yes. these have got very faint lines. So it looks like we're Let me very perfect. That we um, oh, very yes, perfect quilt. Yeah. Yes, but it isn't. It's because we're giving you those guidelines. Brilliant. So you can quilt it if you want to. Oh, beautiful. And it is so faint, but you can see it when you get it home to use those to quilt onto. And that looks so plush, doesn't and it? And the other way is these bits are the base. So we want, because we knew we'd keep putting it down. Uh -huh. But then we've also made it reversible. Nice boxy bottom. Yeah. And it's reversible as well. Yes. I mean, you can turn it totally inside out. And it still looks beautiful because you've still got the you've got the, the pocket. I mean, yeah. it's really beautiful. The pocket just does that, so you can absolutely have it both oh, yeah. ways round. There you go. There's your pocket and your pocket lining, yeah. and then you've got the beautiful artwork again of your spring fairies for the front and the back. So that's another option. We keep going, by the way. This is the show that just keeps on giving. There is so much choice. Uh, this is the say. Oh no. This time your full feature in your so, spring fairies. Yes, so these oh, are, I, I mean, the so gorgeous. beautiful. So what we have on here is we have gorgeous designs that you can see on here that you've got four different colour tones. So you've got the pinks as well as the blues and also got tones of greens. Look at the detail on these. It's not lost at all when you've transferred from, you know, your, your world of paper crafts into fabrics. It's perfect. So you've got... Four 
beautiful spring fairies. I mean, look at the definition in her eyes and like you say, her jewellery, the lace of the dress, the wings, everything is just perfect. This is the second one. They're all four different designs, four different fairies. Well, I'll say four different fairies. Two are the same images, as you can see, but different colours. Yes. So you've got the blues and the pinks there, slightly different So tones. when I was designing this, I was literally building a garden. <sighs> I was putting, I wanted, I was saying I want a daisy there, I want it in blue, I want it in pink. So I was literally building the garden and then putting the fairy in. Oh my gosh, she's absolutely And beautiful. then when I actually designed this, I colour toned the outside to match the dresses. Absolutely perfect, isn't it? If you want to do, you know, the uh, vintage rose design quilt, I mean, you can absolutely do it with the spring fairies range because you've got your features and you've also yes, got the squares. Yes, got, yes. Brilliant. These are all back in. Uh, if you missed the show last month, then you might have missed these. But we did spend a whole show going through them. So we're just recapping them for anybody who missed out. What's next? Yeah, this is the other feature panel in the purples. Isn't that lovely? Oh, with the rose. That is gorgeous. So these are the purples and pinks that we've done on here. So yet again, you've got those gorgeous size, 35 by 35. Uh, panel with the four different colourways. Oh, oh, sorry, not four, four, well, different, four squares. different squares. Yes. All beautiful feature panels for quilts, for fronts of bags. They are only nine ninety nine. I mean, that's four cushion fronts, isn't it? But also coming up, we have got the squares. I think have we? Yeah, we do have the forty squares. So if you want to then uh, incorporate them onto uh, the. The, the, the top of the, the and the bottom of the quilt, then this would be perfect. So look at this. Here you go. Oh, in the yellows. Isn't this so useful to be able to have a combination and mix? You're not having to root through your stash thinking, right, what colours are going to coordinate with my feature squares? No, exactly. And you'll find, you know, if you're going for the joke bag like Jenny's done, yeah. You can make it this in the yellow version. The, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Do so the, imagine someone getting married and having all your flower girls. Like that. In little fairy dresses like this. That would be lovely. <gasps> My daughter is obsessed with fairies. She's so, got yeah. beautiful big fairy wings that she wears that are musical and they open Aww. close. This would be, we all know a little girl in our life that would love a dress like this. <gasps> I am thinking, oh my gosh, imagine fairy part, birthday, special birthday or um, a wedding. They, they're real special dresses, aren't they? But super affordable to make. $14.99, you're not going to use many of these squares. You could then make all sorts of accessories, little handbag for oh them my to goodness. go with. Yes, you can do all kinds of things or you can mix and match with the cushion that's coming up. Now, I think we do have this cushion. Um, no, we haven't. Oh, yeah, it is. It's here. Oh, now, this is a cushion panel because you've got your front and then you've got enough to be able to choose yes. which envelope back you want. So enough that it's going to overlap on your cushion flap perfectly. But uh, what I've and done... as John said, love the detail. No. Yeah. yeah. So we ran out of cushions. It's really nice. <laughs> when we were putting all the cushions on, we ran out of cushions. We even took the ones in the green room. Uh, so <laughs> this is what we've made it up with and look oh that looks amazing but you could choose if you prefer if you want to use the daisy one yeah of course you well. can and use it for something else yeah uh, we give you choice yeah you've got two different choices to use for the envelope back and then you've got the main sort of focal one which is going to look beautiful and then that's the front of our cushion spring fairies in green and then what's next 99 and then Spring Fairies Oh, the yellow. yellow behind Bella. I love this one. Look at that. Oh, yes. Yeah, she's so pretty. Very beautiful. spring. We'd be lovely in a conservatory, wouldn't it? Yes. So you've got, again, already, it looks like you've even bound the edge of it. You've got this bound edge, but you don't. Look. Apparently, we have to learn how to do, what did John? Mitered. Yes, um, piping. piping. Piping, yeah. Which sounds complicated, well, everybody. No, because all you all you would need to do is to stitch that down there as well, and then it would look like you've got a piping, not piping. You do realise it's gone over my head like you that. You could do it. This, I like the faux piping. Or anybody who's got, if anybody's got any piping cord, you could use that for your piping, couldn't you? Right, we will make sure we put that on the list for next time. Yep, yeah, because okay. they would look amazing. <laughs> with but, I mean, they're gorgeous, aren't they? They're absolutely beautiful. So Love that them. is the yellow and green very spring and this was ombre yes so love that so that was a paper that we made into a fabric that looks so nice it's worked now so then well. of course i had to go with pinks and purples 
Sorry, we're just flying through these, but they're all underneath us. Even if the graphics go out, don't worry, you'll be able to find them underneath us. Oh, look. This is then in the pink. Oh, look, it's lovely. It's so beautiful. And again, the back, you've done this time with the daisies. Yes. Yeah, so so that means that you've then got your I've ombre my, fabric. And I've learned about folding it over twice. Oh, look yeah, at me. And that's them. why I, the first lot of designs, this was lower. Yeah. And then I realised I needed to have the extra fabric. Okay. So then we put it higher up. Yeah. This is it, like you say, it's, it isn't about being, you know, the most experienced sewer. You're not trying to be in competition with them, but understanding what a lot of people That's are That's exactly it, is understanding. So although we are on this journey and we're very, very excited, we want to try everything. So yeah. as then it helps us with our design yeah. better. So that means we bring better designs yeah. for everybody to enjoy. I mean, this is lovely. And then you've got that ombre one. Yes. For your stash. It's all going to coordinate beautifully. Finally, we've got again purple. the cushion in purple. All so, the spring fairies, I mean, very popular, by the way. Just be aware that lots of these are now extremely limited. Look at this. That's what it's going to look like when it's finished. And it's yeah. so easy, actually, isn't it? I actually, Have you done it? I've, yes, this was the first thing I did, yeah. is make an envelope uh, cushion. And do you know what? My husband didn't believe I made it. <laughs> didn't he? No. And it took me 20 minutes. That was the exciting thing. Yeah. The panel is amazing. So if you are watching and you have never actually done sewing before, go for a cushion. Yeah. Because to me, that's the so easiest. So satisfying to it finish is. it. Like, oh, yes. I've done it. Yeah. My husband, it was, I had to be eyewitness. Yeah. I have to she did there. No, he didn't believe me. This was last year <laughs> when I very first started because he's like, oh, yeah, Deborah, you're going to do some sewing. You can, when in your life are you going to have time? And when I did it, I was like, oh, my goodness, I can do every room in the chateau. Oh, yeah. You were going to have piped <laughs> cushions. We're going to, yeah, everything's going to be. I need, now I need to learn how to do in. curtains. So, anyway, so this is the purple option. And I think that's the last of the fairies that we've got. Yeah, it is. Well, I forgot to show you this was what. Jenny did. Oh, great idea. Storage tubs. I love this, Jenny, if you're watching. I just, it's amazing. So she's even quilted it. So it's got the 40 squares. And then you've got the actual feature panels. Brilliant. Great okay. Idea. And she's used the 40 squares. And it's one of those. It's got some bosal inside to keep it um, structured. These are and great then storage this, tubs, aren't they? In the inside, do you remember? Oh, there you go. Can you see that? That's leftover fabric. The actual, she's put them together mm -hmm. from the, um, what was it? Straps. From the straps. Oh, fantastic. So she made the dress, had that left, and then she put the feature panels, 40 squares, and, pa and that's the dress, uh, yeah. the straps. Love it. Great idea. I'm, honestly, you're going to have so much fun with these panels. Get creative. Uh, can I just show you that the birds are now on pre-order. Everything from the, the next show as well is going to be on pre-order on Watch Live. If you click Watch Live, message in the studio. If you click on today's show, coming up on today's show, this is all of our next out. By the way, we've got tapestry fabrics. Stay tuned for those. You're going to love these for the chateau. Oh, very nice. They're really nice. Keep scrolling down. And then you will find Debbie's next hour, which we've already loaded on. There are um, some of the... Oh, yeah, they're the velvets. Oh, these will look nice with the velvets, actually. Imagine this with a velvet back. Then we've got... Yeah, this thing's already selling out. It's very, very busy. Oh, my gosh, how are we going to get this next hour? Here we are. Right. We've got some peonies that are coming back in. Peony bag panel, peony squares, the sunflowers. Sunflower. Sunflowers are already selling out, by the way. The apron was very popular. Oh, cool. the uh, blossom um, tablet cushion. Yes, the one that's been on the front of the desk. That's there as well. There's your birds. Right, yes. all of these spring birds launching at 10 o'clock. Have you got a tote bag? Oh, oh, look, there you go. You got that one. That's going to look lovely. Oh, yeah, you've got tote bag. Look, even uh, we've, we've got one on the desk here. This is what your tote bag's going to look like. Oh, also on the web, we mentioned the green machine. The green machine comes with lots of different bundles. Shop ahead because we've got a brand new accessory bundle as well of diamantes. Belly going to need these. We have already got them. <laughs> <laughs> got it all. Right, thank you ever so much. Thank, thank you. you. We'll see you in, well, less than an hour. We'll see you at 10 o'clock. Don't go anywhere because we've got, by the looks of things, loads of fabric to bring you over the next 40 minutes. We'll see you after this. <laughs> Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app.
head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. Not only is Sewing Street live from 8am till 1pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Sewing Street app, now, Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754, which means there are more ways to watch your way with Sewing Street. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com, where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one p and throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard p and is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to sewing or a seasoned pro, you're sure to learn something new. We're live every day from 8am till 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Did you know that we can deliver to over 20 different countries worldwide, spanning four continents from the UK to Australia? Check out our website for the list of countries and delivery costs. Sewing Street, stitching the world together. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, even after we finish broadcasting live? Just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one p and with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus, you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24-7. So head over to SewingStreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. Hello, welcome back, welcome back. Right, I feel like 
like my birthday's come early. It doesn't officially start till tomorrow. Hint, hint, plug, plug, plug. But um, this is amazing. I've never even seen these tapestry fabrics. And just going back to the last hour, Debbie Moore Designs, those panels would look amazing with velvet backs. They would look amazing. Or some of the PUs for bags as well. Shall we do the William Morris tapestries first, please, bed? Because I love them. And we've got velvet. Yeah. I love them all. I love them all. Right, I'm just going to dive in. This is MKC 432. Right, this one is William Morris Tapestry Fabrics. Oh, do you know sometimes when you like the reverse? Mm. Oh, I do like the reverse on this. Right, so now I've been watching and Ben, me and Kieran have decided we are applying you for the next series of the great British um, interior designer or whatever it's called, the master interior master. Like you've got to go on it. You will be on it. You will be on it. So I've been watching it lots and oh my gosh, this would be, we would seriously talk about it. You would get on it. You'll be on it. You would win it. Yeah, you would win it. This would be brilliant though for upholstering onto, I'm thinking like window seats in bay windows. This would be lovely for carpet bag style, uh, you know, weekend bags or cushions. But I mean, look at the width of this for $7.99. This is your deluxe, it's proper tapestry fabric. It'd be lovely for dressmaking, a jacket as well. You've got so much fabric, you could do at least, you know, how many cushion fronts with this? three or four cushion fronts, depending on the size of them. Um, but it is sold off the bolt now as well. So you can buy as much as you want for 7 99 and a half meter. Now we have got designs galore and I'm aware of the time. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just show you all the designs and then it's up to you to fill your boots on, um, on the web. Even if Ben takes the graphics out, it doesn't mean that it's sold out. You can still go for it. We've got this same print in a different colorway as well. This is BTC491 and it's in more of your uh, uh, black and pink and oh, beautiful reds. Look at that. £7.99, a half meter for your Honeysuckle Rosa Deluxe. Just £7.99, a half meter. Isn't that amazing? I am just so excited for the possibilities of home decor, bag makers that this is going to bring because it is a bit chilly in here, isn't it, Kat? Um, because of the, the quality of this, I mean, it's going to be really, really uh, sturdy. If you want to make a really lovely big weekend bag, I'm thinking with leather strap handles, it's going to look a fortune. $7.99. It's an absolute bargain it's a steal ollie he was like hang on is it me or is that like a really really good price i'm shook up. normally if we have um tapestry fabric you're looking at least 13 pound a half meter 12.99 a half meter so to have william morris honeysuckle that beautiful deluxe tapestry fabric it's absolutely fabulous quality really thick um for under eight pounds a half meter you cannot go wrong it comes in green Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like this one. I really do like this one. Do you know how expensive it is to wallpaper uh, your, your wall with William Morris wallpaper? So to be able to have home decor, to be able to just make yourself some beautiful cushions, bolster cushions, draft excluders would be good with this. I want to go on one of uh, Catherine Wright's upholstery courses. Do you want to do it with me, Ben? You, can you do upholstery? Sort of strikes me as the sort of person that you'd be able to do it. Imagine doing like a, a bench window seat in like a nice bay window, or if you've got, if you've got an old footstool, piano stool that you want to do, you William Morris. Remember this is, that's just half the width of it. Even any lovely jackets. I'm thinking like a really nice, smart, sort of boxy, you know, Chanel vibe jacket, really smart jacket. That would be lovely. 7 99 and a half meter. As I said, we have got fabrics galore to fly through. Have a look on pre order. They're all listed underneath us. We all do our best to get through everything. It's going to be a speedy hour. Right, this one is QXC432, please, Ben. I like these colours and I just love the reverse. <laughs> I love the reverse on lots of these tapestry fabrics. 
Oh, what about the Tallulah Shacket? Have you seen Hayley West's Tallulah Shacket? Just to have panels of it, along with maybe some denim, would be really nice. Seven pounds, 99, a half metre. Oranges, reds, yeah, lovely. Even to be able to have um, tablewares, you could just, if you've got a, a nice blanket stitch along this, this would be a really lovely table runner. And you wouldn't need to do anything else. You wouldn't need to quilt it. You wouldn't need to put any interfacing or back it or, you know, that would be amazing. How much would it be? William Morris table runner in tapestry fabric as well. I have no idea how we got that at such a low price. Did you say this launched earlier on in the year? Well, I say last year. It was on once before and it was the start of this month. Oh, because you said to me, oh, you probably um, haven't seen this because it was, um, I, th I presumed it was because it was, it was on when I was off. But, well, it was on when I was off in April. <laughs> earlier on this month, it absolutely went wild in the aisles. I am not surprised. So this could be the first time you're seeing these. Um, we are going to just show you all the different designs. Here we have, it's the first time we've had William Morris Tapestry Fabric, ALC454, please. Do you know, uh, like a Mary Poppins star carpet bag? I'm thinking like quite a rounded one, big rounded carpet bag. Have we got any holidays to look forward to, any weekends away? Is that you done now for the year, Ben? He's going to have to book something else. Um, Hannah booked us all on a trip to Croatia the other day. She found a, not during the show, she uh, found a Croatia trip for £104. Airbnb, flights, everything. I don't know when she's going. <laughs> 7 99 in that lovely aqua. Aqua deluxe. I've got two weddings in the next two weeks. So I'm having my birthday show a little bit early. I shouldn't really say that because we normally have our birthday show on our birthday and Dave Greaves just said happy birthday to me. And I said, well, it's not technically till the 26th. It's, it's next Friday. Normally I'm, I'm you know, on my birthday, but I'm actually away. Um, we're at a wedding. This is, yeah. Let me spin this around. I think I'm upside down. <gasps> oh, see, that one is just so classic. This is Blackthorn. It's one of the most coveted designs actually isn't it <gasps> it reminds ben of the tulip fields in amsterdam has anybody does anybody know ben's been on holiday anybody i don't think any, well none of us noticed you'd gone to be honest ben no one had noticed no one messaged him to let him know that they missed him <laughs> oh seven pounds 99 and a half meter your tapestry fabric also in the green is available. We missed you, Benny boy. <laughs> Sorry, this one is ZIC. The greens. How about for outdoor furniture bits? I mean, it's a tapestry fabric, so it's really durable. It's, it's heavyweight. Um, I'm thinking if you are going to be doing some really big outside cushions. Oh, so I, I actually did set up all my outdoor bits yesterday. We were all outside in the garden. And then, I mean, it was so sunny. We were sat out all having our lunch. It was really nice. And then um, about 20 minutes later, oh, my gosh, it was awful weather. Yeah. It wasn't hailing yesterday, but it keeps doing that, doesn't it? Like really sunny and then hailing. <sighs> I've been uh, jet washing the patio though, and it is the most satisfying thing I've ever done in my life. Seven pounds, 99 and a half meter. That's again, Blackthorn. It looks completely different in this colorway, doesn't it? Tapestry fabric, really lovely quality for under eight pounds. Um, I know a lot of William Morris fabrics were actually designed for tapestry, weren't they? If you ever uh, 
followed Mae Morris's life, um, William Morris's daughter. She was actually head of the textiles department, and a lot of it is actually was developed for for textiles, uh, for tapestry. This is lovely. RIC four thirty nine, please. I keep going upside down. I'm so sorry. There we go. Now that is like the tulip feels, isn't it? I always think a bolster cushion looks very high end. There's something about a bolster cushion that I just think would look really lovely with Willie Morris. Willie Mo. Could you make a skirt, a tapestry skirt? I don't see why not. Have you got the green machine? Do you know what you need with this tapestry fabric? The green machine. If you are doing a big carpet bag or, you know, if you're doing a skirt and you want a nice um, Presta popper. Yeah, that'd be really nice. Can you? Google it. I, I don't see why. I don't. And someone will message in if you can. 7 99 Tell us. Let us know. Definitely a jacket, a boxy jacket would look really nice. Oh. Is that me and my flared jeans? I bought a pair of flared jeans that I'm wearing today and I bought them today just because I know that I would get my honest opinion from uh, Ben's honest opinion. I'll be like, hmm, because it's meant to be a thing, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Right, same again, larger print. Sorry, I'm throwing these at you now. Uh, SIC 469. Well, Ollie just told me that his 15-year-old daughter is going out to buy flares, so she's very trendy. <gasps> <laughs> now look at me now. <laughs> oh, dear. 7.99. <laughs> Yeah, because it was very different then. Seven pounds ninety nine. <laughs> this one is ebony again, beautiful lily and pomegranate, half a meter, seven pounds ninety nine. Please, will you let me know what you're thinking of making? <gasps> oh. Is this what you're thinking, Cat? Cat could rock this. Right, somebody's got to make us a tapestry skirt. I mean, maybe I'd have it a little bit longer, personally. But it'd look great, wouldn't it? If you've got legs like that, absolutely. I do like that, tapestry skirt. Ben's got legs like that, he could rock it, absolutely. You would. What would be your name? This is if he's in RuPaul Drag Race. <laughs> NMC452. Right, I think this is my favourite. It's super fresh. Now, Ben is um, very good with homewares and interiors, hence why we are trying to get him onto the Interior Design Challenge programme with uh, Alan Carr. Um, so don't let it put you off. He's saying nobody has bought this one yet. And this is my favourite. So don't let them put you off. It's really lovely. Um, <laughs> I promise he's got style. He has got taste. <laughs> no, we are applying for it. We, were, we both said, oh, do you know who needs to go on this? Ben, you'd be brilliant. We're way too boring. Our interiors are awful compared to it. Like, Ben's so good. Right now, loads going into baskets. Loads in baskets for this. Seven people are going to miss out on this. We only launched it earlier on in April. Thank you, Ollie. Ollie's looking over at the producer screen. <laughs> Ben's too busy looking at skirts, tapestry skirts. <laughs> Seven pounds, 99 and a half metre. Get as much as you can because this isn't something that we do very often. Ah, oh, yeah. It's about to sell out. Right, what's your next favourite, Ben? I like this one. Personally, this is my favourite because it reminds... Oh, but I haven't seen... Oh, right. The last three designs are amazing. This one only comes in one colourway. It's not a William Morris, but look at this. How cute is this? It's cute gardens, cute gardens. 
Um, have you ever been to Kew Gardens? It looks like it's been embroidered. Do you know what I mean? Like it's a tapestry fabric and it looks lovely. I think this would be perfect again for the Tallulah jacket with your really nice, uh, maybe some denim. Wall hangings would be nice. Notebook needle cases, storage tubs, carpet bags. Have we given you enough inspiration? <laughs> Six pounds, 49, a half metre. If you live locally to things, though, you just don't go, do you? You don't tend to experience the touristy things. <laughs> You've got lots of tourist attractions in Redditch now. Have you been to the new farm? Is it called Atwood Farm? Is it not new? Oh, they've just recently put signposts. I've seen the signs, and I'm like, oh, I need to go there. Six pounds, 49, and a half metre. And remember, half a metre... Is very wide. That is a Laura Laura fabric. That's a bargain again. Tapestry fabric for six forty nine a half meter. Really good value. Pop it back in there. Right. We've also got three designs. Go back to William Morris. Okay, the brook. Three colourways. Let's go with G O C four. Um. Oh, oh. Yeah. Seven pounds, 99 and a half metre. Have you ever been to Arrow Mill? That's nice, isn't it? Do you? It's really nice in there, isn't it? Sorry, this is a local. I say, is it local to here, to Redditch? It's, oh, it's Ulster, anyway. Yeah, Ulster. Ulster, not Ulster. Seven pounds, 99 and a half metre. That is so beautiful. I think this needs to be on something that's a larger, actually, because the repeat's quite frequent, actually. If you are using this for smaller cushions, I'm even thinking, you know, like little cute 12-inch cushions. We've got some great velvets as well. Right, let's have a look. Mm. No, 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 no. You could do front and back in this, to be fair, couldn't you? You could do, um, it is really lovely. Okay, it also comes in the nighttime blue by day by night. This is ATC, yeah, $7.99. Brand new earlier this month, at the start of this month, this was brand new in. We got um, velvets to come. We've got PUs. Let us know if there's something you definitely want to see because we're going to do our best to try and show you as much as we can. But it's a lot of fabric for one hour. Ben, you have packed in today's show, haven't you? Oh, look. I just did a bit of pattern matching. Look at that! <laughs> Last one of the Willy Mo tapestry. Can we do the other tapestries? Yeah, because they're so affordable. They are so affordable and they're really, really popular. <laughs> oh, have you spoke to Pete? I thought he was your friend. The brook in wine. Seven pounds, 99 and a half metre. Remember, this is off the bolt as well. So if you want metres of this for a really lovely project, you know, whether you're doing large bags if you're doing a collection to make to sell you can make to sell with this did you ask debbie about her angel policy by the way um seven pounds 99 right should we do the other tapestry fabrics because we've got lots and lots of lots and they're all brilliant value for money um whenever we bring tapestry fabrics whether it be within a bag making show or a, a project show now this is a william morris inspired print it's called new world and it's not i mean I know when we see the birds and we're talking normally about Strawberry Thief, but this is a similar sort of vibe. It's still £7.99. <laughs> I 
I do love that bottle green in the background. Okay, now this is where it gets silly. We're happy at 7 99 a half metre, aren't we? We're, we? Everybody's been checking out. This is one of the lowest prices. That must have been an early bird special or something. There is no way. Ben, is that the price? I would absolutely be uh, making the most of that. Oh, you've missed us, Ben, haven't you? You've missed us. We've missed him. How long have you been away? Four days. <laughs> He has actually been away for three days. He has only been away for weeks. Five pound ninety nine a half meter. Nine days he's had off. Ah. Five pounds ninety nine a half meter. Tapestry fabric. With that William Morris sort of feel to it. I know it says William Morris, or it just actually says William in the graphics. It doesn't say Morris, it just says William. <laughs> Tapestry William Forest. Not William Morris, William Forest. Five pounds, 99. <laughs> right. Great price. Okay, now let's do the trees. These are like your tree of life kind of feel. Um, Aura, aura, I love those colours. Let's have a look on the back. Mm, no, I'd go with this side. Um, homewares, again, this is screaming out homewares for me. You can still use this for, you know, more good, sort of simple envelope back cushions. If you go to a garden centre and you see fabric like this in a cushion, you're probably looking at 20, 25 pound a cushion, aren't you? What about like long draft excluders? Here we go. Uh, Savage Edges joined seamlessly on the fabric. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah, is it you, uh, with me pattern matching, being like a genius at pattern matching, but they just literally butt up together. Jennifer, and this is a funny one. Oh, thank you. Why is that funny? That's so true. Ben was like, this is a funny one. The fairies look like me. Although I haven't got a French mannequin, mine now's awful. I'm going, I'm bridesmaid um, for my mate in a couple of weeks, and she's asked for me to have French manicure on my toes. Is that extreme? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I've got, I've got. Oh, I've Ben, I've got a lot to fill you in. I've got the biggest high heels that she's got me to wear. I can't, I can't even stand up in them. Honestly, I'm, I've had to practice. I've had to actually have them at home practicing, because just to practice to stand in them, I, I'm gonna I'm absolutely gonna fall flat on my face. I know in my flats though. In, I've never been a heels person, and I think since lockdown, who has been like right? Does Shay go out in heels? Does your daughter wear heels? I just don't think the young, the youth of today wear heels. I went out. Do you wear heels when you go out, Kat? Only boot heels. Boot heels, but you wouldn't wear like stiletto heels. I feel like back in the day, yeah, we all wore heels, but now nobody really wears heels. <laughs> no, I, I've just been in Birkenstocks or other flip flops, cro Crocs or something for about four years now. Right, these are lovely. This is your, oh, look, Gaudi, this is your, uh, yeah, it is like Barcelona, your mosaic. You only need to use snippets of this as well. <laughs> Little needle books would be nice. You could make lots and lots to sell them, couldn't you? It's $6.99. It's just so cost effective to make to sell. Your friend Joe Lysett was filming a new show. Kat was a uh, had tickets to go in the audience. Your mate, your mate uh, is Ben's friend, Joe Lysett. He follows Ben on Instagram, you see. £6.99. Little Holland. £6.99 
£6.99 for all of these tablets. This is always one of the best sellers. This is always one of the best sellers. We've had this for numerous sort of bag making projects. It goes really, really nicely with PU. They always say to use sort of like similar weights of fabric together. This one will be really nice with your PUs. It'd also be nice with your velvet, actually, if you do want to do some nice cushions and back it with velvet. Um, we've got two more, I believe. Um, I think that Hayley used some of these fabrics within her Tallulah jacket pattern. Have you done the jacket before? Isn't it great? Really cool. A lot nice with denim. Mm -hmm. Six pound ninety nine half meter for the Aztec. This is what I mean when I think you know when you look at fabulous tiled floors and you see quilt patterns within. Yes, that is inspiration for a quilt, isn't it? We've also got your herringbone design. This is the last one. We have flown through those. We've got some velvets and some PUs to bring you. Last of the tapestry, and this is your zigzag. Would you cut it all up and then put it all back together? <laughs> it looks three dimensional, doesn't it? It looks like stairs. It looks like it's stairs. Very clever placement of that. £6.99. I can't not see that now. You know when you look through the... Um, do you remember those magazines when you were young that you used to stare at so hard that you went cross-eyed and it all different things come out at you? That's what it reminds me of. They look like stairs all coming out at me now. Um, £6.99. They can't be good for your eyes, though, to stare like so hard that everything starts coming out the page. But it's fun, isn't it? Right, let's do Strawberry Thief in Velvet, please. Have you seen the William Morris velvets? I've got the navy blue. If you love William Morris and velvet, please watch tomorrow's show. I'm so excited to show you tomorrow's show. Uh, Bex is here with Amber Makes Projects. It is going to be amazing. I'm very, very lucky. Uh, £7.99 for your strawberry thief. Beck said she requested to be on my birthday show. She says, because otherwise I'd never, ever see you. She was like, I really want to work with you. I want to actually see you and say hello. So I want to hang out. So we're hanging out on my birthday show tomorrow. Uh, £7.99, Strawberry Thief in that lovely. And it is velvet, by the way. It's a velvet. It's super soft. Beautiful crushed velvet. Strawberry Thief. Now, just so you're aware, what's the width of this, Ben? Because it fits nice and wide. If you are thinking, yeah, 145 wide. So if you are thinking of um, dressmaking projects, I love a bit of velvet. Uh, if you are thinking of homewares, that is lovely, really lovely. But bag makers, I mean, you can't go wrong, can you? You can't go wrong with velvet. It behaves itself as well. It does behave, behave itself. Oh, yeah, velvet trousers are very, very in, aren't they? Now I'm wearing flare jeans. I feel like I could talk about fashion. <laughs> I never used to be able to when I was in my uh, skinny jeans with my Christmas socks and my slippers coming in. Now I feel like I'm fashionable. Seven ninety nine and a half metre. <laughs> Whatever. Ben's just teasing me, mocking me now. Right. Strawberry thief in wine. Oh, these are larger scale prints, by the way. This is larger scale. Let me just show you next to the other one so you can see the difference. So the birds are smaller here. And look at the size of these. I mean, you could do some 20 inch really big fancy cushions and I would pipe them yes I think piping them would be lovely and we've got coordinating solids as well oh which one would you go for Ben no I'll maybe just do front and back in this that's fine oh, it's a different red isn't it there's lots of different shades of red so that's too that's too more that's more crimson isn't it uh, so about 99, half metre, once again, it's 145, 145 wide. So you've got a lot of fabric and it's just so soft. 
It is lovely quality velvet. <laughs> There's nothing to worry about in terms of sewing with velvet either. I think when you sort of start out and you're just used to sewing on quality weight cotton, do you think, oh, delving into any other sorts of fabric is brilliant, but it's difficult. But just, this is strawberry thief. It's called grey and it's, it's not. I know the background is like more of a sagey green, actually. I think this would be lovely for your home, Ben. Background is more like a slaty grey, isn't it? Because of the green that's coming through. It's giving it more of a green feel overall. Yeah, nice. If you were to put blue with it, the grey would feel more blue. The strawberries, look, the colour of the strawberries, they really stand out, don't they? £7.99. £7.99, a half metre. You just have to think about the, um, is it called the nap or the pile of it? So obviously you'll cut them all in the same direction, all your pieces. Um, but this would be a beautiful, again, jacket or blouse. Oh, I love velvet. I love wearing velvet. Mm -hmm. Seven pounds, 99 and a half metre. But I just think it elevates the look of a cushion. If you've got a beautiful bolster cushion, like a round, lovely cushion. Oh, yeah. That'd be really nice. Then we also have... Um, two more. I think this is the garden. Um, and this is the V&A as well, by the way. This is the V&A collection. So when you're looking at this quality, you know it's lovely. Look, it says here. Um, uh, KVV T71. William Morris, Victorian Albert Museum, London. Oh, is it sold out? Sold out on pre-order. Well done, if you got that. We've got Golden Lily. I think this is the last one, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Is that William Morris? No. Golden Lily. I didn't know William Morris is a lemon. One with lemon. No, oh, come and show. It's not that one. No. <laughs> Seven pound nine This is the last William Morris fabric. That lovely golden lily of print, and it has got the most amazing soft touch velvet feel. It's beautiful. It doesn't have stretch to it, so you don't need to worry about, you know, if you are sewing um, homewares or if, you, if you've never worked with velvet before, it does behave itself beautifully. Obviously, just be very careful pressing it. I, I think you're okay. I'll ask Bex, but maybe use a pressing cloth or, or, or press on the reverse of it. £7.99. Doesn't look like it'll crease particularly um, hard anyway. Maybe get a steamer on it if you're uh, making you know, a garment, that would be lovely. Right, do you want to do the lemons though? Because this is going to be really nice for um, <gasps> homewares. In fact, there was a, a lady on that Great British, I keep calling it the Great British and I don't think it is, and she had this, this fabric in cushions behind her on her, you know when they talk about her home and she had that one. No, I haven't seen that one yet. I'm still, I'm still a few episodes behind. Look at this. Oh, so you are watching it. So again, it is in that lovely velvet, Garden of Eden. I mean, they just look, it looks like a, well, it's a digital print, so it looks like a photograph, doesn't it? Your mangoes and lemons in velvet, £8.99, a half a metre. If you go into a very fancy interior design shop or, you know, like a gifts and homewares store, you would be looking at like 25, 30 pound a cushion, wouldn't you? Eight pounds, 99 and a half metre. They are absolutely beautiful. Yes, I do love the range. Even in the range, you'd be looking at at least what? 15 pound a cushion of velvet like this. Right, let's do this one, because this is really cool. 
I love the dark background and those absolute fabulous pops of colour. All of your exotic plants. I'm only saying that because I can't name them all. <laughs> can't name these flowers. Eight pounds ninety nine. I just love having the real bright yellows, pinks, the ombres, those sort of rainbow tones. But this is the fabric. I should have found a clip. It was on episode one of that interior design challenge, and she had the most amazing house. Um, and beh sat behind her on her interview. She had this fabric, and I said to Kira, "We sell that fabric. We know that fabric. Fab, isn't it? Um, just." Eight pounds ninety nine a half meter for your botanical. I heard somebody say to me because you know, um, oh, do you know? Oh, in fact, that, that's another story for another day. We'll move on. <laughs> it's not very three dimensional about this. They're lovely, aren't they? Right, keep going through. If there's anything that you have not seen or you want to see again, or if you've got any questions about, please ask. This is your rainforest again from that same collection. Navy background with your parrots, peacocks. 8.99 meter. What garments could you make with velvet? If you got the Great British Sewing Bee book that we launched the other day, oh yes, a waistcoat, imagine. Velvet waistcoat. Waistcoats are, again, not just talking about my knowledge on the trends at the minute, but they're very in, aren't they? £8.99, I love the uh, deep navy blue background. I love the parrots. No, they don't. They just have parrots in the trees in Amsterdam. And is this a toucan? I love that. Look at that bright neon pink. Beautiful neon pink feathers. Sorry, I know that we're low on time. Leopard print is completely sold out. That's sold out before the show. Well done if you got the leopard print velvet. This is a very spring feel velvet. In fact, this would look nice with your... Uh, this would look nice with any of your Debbie Moore designs. If you've got any of the spring fairies and you want to back a cushion with one of those feature panels, is the one that you could pass me, Kat, just so I can see. Or actually the, um, the sunflowers, any of them. Fairies, sunflowers, what, which one do you think? Right, Kat's saying this one. Do you think these would look nice? If you've got any of the feature panels. If you want to do the front in this... And then the back in velvet, that'd be really nice. Yes, all the birds. We've got the bird feature panels coming up. You could have the front of the feature panel and then the back in velvet, which again, I personally think it just elevates it. It just takes your cushion to that next level. You don't need to do anything fancy, but any of these lovely birds, definitely get hold of this. Eight ninety nine and a half meter, by the way, it's so, so wide. You'd be able to do loads of different cushions. I'm so sorry that I'm... I'm messing all these up. Uh, right, we also have, make note of that one when you're thinking for next for uh, the next hour. Oh, right, this is, my, this is my kind of vibe. I love that. I love that. Ben, can you design a quilt, you know, these sort of colours? I love this. It's very dramatic, isn't it? monochrome black and white but then you've also got so many lovely shades of greens a bit of blue chromes creams i love that and look at your peacock that lovely peacock green oh there you go and the feathers <gasps> it's like sepia tones isn't it Seven, oh no, sorry, eight pounds, 99 and a half meter. 
<laughs> Not to scale. Besides the peacock next to the butterfly. That's funny. Uh, last one. Now, this is really fresh and fun for spring. We're all ready now, aren't we, for spring? Did you have nice weather in the Netherlands? Yeah. Was it nice and warm? Oh, good. To do uh, 38,000 steps a day, it was very warm. 38,000 steps. I mean, how did you even do that? Oh. Eight pounds 99. Right, now we have the solids. So if you do want to back any of those beautiful fabrics um, with navy. Yeah, this is navy. Right, really, really quick. We're flying through these. We've got a couple of minutes. £7.99 for your navy colour. I'll show you the blue bar next to it just so you can see the difference. We will get to the PUs, don't worry. £7.99, a half metre. I'm going to fly through these solid colours. Cut to order. All of these are cut to order. You can buy off the bolt. So if you want two metres, for example, buy four units. If you want two and a half metres, buy five units. It goes up on a linear scale. Um, seven pounds ninety nine, and that is for your lovely sort of crushed velvet. <gasps> Once again, for upholstery. When we go on our upholstery course, Ben, this would be great. Because I've got a velvet. Uh, well, I, do, I don't know anymore actually. I used to have like a velvet um, headboard. Really lovely. Uh, in the green. Once again, these are going to be perfect for any of you Debbie Moore designs uh, to back any cushions to put on. Um, along with tote bags, just £7.99. Very, very plush indeed. £7.99. That's called Jade. We also have your red. Claret. You can embroider on top of it as well. I've seen people who have embroidered onto um, velvet and it looks so nice. Wasn't it Delphine, actually? Didn't she do some lovely bee cushions on velvet? They were amazing to do some bead embroidery. <gasps> ah, Ben used to have in his old wardrobe his red velvet flares. Where are they now? Are they still? They're gone. They're gone. Um, I saw your shirt that you managed to get because Ben's reinvented himself. He's very Zara man now, but he used to have like a very cool uh, <laughs> dress sense. Seven ninety nine and a half meter. In the plum. <laughs> Seven ninety nine and a half meter. Oh, that is a beautiful, sumptuous colour, isn't it? Final one is rose pink. That is very feminine, isn't it? And right, actually, anybody who got the vintage rose panels, feature panels, get this. If you want to make cushions, back it with the velvet. It will look absolutely beautiful. If you bought those four squares, I think they were only nine ninety nine for the four squares. Get yourself a half a meter of this, and you've got enough to be able to make four cushions. Then seven ninety nine. That is a brilliant price. Now, loads of people have been asking about the PUs. In fact, they've already been selling on pre-order. We've got metallics. We have got metallics. Right, Kat's going to be saying she wants a skirt in this. I know it. You can use this PU for, for skirts because it's super, super soft. It feels like a really, really high quality leather. It's, it's not. It's a PU. Skirt. Yes, 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 yes. And because it's got the backing, the cotton back, it's really easy to sew with. Um, quite often, I know a lot of PUs tend to stick under your, your foot. So often people use a Teflon foot, but you, you don't actually need to because the majority of your stitching is going to be right sized together and it's just a cotton. Um, just obviously be aware when you're pressing. Um, I wouldn't press directly onto this. I would use uh, a pressing cloth. And also don't pin it because you might leave little holes. I'd use clips. 
but for bag making for um yeah this is lovely and it's so malleable it's really lovely to sew through seven pound 99 i know lots of our guest designers have said it's it is the best pu they've worked with our quality is fabulous now this is pink metallic <gasps> oh i like this um this one is uh, i believe so i haven't got a sticker i'm afraid 7.99 it is 30 percent viscose 40 percent pu and 30 percent polyester in your metallic pink i do think a bag with this and maybe add some pearls details some pearls would be lovely you could also use this for a plique, by the way. If you have got yourself um, an alphabet that you want to use, why not cut out letters? You could applique it onto things with or, or flowers or hearts and put them onto cushions. Very nice. Um, all of these are flying out, by the way. There was lots that went on pre-order. I've got it in the brown. In the plum. Um, I think this is bronze, yes. <laughs> Once again, it's super, super soft. Uh, I know lots of PU out there. It's very difficult when we're on the telly and you can't literally hold it and feel it. But if you have worked with PU before and not got on with it, don't be put off by, uh, you know, by that because ours is super, super soft, so malleable, lovely to work with. Great. If you are doing dressmaking, you absolutely can make a nice leather skirt with this or PU skirt uh, or a jacket. But if you are using this for, um, for a plique or bag making, it's ideal. In fact, I was following uh, 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 one of the girls on... Um, <laughs> I was following a girl on Instagram who makes her own boots and she uses... Yeah, PU. We should do that, shouldn't we? I'd love to do shoemaking. It's actually not, if you've got all the right hardware, like you can do it. You absolutely can do it. You just got to get yourself your, your uh, soul. But I really struggle with shoes. Does anybody else get shoes that fit me? So this is perfect. Right, this is gold and then we've got silver. This is your gold metallic. Light gold. Whenever it gets to Christmas, this is always out of stock. We always sell so much of this because people use it for applique stars and all sorts on, on um, sacks. Seven pound ninety nine a half meter. Thirty percent viscose, forty percent PU, and thirty percent polyester. And you're like gold. It's very wide as well. You get a lot of fabric there for your money. Um, have we done the silver? No, silver. Pewter or steel. Even if you don't want to make a whole bag out of this, just to do feature bits, so like your flap or your strap with a PU, looks really nice. £7.99 for your PU. My friend, I'll never forget, my friend Nikki, she wore trousers exactly like this for New Year's Eve a few years ago, and she looked absolutely amazing. <gasps> yeah, I need to show you a picture. She did look so good. And she still says, I mean, she's now, um, she's got a little boy, Jensen, and she says, still got those silver trousers. I will get back in them because they were so nice. Okay, now, there are your metallics. These are now all of your matte finish. Matte, lovely pink. It goes really nicely with your metallics, so if you do want to add two of them together, um, I know that Becky Alexander Frost, um, Emma Brassfield, lots of our resident sort of bag makers, love, love, love working with our PU. It's super, super soft. Uh, key tips is basically to use your clips instead of pins. Um, shouldn't need a Teflon foot, but maybe a walking foot to just help if you are finding it sticking with your machine. Uh, but other than that, a majority of our sewing anyway is going to be right sides together and all of these are backed with cotton. No, this one is... Um, right, hang on. Could, because I just want to show you, there is a brown. So this is like the... There are four colours, Ben. I haven't got codes, you see, so 
grey. £7.99. That's fine. Oh, I've got black as well. Black, red, navy, blue. Yeah, you shout out your ones. Uh, okay, if you just want your classic black PU. It looks grey in the web image, but it is black. Go by the graphics and go by what you see on screen. It's just so, so soft. Have you ever um, had like a really lovely, fine quality, very soft leather, like purse or anything? Um, then you'll know what I mean. It's so, so soft. You'll really enjoy working with this. This is great for purses as well, actually. If you uh, enjoyed making the, the, the bag that we had earlier, the, the little cosmetic bag, this would be nice to have as a little like travel wallet in one of these PUs. Indigo. $7.99. Can't go wrong with navy blue, can you? For a handbag would be beautiful. No, PU doesn't, it's got no stretch in it. It's, it hasn't got a, hasn't got any elastane. It's 30% viscose, 40% PU and 30% polyester, so no stretch to it. Oh, this is a lovely, very classy red, isn't it? This is like Le Bouton red. Yes. Look at that. 7.99 and a half metre. Remember, half a metre is wide as well. You're getting lots of fabric for your money. Um, I think that might be the last one. We, we've actually got through everything. We've got through everything this hour. We've done ever so well. Now, go for it. Have a look underneath us on the website. There is lots and lots of fabric. Here's the brown. £7.99. We've got it wine because it's slightly on the burgundy sort of scale, but it is more of your like... Yeah, I can see why I've called it like a deep merlot, a deep plum, $7.99. Okay, Debbie and Bella are eagerly awaiting in the wings. We've got so much to bring you with them, uh, including all of those sunflower panels, the springtime bird panels, uh, and so much more. New projects galore, so stay where you are. Don't go anywhere. We're back with Debbie Moore Designs after this. <laughs> Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app. Head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. Not only is Sewing Street live from 8am till 1pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Sewing Street app, now Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754, which means there are more ways to watch your way with Sewing Street. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week.
Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one P&P throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Did you know that we can deliver to over 20 different countries worldwide, spanning four continents from the UK to Australia? Check out our website for the list of countries and delivery costs. Sewing Street, stitching the world together. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, seven days a week, even after we finish broadcasting live? Just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one P&P with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus, you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24-7. So head over to sewingstreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with Split Pay. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Hello, welcome back, welcome back. We're getting everybody all kitted out for spring and summer with yes. this. I mean, I absolutely love the sunflowers, the birds. I know. I suppose you have to think of, you know, something for everybody. Not everybody will want to have the fairies or, you know what I mean? You've no. literally ticked every box. So this is the thing with Debbie yeah. Moore Designs. We've been, we're celebrating 15 years next month. Are you? I know, I don't know where the time has flown. It's ridiculous. So in that time, we have developed something like seven, Hundred collections. <gasps> so if you think of every seven hundred collections, times it by twelve hundred printable elements. That's how many designs we have. So I mean, for us, this is really exciting because over those fifteen years, it's only the first year that you've been dipping into yes, putting it's these not designs even been onto a year. It has not even been a year. We started last July, and we started gently, mm. maybe once every couple of months, and now we come in every month with new designs. We've got two new collections. We did the earlier show yeah. with the vintage florals, which is just, they're all beautiful. I'm going to say that. They're all gorgeous. And then we have got on today's show back in stock with the sunflower and peony and the new spring birds. Brilliant. Right, what are we going to start with, Ben? Because everything, just so you know, has been absolutely flying out on pre-order. Thank you for getting there early. And for anybody who who had uh, hasn't yet looked on the web, have a look. Go through and have a look. Right, there's so many different panels. I just want to make sure Six, I get the right. Four. Here we go. The last one. <laughs> Typical. <laughs> we're lucky. We, uh, we've got a, a feeling these are all going to sell out. So if you want it, go for it. Now the birds. So when I designed this one, okay, I wanted to design different options so you can see they're actually obviously those two are the same layout but different colorways but yet again they're all different colorways so you've got from the pink with the blues up. yeah this was inspired from the chateau 
Really? I found loads of teacups, haven't I, Bella? Yeah. Loads and loads, loads. of teacups in the chateau. <laughs> really gorgeous china. I was like, how cool would it be to have a bird on it? Just as you do. Yes. So this is a collection that I launched this year, actually. Right. Birds of a feather. And so these designs are from them, but what we've done is tweak some of the designs to fit in with the new sewing fabric designs. And look how cute that is. And um, I mean, we started out earlier on saying about how um you've thought of everything that you've got the borders already included so you're not dipping into stash trying to pick out a coordinating color you know it's all going to work yes. and whether you want all four together and quilt it as it is or whether you want to cut these up and use them as um separate blocks then i mean the world's your oyster we've seen feature panels being used in quilts in bags, in cushions, in dresses, yes. in all sorts. I mean, there's nothing stopping you fussy cutting these birds, using no. this as a plique as well. And then also in this range, what I've done is I've done 40 panel, uh, 40 uh, square, sorry, Brilliant. and also a variety pack, so you can do a big quilt. Right. So I've tried to think about everything. And this is where, for me, the value for money comes in. Like, it's, it's wild, because you can now do a whole kit. Bear in mind, this is 9 99 Yeah. You've got, bearing in mind, this is brand new, never been to air before, and it's under £10. Four cushion fronts, four big blocks, and if you're adding in your 40 squares, your charm yes. pack, I mean, that's everything's really affordable. You can start to build up your own quilt. And how beautiful is this? Very for, spring, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah. these are actually um, colour picked and they're hand drawn. And what we wanted to do is give you that kind wow. of option of when we've actually designed them is layering really good so yeah. when you come to the other designs you'll see what i mean so you can we are learning about applique yeah. which in paper world is decoupage yeah so all our layers give you that option as well yeah this is going to be beautiful all your yeah lots of opportunities when it comes to um to applique with these okay just nine pounds 99 we've got same design different colorway go on sorry what was the code ending in it might be the end one. Oh no. HJ, here we go. So same again, four squares. This time. Yes. This has been the most popular. This is spring. You know, the green and I mean when I did this one I wanted a soft lemon. Yeah. That I picked, not yeah. a vibrant one. So as you can see, you're going to get four different ones as well. So you've got the, the same design, but not because you've got a vintage feel behind it and a solid behind oh, that. Yeah. And then as you go down, what I've done is, of course, giving the teacup. But then this time I've added some lace in the background oh, and giving yes. you the option of the layers and put butterflies in. I love the different borders as well. Like they're all different, you know, size borders. You've got the different, uh, like you say, this one's got that sort of vintage feel, hasn't it? Yeah. With the lace. Uh, just nine ninety nine. I'm amazed at the prices of the panels because obviously, you know, Team Up with Sewing Street and we print in the panels for you. We are able to do them at the most amazing prices. Uh, I bet you're excited to see what everybody ends up turning into. I do, into. I do. I mean, uh, we've got an amazing creative design team now between Nicola and Jenny and Bella and myself. We're trying to work at different ideas, but we are new to the yeah. sewing world. Uh, so we're just having, we're just dipping into being creative and being what we can do just nine pounds 99 for your features uh don't forget we do have the 40 squares as well as the brand new variety panel which if you haven't seen a variety panel before oh that is a game changer absolutely um 40 squares oh i love this this is in that lovely fresh green now we've then. actually oh. used this and a cushion coming up oh that's we're going to demo it so look Look how big it is, and you can see how fresh it is. And we use the ombre, and we put it on the front. You'll be able to see it a bit more detail, all the different sections we're giving right. you. Right. Oh, yeah. I mean, so do you say you've got two of each design? So on this one, we have two of each design, and we have used it oh, on the back of here. And you've got a spot, you've got a plane, you've got a gingham, so you've got a, you know, lots of different coordinates. This is a new fabrics. cushion, and we've used it wow. at the bottom there. Okay, wow. you can see it on there. I mean, that is a big cushion, isn't it? Yeah, it's a conservatory cushion. <laughs> yeah, nice big, like 20 inches. There's a new cushion. panel coming up. So. Very nice, very nice sneak peek on the uh, rectangles. So, yeah, so as you can see, you have got up to here, there are the 20 different squares that you're going to get. And what we've done is we're going to give you some brights, and you've also got some pastels in there. And you've got different sizes of flowers as well that oh, you yeah. can use with the birds. 
as you go through them all. Uh, it's like having your own sort of charm pack, but then also having great coordinating fabrics that are going to be very, very useful. Look, you've got your ombres in there yeah. as well. And you've got cute little birds oh, <laughs> in the so nest, nice. okay? And then obviously we've got con contrasting designs of, and he said papers there, fabrics. <laughs> Uh, I, honestly, I, I, I can see why this is absolutely flying out. It is perfect this time of year. And we mentioned this earlier, but we've purposely not put gaps between yes. the squares. So you can literally quilt it as is there. Or you can just like here, we've just yeah. used it on the bottom as a fabric. Yeah, looks great, doesn't it? It's £14.99. Um, right, we're going to fly through as much as we can because we've got so much to show you in this hour. This is now the same 40 squares, but this time in your pinks. Look at the size of the panel yes. for less than £15. Oh, this is my favourite. This is giving me pinks new baby girls, new baby yes. boys, new so baby. I thought that was lovely for that, yeah. Really soft pinks in there with the pastel blues in there. And yet again, the same kind of 40. Mm -hmm. You get 20 designs, two of each. Yeah, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the feathers. So these are all fabrics again that um, you know have derived from your latest paper craft. This range. one is actually the latest one. We brought out birds of a feather collection in paper craft last month, and I thought, you know what? Why don't we do it in fabric? Right, because it's brand new and it's spring, yeah. and it feels really gorgeous. And yet, I have changed some of them to go with the squares. So there is quite a lot of mixing and matching with the existing designs and creating new ones for fabric. Yeah, I love that. There's a lot of tweaking that goes on to make sure it's just yes. right for the fabric. It's not a case of, oh, I've designed this for the paper crafting one. Here you go, put it on some fabric. No, no, no. It, no. There's a lot of time that goes so into it. So I actually it. nearly threw my uh, machine out the window creating <laughs> this design <laughs> because I had, we had all the panels up because I wanted to make sure that the colour tones matched each panel. And I, I use a Mac to design all this. And I was just like, it kept crashing and it kept, I'm like, throw it out the window. Oh. I just need it out. But the collections just come out beautifully. And Bella had the same problem. Her machine was, I was in the France and she was in the UK and we we're on the phone going, we need a new machine. Yeah, <laughs> new memory. But yes, when you actually get them home, especially if you're going for the matching, the feature panels and the variety, pack or even the new 30 squares that are coming up you're going to love them right so is this another oh this is the variety that's the variety if yes. you missed the show earlier on i don't think there is anybody else that has designed a panel quite like this because you've thought of everything you've got feature panels you've got five inch squares and you've got two and a half inch strips on here. You're now thinking like a sewer, Debbie. <laughs> thinking of what we all need. Do you know what? Bella and I get together. This is brilliant. We get a cocktail, we get a notebook. Oh yeah, I love that. And then go through what we want to do. And this was like, well, why don't we put everything in one section? <laughs> so people say, now you're gonna do more like designs on fabrics. And we thought, well, why don't we do a panel? I mean, so these are smaller. You've got the feature mm -hmm. uh, sections and now you've got, I love this. This design That's is beautiful. beautiful. I've got you got and the feathers as well. Then you've got the ten across the top. Yeah, they're all your ten oh, five okay. inch squares. And then I have given you these borders. <gasps> they are beautiful. Like you said, for strips on the back of cushions, yes. or borders on, on 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 cushions or bags. Or edging. Look at me round yeah. quilts. If you get a couple of these, you've got your edging. Yeah. Make a huge quilt because if you get this and then you get your forty squares. Oh, this could be bindings. Can okay, you, you got your forty squares. They'll go with it. And then you get your feature panels as well. Oh, good idea. So if you got the feature panel, um, the variety panel, and your 40 squares. Which are those? How much are we looking? That's 17 99 That's £15. And this one's £10. I mean, we're still looking for a whole, for all of this coordinating fabric, you're still under £45. It's amazing, isn't it? And you, I mean, that is enough, Bella. I mean, that, you're looking at enough there then to yeah. create a really good sized quilt. Now, in the Spring Birds range, we have a new panel. Okay. Okay, that can actually add on to this. Right. And it's the 30 squares, not right. squares, rectangles. rectangles. Yeah. Oh, is this the one that's in yes. the cushion? Yeah. Oh, brilliant. We'll do that after these two. Everybody who's got these, we've got the variety panels in the different colors as well. This is in the pinks. Your variety panel, which it can, has all of... Oh, in fact, actually, have I got the... Uh... No, this is tote bag. Oh, we've put the tote bag in. We can talk about the tote bag. We can talk about... Oh, do you want to do the variety? Just do the variety. 
There you go. There we go. Found it. It's no. NK. No. Where's the variety? What's the variety? <laughs> Have we only got the one colourway in the variety? Oh, sorry, yes, because we've got this one. Right, that makes That's sense. That's a confusion. Right, if you want your variety, confused. get the yellow. Get the yellow, get the yellow. So, we can go back to the one that you were looking at, sorry, Ben, which is VHUU80. Which is the tote bag. Now, this is a tote bag for oh, the birds. You turn it into a dress like Jenny's done. Well, this Think outside the box. You have got fabrics galore. Jenny actually turns in, we, it was the dress that's behind us, the bag from the fairy panel, the tote bag panel with the fairy designs into a dress, which is amazing. This does have your full instructions on here of how to create it into the most, I mean, we can't even call it a tote bag. It's the most luxurious tote bag I've ever seen, Debbie. Well, you could <laughs> stretch it, a reversible bag. I love reversible bags. So you've got the d three different designs. So you've got that one on this side. Yeah. You've got that one on that side. And then you've got the blossom pink blossom and then you've got the feathers and this is almost like a reversible bag with a pocket so you've it got is. two pockets on there and this looks Fantastic. just as nice look at that uh but then again if you want to use your own fabric for your lining yeah you've then got three tote bags out of this one exactly. panel for or a dress. or a dress yeah i mean look at the size of that less than 20 pounds you've even got spare fabric here this is classed as your um pocket um pocket lining if you want to use it or i'd save that but saying this it is nice to have a fancy lining that you see isn't it i think it's a designer bag and it's yeah. if you're doing it for somebody as a gift yeah it's really or special. giving the panel as a gift because these this is what i love about these panels is if you're a beginner like myself, you can follow the instructions and create this. Yeah, we've all got those friends who probably are now saying to you, oh, Debbie, I want to learn how to do that. Yes. G gift them the panel. It's got the instructions there, ready to go at 19.99. And you don't need any interfacings. You don't need anything else. You've got your sewing machine and some thread. You're ready to go. Oh, this is a new one. Ah, right. Now, you've called this 30 rectangles. I need to come up with a we name. We need to come up with a name for it because... <laughs> it's literally... I suppose the thing is, this is so versatile, isn't it? It is. Once again, you could use this as constructions on a quilt. We never use rectangles. I mean, this is such a great... So is that bad? Because no. we, we thought it'd look nice. It does look nice. It does look really nice. But it's not something you see as a pre-cut. You normally have, you know, like your squares or your we strips. We just thought that you can make it stripped down for quilting. Yeah. You can double it. You can treble it as well. Yeah. And then the other thing that we've done, because the first time we did this was with the fairies. And yeah. so this is the second time we've done this design, as in this range. And this time you have got 10 different designs, two of each, no, three of each. Because it's 30. I mean, that is so lovely, isn't it? And we put the pink and the yellow in here because they do work together. We've got, and Bella's on the demonstration she's doing today, she's doing quick quilt. I love quick quilt. Yes. And we've actually made the section in the middle wider because we've learned that it needs to have a decent size. Yeah. And so essentially on this. Yeah. Large, we called it conservatory cushion. Yeah, lovely we've big quick statement quilted, cushion. But then what we've done is we have used on the top bit, we've used the variety pack. Yeah. And then at the bottom, we've used the 40. Right. So you can create cushions, you can do quilts with it. They look amazing. I'm thinking even, you know, for bag makers, if you want to use these as pockets or curve the bottoms and that could be the flap on you know on a on a bag yes so that would be really nice because we, we again we don't see this shape so think of something that's elongated that you're going to be able to use this as a feature please let us know message in what are you thinking you're going to make with this love the bird um feeding table that's so lovely the little bird so house we've got quite a couple of different oh, bird yeah. houses we've got the nest so we've got obviously the teacup we've got options with the different birds on there so as you can see a whole wide range of variety on here which is why it works beautifully with the variety pack oh it's flying out let us know what you're making 14.99 we all love these bird collections and actually I've never seen one quite like this with the spring colours. The lovely lilac tones are really pretty. Well, we put what you know, the blue tits in, but then these are our imaginary birds. Yeah. <laughs> I love them. As a designer, I get to design whatever I want. Bella and I were talking about this. We can literally design anything we want, and this is what we get so excited yeah. about. Yeah. So, on here, who, who, who doesn't want a lilac bird? <gasps> I love it. So pretty. Oh, look at the three little chicks or the little birds there. Go on. That's now 50p a panel, 50p See, a rectangle. that is really amazing, isn't it? To be able to get that out. 
Let me measure them for you. So if you are thinking for bags or... So they are four and a half by... Thinking about <laughs> six and a half. Six and a half inches. Four and a half by six and a half inches. And they are all fussy cut perfectly. Yes. And then you can do what we call the quick quilting if you want to. We've yes. used some wadding. No, we haven't. Yes, we have behind us. Don't ask me which one. Which one is it, Bella? Um, it's a very thin one. It's a polyester. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just but craft wadding. Uh, yeah. And you can do different <laughs> things with it. But the idea behind it is the flexibility. And that's what we've done on this range. We're giving you more choice. Yeah. That's fabulous, isn't it? Are you going to be doing more rectangles then? More yes. panels with rectangles? I know every month you're going to try and bring us something different, aren't you? Every month, every month. Brilliant. Uh, now, I believe you've got this as well in a tablet holder. This was oh, a new design one. that you just... The, I suppose it's things that you use that you think, actually, this would be really useful to do. Yes, because obviously... Look, everybody, tablet. everybody has a tablet. I mean, look at the blossom in this. So we earlier on launched the Vintage Rose collection in the tablet holder. These are brand new designs today. Um, and it's so, so simple because you literally take your pair of scissors and cut all the way around the edge. Every single part is labelled, the handle, the base. You can see there the sides, the side panels. You've also got spare fabric here. Um, and then all of your instructions and a diagram of how to assemble it. And then it creates this lovely... And it honestly, <laughs> even if you've got, uh, you know, with a curved, with a curved um, shape, it's still simple to do, Bella. Yes, I mean, it's not sort of going, going in and out and in and out. You're not wiggling around. You're literally, it's a very gentle curve. So, obviously, when we've been learning to sew, we, we, you initially start with your straight lines. I'm still and on that's straight lines. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thing to do but gradually as you get more comfortable you you can actually move the fabric a little bit easier and it's a very straightforward curve it's a very gentle curve and it's then a literally a case of assembling the side panels and putting the top and the bottom together and it's it's yeah very very straightforward I wouldn't have been able to design it if it wasn't that straightforward and working in yeah. a very which easy way which we need to say thank you to our friend Alan Yes. yes, so if you're watching, thank you, Alan. <laughs> Alan? Yes. How, what's Alan's input then? He He's basically, been... when I told him last year, I've known him for years, when I told him that I was thinking of going onto Sewing Street and bringing out fabric, he was so excited and he goes, Debbie, you have to do a tablet cushion. I'm like, why? <laughs> <laughs> and this has been going on, so it's taken us probably a year yes to design yes. this okay because we because it's not that straightforward when we not yeah. we not sewers yeah. so we we put it on our list of things to do and he's like because everybody has a tablet yeah and i and everybody needs one to put something on yeah and not only look at the price for it to be able to create this as a gift okay and you know if you don't know what to give somebody give somebody yeah. It's got a little pocket on it as well, hasn't it? Yep, it's got a pocket as well. Could you put your phone in? Or, for example, this is the one that we did earlier. Bella's got some pen in there. And it's used the, uh, the beads that we have on mm -hmm. the show, the pellets, and some wadding on this one. Do you know, I actually need this at the moment. My little twins, they're obsessed with opening and closing the door. I'd have that as like a little nice doorstop. Have wait, it to wait. keep my door open so they're not I mean, trapping their fingers. Bella's laughing because we are designing some doorstops. Oh, are you? Yeah. <laughs> we it's were... got a nice little handle, hasn't it? I know, but yeah. we, we thought we'd design shaped doorstops oh, okay. so, we, uh, so yes of course you can but I would tend to use this to put your tablet on it yeah it's, that's what it's, it's, it's for designed that. for that and it's got a little pocket for your phone or whatever you want to put in there and it literally is so easy so you sit and watch sewing street whilst you're sewing watching tutorials yeah. or yeah exactly so you get everything on there you get the instructions uh, we've even got the diagram on there, so showing you how to put everything together. Brilliant. Uh, now, we also have two more. These are the cushions, okay? So okay. we've done the cushions, and we've got two different types. Right, let me just move these up. Oh, by the way, if you are making the... Um, oh, I've just put my finger through that, and they're all going to fall out. Oh, there everywhere. they are. They are. <gasps> oh, no! We need to sell a tape over the top of it. But anyway, if you do want your recycled polythene pellets, then they are available. Oh, I'll leave them like that. Now, we also have... Yes. ...these two beautiful cushions. So we've got birds, and then the other one has got birds. the birdhouse. So we've got birdhouse and birds. Okay, now these are cushion panels. So you've yes. got your front of your cushion. Of course. 
So envelope got, back. Envelope back. You've also got a lovely strip at the I back. I to say, it's not just an envelope back. It's a really beautiful, beautiful yes. designed back. And, and then a choice. A choice of two different ones. And these, were, we put this one on because it's great for doing the quilting yeah. through it if you wanted to. Or keep that if you're going to go. Because it's in those green and lemon collection mm -hmm. of fabrics. So they'll work with all the variety pack and all the different feature panels that we have. And that is just a lovely design. Beautiful. £14.99. So if you are, um, you know, a little bit daunted about cutting and knowing, right, how much fabric do I need to make sure it overlaps properly? You've done that for us. Done it. So this is was my first project. And uh, I said to you in the last hour, my husband didn't believe I did a, a cushion for the yeah. first time. And it took me and I timed myself. And the great thing with an envelope back is you don't need to leave a turning gap. So there's not even any like little bits to sew up. You so, can just yeah, go all the so, way around and turn it through. Yeah, so essentially you just choose which ones you want. Yeah. Put it all in. Okay. And obviously you need to do it like you so. Like hem. Um, hem on both of them. And we've got, we've done two different ones. So you might want to put so two cushions. I do like two cushions, but they're matching but not matching. Exactly. So I picked the colour tones with it. Okay. And yes, it's a made up bird, everybody, but who doesn't <laughs> like the bird? So what I've done is giving you the option. So you have got um, the back, I've matched the back, so at least the back kind of matches, but then the designs on the back are different. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're lovely. Oh, so the feathers, and that's on braid. It's on braid on the feathers, and yet again, you've got the quilting effect on there as well. And is that an addition, or was this a uh, lines that you would have had on the... This one project? already existed, yeah. okay. Um, but what I've done is I've made it a little bit, uh, shade a little bit different. Lovely. So you've got those options. So they are the new uh, spring bird collection. I love the butterfly. Obviously all in proportional to scale. <laughs> <laughs> Giant butterflies. Well, do you know what? I mean, when you think about the flowers, because you can actually, if you go for the other ones, you can uh, uh, plique up or whatever yeah. you want to do. Yeah. If you get the whole collection, this is a big centerpiece, isn't it? Absolutely. Uh, is there anything that you were going to show us with the rectangle? Oh, yes. yes. Oh, I was Bella. going to explain um, the quick quilting techniques. We've talked a lot about it and actually showing you how it works would be a good idea. So this is the rectangle panel with the birds, which is absolutely beautiful. All the different colors, which will work well with all the other pieces. And all I'm going to do is sew down the middle of this grid, which will give it an effect, which looks like I've quilted it, but actually I haven't quilted it. So, mm -hmm. well, I've quilted it in the sense that I'm using the, um, wadding behind right so have you got um anything under the wadding is it just the wadding under it's just the wadding yeah. at the back yeah um oops yeah, yeah hold on sorry <laughs> so i'm literally going to stitch down the middle and actually it will give an effect that looks like it's quilted so that it works really well with the cushion it will be, be a beautiful cushion front well, it looks like you've pieced it all together with yes. the sashing in between. Yes. So that's what I was saying. We increase the sashing in between to yeah. give you that option. Yeah. These are brilliant for anybody who is, um, I, I say anybody that's beginners, but also there are so many sewers that I know out there that love working with different, you know, different shapes. Yes. As, as you say, right, what can I do with this? It's like, um, you know, play ready, steady, cook. Here are all your ingredients. What are you going to make? And for for your lady to make a dress out of the I know. Jenny back did an amazing panel. job. Yeah. So that uh, is on the previous show, and it's still on the website. So yeah, it is gorgeous. gorgeous. Just shows, doesn't it? I mean, uh, fabric. You obviously can then patch together to make whatever you want. Yes. Um, if if it all builds up and and use templates then to cut out you know, dressmaking patterns, it baffles me. But these are the new 30 uh, rectangles that we've just done, but we've yes. done it so you've got the option of doing it in the quilt. I like the idea of creating almost like a seam, large cushion, but you could make them smaller because you could mix the, the 20, sorry, the 40 squares in there as well. And don't forget, you've got that new variety mm -hmm. panel with that as well. This one is flying out, 30, 30 of your rectangles. All ready to go. And how many of you? How many have you got on there, Bella? How many? So have I've got four by three, and we've already um, cut the backing so that we know that it all works together, um, and it will fit the cushion perfectly. But obviously, you've just got to make sure it fits the right size of cushion that you're going to be using. 
But the nice thing about having the, um, it all measured and laid out is that you don't have to do the measuring, you don't have to do the trimming of the edges and sewing it like this is a really quick way to get a really lovely effect. So if you wanted to make a gift very quickly, mm -hmm. yes, I mean, this yeah. is, I mean, making a cushion like this because that everything size, yeah. of that size, or you can make smaller ones. We, we just, you know, I was just thinking. I love a big cushion. Big cushion, yeah. Big plump cushion. But the, also the designs are different. So the, the yeah. 30 rectangles are, have got the pink tones as well, but it goes with the yellow as well. They would be really beautiful to embroider onto if you've got any nice gold metallic thread beads. or if you've got beads. Yeah, yes. that would look amazing in 3D. You know, we just wanted to show you the basis of what you can create with this. So these are some new panels that we started to do, and we are going to be bringing out more of these. We just wanted you to be able to then in the paper crafting world, we have different types of sets that you marry up to create mm -hmm. a bigger piece, which mm -hmm. is why, like mm -hmm. you said, you've got the variety, you've got the actual feature, you've got the actual 40 squares you can do yeah. with quilt. And now we've got this one as well, the new 30, that you can then mix and match with it. Yeah, so many opportunities. So I'm nearly finished um, sewing down the last section, and then it's just a case of assembling the envelope cushion. And I just think it's a, a really nice, quick project, which gives a really good effect quite quickly. It's a real confidence builder, isn't it? When you yes. finish and complete something so quickly, it looks really quality. The designs are beautiful. Yeah. And I do, I, I really think once you've quilted it, it feels very plush, doesn't it, Bella? Yes, I think it gives that sort of element of luxury and sort of... Um, it, it makes it feel like it's an item that you've spent a long time on without actually having to spend the time on it. Um, you know, it's, it's got a lot of um, look for the amount of time, if you mm -hmm. know what I mean. And it looks really luxurious. And then it's the two back panels have, we've done from the variety square, the variety panel. So um, that picture, will yeah. go over the top. And all I've done is I've literally folded over and um, sewn along the edge to make sure that it's neat. Yeah. And then right sides facing, the bit that's going to be at the top, um, sorry, the bit that's going to be on the top on the back goes first. And then this piece, which is the bottom of the envelope, goes second. And then it, all I need to do is um, pin this together and then sew around the edge. And as you say, you haven't got the turning gap. It's the simplest project for someone who's never done any sewing. I mean, as you say, Debbie, it was the first one that it you was. did. And I'm very um, proud of my cushions till yeah. today. Yes. Yeah. It might yes. not have been straight the first time because I kept pressing the pedal so hard and it was going like this. <laughs> <laughs> As you gather, I rush into things and I was no exception. Bella's like, slow down, Debbie, slow down. Yeah. Okay. Debbie, I was afraid you were going to sew through over your fingers. Oh, you know, God. So, so <laughs> fast. But no, but, but I, I love now, I mean, cushions are my favourite thing because I think you can actually change a room. I'm oh, all yeah. about... I'm all about DIY, home decor at the moment. Fully renovating. I'm fully renovating. I've got 32 rooms to renovate, okay? Oh. So, so have you started any of the inside of the house yet? I know you said you're doing the garden at the minute. No, we actually have started the inside, wow. but we've started clearing. Yeah. The chateau's now been emptied five years and everything was left. And are you living in it now? Because I know that when I spoke to you before, you weren't living We are living. It has a spare house. <laughs> I mean, it's just amazing. It's a sheet, okay. It's as a sheet, but it's a, it's a house, essentially. Uh, and so we're living in there while we're actually renovating because although, you know, uh, some of the rooms are okay, they all need decorating. But what, I'm, what I like about the cushions, what I'm saying is you can change the look of the room by putting some new cushions Absolutely. in. Absolutely. So, you know, as much as uh, everybody says, oh, it's the first project, the cushion, cushions I love. Yeah. You can just, you can go. And um, Well, we change have, them seasonally yeah. as sewers, you know, you can just change it as spring comes, put your spring, spring cushions, cushions in. Exactly. So that's my fun. And then obviously I need to learn about piping. Uh, yes. Jill said, good morning. I would use the 30 rectangles as book covers, <gasps> passport know. covers, and adding some from your stash. Yeah, great idea, Jill. That is brilliant. I think you've got the 30, have I got 30 squares? I've uh, got another message come through. Sorry, the, the camera is so far away from me. I can't barely see that. Love everything, using the rectangles for quilt as you go. Absolutely perfect for quilt as you go as well, yes. because you've already got your sash in there ready to go. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Brilliant. 
but I mean, whichever one you go with, it all mixes in. Uh, I started as a card maker after seeing um, Debbie's designs and kits, and now primarily soft crafter, and I'm delighted to see Debbie's designs on fabric. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Who's that? What was the name? That was Michelle. Oh, Michelle, thank you. I mean, that is brilliant, isn't it? There are a lot of people who have followed your journey over. I mean, yes. you say you're 15 years 15 old. 15 years, yes. I started with uh, other channels uh, yeah. 18 years ago, oh, working on TV. But no, uh, and as Debbie Moore designed, 15 years next month. Gosh, that is amazing. And we what have a lots and lots of new products coming out and a fabulous. I'm not going to give too much away, but you're going to love it. <laughs> Oh, very exciting. I do. I haven't seen anybody do rectangles before. And like you say, actually, they're going to be very, very useful. Perfect for purses and packs, sport covers. Call it a postcard panel, somebody said. Oh. Oh, no, that's an idea. That's that is perfect. a really oh, good side. idea. Yeah, yes. someone in Merseyside says call it a po uh, postcard, yeah, postcard panel. Postcard panel. That Please is a on. good... Please, can you ask Debbie to design some pillowcase covers? Pillowcase. Oh, yeah. longer ones. <gasps> okay. Pillowcases. That's a good yes. idea. Yes. I will put that on my list. Because often we've talked about how you can upcycle pillowcases with strips. So if you've got a plain white pillowcase, yes. um, you could put some of these lovely strips on them uh, on the side, yes. applique the bond, and you could upcycle them using your variety pack. But can you imagine if you had, where is it? Is it on this side? Had this on a pillow and then it continue you know yeah. the actual size yeah that would look lovely yes please yes can i can i can do that Woo, thank i you. don't it might i've mean, already it might take well, a bit of time. It might, we, i think we've already got the next few months yeah sorted out it might be about four months time yeah lovely great idea keep your suggestions yes, coming keep, in keep, 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 keep. uh 14 pounds 99 and that's your variety pack which is your no sorry is it your 30 um bird rectangles the postcard that's not panel this one. is the yeah. one that's the new graphic which is the one that bella's working on this how are you getting on bella i am nearly done that's how quick, how quick is. is that so that means she's done a cushion i don't know what 10 minutes so have you just sewn in between each of these green sashing yes. sort of lines there? Yes. Yeah. And the only thing I'd pre-done was I pre-did the hem on the edge of the envelope. Yeah. Okay. But apart from that... So you've now sewn all, all the way around. Yeah, sewn all the way around, pinned it together. And remind us, what um, wadding did you use? Um, it's a very um, it's that thin one there. wadding. Um, in fact... There you go. Over. <laughs> this is this is for a quilt, so you're going to have plenty there to be able to make lots oh, yes. and lots and lots and lots and lots. Yes. But this is another nice one if you are doing any of the quilts. If you've got your three different panels today, this is your poly down premium polyester, only twenty nine ninety nine. It's lovely and sort of lightweight. And if you are using it as a lap quilt or a picnic blanket to take out with you, it's great because it washes really well and it dries very quickly. Yes, and it's it's really perfect for the, this kind of project because it gives you a quilting effect, but you haven't got a huge deep pile on there because you don't need it because you're going to put a cushion inside. Yeah. So, you know, it's yeah, and the best bit about envelope cushions is you don't have to remember the turning gap, which I always forget. And so fortunately, with an envelope cushion... Or it's daunting to think about inserting zips, isn't it? Is it yes, know? I think that's the nice thing, is you can actually create something that's very personal to you and have it in your home, and you've made it, and it's your personal choice. And I think that's what it's all about, is having your choice and your project nice, look at in that. your home. So, I mean, how quick and easy is that? Because of the designs all being done for you... It makes it a really special, like you say, unique project. No one yeah, else is going to yeah. have this fabric. So that's the 30. And then on the back, we've used the variety at the top. Variety at the at top. At the bottom, we've used the 40 squares. Yeah. So you've got three different panels that we've used on there. So um, do you want to just recap the variety squares, Ben? The only way of getting the variety squares in the birds is in this colourway, am I right? Yes, in this colourway. But if you saw the earlier show, we also have them in the vintage florals. On the vintage florals, you can see that you've got um, different... What we try to do is put the 10 across um, in different... Um, you've got different designs that will go with it. We'll yeah. also give you six of the main blocks just here, like so. 
Love it. Okay, and this is what I mean. This, this is what Bella's lovely. used. Yeah, oh. I love that one. And Bella's actually used this section. Your two and a half inch strips. Okay, just part of it to do the back of, to the back of the actual uh, cushion. But they're great about using them in the quilts, aren't they, Bella? I think the nice thing is, is because you know everything is colour coordinated, you can mix and match, you can create your own collection. The thing I th always think of as being really luxury is when things match i want everything to match <laughs> that's my idea of a luxury product i want you know my curtain to match and i want the smaller cushions and i want my patchwork quilt that i'm going to have on my lap i want it all to work yeah. together and you could do that with yeah this. you could look, look there you've got your uh, tablet cushion and then you've got your lean on cushion. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, it is so satisfying, isn't it? <laughs> when you've got your full spring set all ready to go. You can serve at your cushion watching Sewing Street on your iPad or yeah. your tablet, your other one. Um, so anybody who has not got these variety packs yet, they are absolute game changers. They're so versatile because your other option would be to get maybe a layer cake, a charm pack, and a design roll, a design roll, which would cost an arm and a leg, wouldn't it? Trying to be able to get all of these colours that coordinate perfectly. It's done for you in one panel for less than £20, £17.99 for that. Now, speaking of spring, um, the sunflowers that are behind you, Bella, are yes. absolutely beautiful. We've got sunflowers and I believe we've got peonies. We do, we do. Should we start with the feature fabric panel? I believe it's on your side. Yeah, perfect. Now, we've already had sellouts, by the way, on pre-order. So if you've already chopped ahead, well done. Talk to me about this, then. So this is, I mean, these are the feature squares. And as you can see, obviously, these ones are not lined up, so you can go through like so. Yeah. As you go through them... Oh, well, if you want to do this, if you want to have that as one big central sort of lap quilt, just do a zigzag. Do yes. a big zigzag strip, stitch all the way through. And again, it will look like you've sort of pieced it all together. Yeah, and what we've got that is we've got... Obviously, two, you've got four different ones. You've got some with quotes on that you got. I love that one. Let's dance in the sun wearing sunflowers in our hair. <gasps> That's lovely. It's really lovely. Yeah. So these are great. I mean, they're amazing price, everybody. They're a good size that you can actually use in whichever way you want to. These would be great wall hangings as well. You could literally frame them. If you want to embroider over the top of them and put some nice little seed beads in there, they'd make great wall they hangings. They would, wouldn't they? Really nice. Didn't we see earlier on that it was, um, again, one of your ladies who made a storage tub? These yes. would be perfect again if you want so to. So she actually, I mean, you can check they out can the website. Besides. Jenny actually used the fairy one. Yeah, of but these, you could like use this. these, couldn't you? Yeah. Or do them for the storage. I mean, these are much nicer than the ones that you'd buy from the shops, the plain ones. Yeah, these would be absolutely lovely with the panel we've got today. But I must say, a good friend is a blessing from God. I hope your day is as bright as a sunflower. These are really lovely gifts for people, aren't they? Yes, they are. And you can make them into whatever you want. They could, they're good sizes for cushions as well as putting them into your um, quilts. Love it. Absolutely love it. We also have um, the one with the hexes. Oh, this is, looks nice. So this is a cushion. You've got elongated sure. hexes on the back. I am sure... Well, it's a uh, green one. Here. It's the green one now. We are, we've got it in the green. So we've got it in a couple of colourways. Yes, we do. This is the blue. Now, that's your frontier cushion. I mean, look at this. Attention to detail. So this is our faux foiling effect. That okay. we, I love cool. doing that. I just like bling. Yeah. <laughs> bling. So this is what we've tried to actually put it onto fabric as well. And it works. Beautifully. And the reason how it works is because there's highlights on it. Looks gorgeous. So you've got your sunflower, butterfly as the front and then your envelope back just like what we've seen with Bella so so simple to do you've got a choice of two um, backs as well so you've even got spare fabric to use yes um, with your coordinating fabric there and then once again you've still done this yeah, lovely strip on the back I love doing those and I just think it finishes and you've got the ombre effect as well Gorgeous, £14.99 for your cushion panel. Uh, once again, though, you could use this if you would prefer as a feature panel with extra coordinating fabric for whatever you want. Yes, yeah, so you can use it with the feature panels we just had. Yeah, absolutely. Make a huge, huge quilt. Yeah, fabulous. Um, the next one we've got <gasps> Abram. is... Abram. Behind me, the so, apron. Hello, sunshine. Should I bring it forward? Yeah, bring it in, bring her in. Oh, there we go. 
This is a great gardening apron, actually, isn't it? Oh, just it to is. have. I mean, I always think of aprons as when you're doing your cooking. But we, I know so many of our sewers who get covered in threads and always wear an apron in their workroom. That's what we wanted. So we wanted an apron that wasn't just for cooking. Yeah. But we wanted one it's not lovely. just for spring, for just all the time. Love that. And when you see the panel that you actually get. The is it massive? Yes. <gasps> Really good, <laughs> you know, there is actually no line. We've not put a lining on this one, but you yeah. could. Yeah. We've got the blue on today's show or even the cream. Very nice. Plain ones. And then there you go. Thank you. Oh, so, hang on. This is seventeen ninety nine. Look at the size of the panel. It's absolutely huge. So you've got the main body. Yeah. And then obviously if you don't want that, uh, I love that, hello sunshine, you don't want that as your pocket, you could have that as a pocket and just use a plain lining. Fantastic. Then you've got your side ties and your neck ties and the solid colour is absolutely perfect with you. It's all well thought out. And you've also put instructions. Yes. In terms of difficulty level, is this another one that's Again, this simple? Is a, this is a very easy I've start. Do, I've done this one. <laughs> these were the panels that we started when we were starting to learn to sew. Yeah. So these are perfectly doable for someone who is only really just starting but obviously if you want to make it more complicated line it do whatever you want with it change it up if you want to but definitely, definitely. A starting yeah. it was one of my first projects and I then felt like I was on a production line for John Lewis or something making aprons because I kept making loads and loads and loads yeah. for everybody I but that's them. the thing now they're a fabulous gift they and when are. you go to somebody oh I've made this for you they're going yeah. no you didn't yeah. and you're going yes we did yeah. and then the other thing what I love about the apron is we always need aprons, it's, yeah, we do. you know, not that we don't need tote bags, but you know, gardening apron. Now, I mean, I'm now learning to garden, mm -hmm. it's on my list. Me too. Okay, I mean, I want to grow vegetables, which everybody's laughing at me saying, in your, <laughs> when are you going to do that? But this is a perfect apron to have. And so in terms of lining it, how much fabric do you think I'm going to need? It was a metre, um, wasn't it? Yes, it was a metre. Yeah. And, and all you do is it, what you lay out your panel and you lay out the fabric over the top so that you know exactly how much you've got. And then you do right sides facing and then stitch all the way around the outside edge and then turn it out. Yeah. And, and it's as straightforward as that. Oh, I love it. I think sunflowers just bring a smile to your face. And, you know, but what we've done on this one is you've got little the butterflies in as well. Where would I put my uh, pocket? Do you need to work so, out where your hands are going to be? Yes. I mean, the easiest way, obviously, is to, um, when you position the apron, is to think about where you would put your hands, which would be just sort of about two and a half, three inches below yeah. the uh, waist at the back. Okay. Yeah, the so easiest way to position it in terms of measuring it is actually to get the um, apron panel and fold it in half and just fold along the half line which gives you a crease and then do the same with the pocket and line the center line of the pocket mm -hmm. up with the center line of the apron. Do you know what you're going to be doing? You're going to be getting your green machine out and putting like rivets, you know, oh, D-rings. Yes. No, you could absolutely. put a D-ring, couldn't you, and yes. have it as an adjustable, yeah. Yeah. adjustable one. Yeah. Uh, that is now very, very limited. There's more of you have got that one in your basket than we have availability. Perfect for this time of year. Thank you, Kat. We've also got one more sunflower, I believe, and this is another cushion, the yes, green, which I you've got a sample cushion, of. Yes. You made this one. Brilliant. So, uh, I mean, we've all, the team lovers, now, now that we've got Jenny, we've got Nicola, there's you, there's Bella, myself, and we've also uh, we've got some newbies coming in as well. We've converted some paper crafters as well Fantastic. into sewing, and they've started with doing cushions. Yeah, cushion is a good basis to start yeah. off with. And you like Bella's just done that demonstration. You know that looked so complicated, but by having the correct panels, you can create anything. I think that's the key, isn't it? Is yes, if you've got fabric at home, you can create an envelope back cushion, but because the design is also well placed and thought out and specifically designed for the cushion, yes. works so well. So what very, we've very done expensive. on this one is, yes, you've got different designs yeah. and we've got the ombre effect and you've got, oh, I love this one as well. So yeah. there is just, as you can see. And that is exactly as you've done, Bella, yes. before you, but this one, I mean, you haven't done any quilting. Anybody who loves their free motion quilting, you could echo quilt around lots of these elements. That's what we've got to get to. We haven't got there yet. Uh, but the there's, but you could do that at home. Exactly. You wouldn't need any other, you know, abilities. Once you've got your your panel, you absolutely can do that at home. It's amazing it's the versatile. Yeah. I think one of it. the other things about the panels where they've cut squares is actually you're not when you're 
new to cutting out fabric and you want to make sure you get good right angles and that you get lines that so that when you sew from the edge you're not wonky you've got the lines already for you they're already on the panels you're not having to worry about making sure your corners are correct and all of that kind of thing so having the panels to work with the cushions is really good yeah i mean lots of people have been sending uh, messages how much that they've loved this in fact oh. someone sent in a fabulous quilt that they made with the winter fairies oh. joe what oh, do you think wow. debbie that is amazing joe <gasps> That is brilliant. Right, so that was used the cushion palette, uh, panel and a charm square panel, the, f the 40 squares. That's oh, beautiful. that is gorgeous. Doing all of those different Joe, quilting that, blocks. Uh, that must have taken you a long time. It's amazing, that isn't it? That looks so beautiful. Oh, thank you for spending the time sending you But do you know what? Pictures. To me, that's just amazing. Yeah. Okay, that's the first sample I've seen of somebody sending something in. Oh, brilliant, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's very exciting that I've actually laid out and fabric. Obviously, I've been doing this now for 15 years on yeah. paper craft, so I get loads of cards sent to me. But Joe, that's amazing. Oh, we've got to another one. To see it one. though, you know, oh. in people's living rooms, they've all made up. This is from Sue in Tamworth. Oh, it looks like you've put it, is that with some um, batiks as well around the thing? Yeah, 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 <gasps> yeah. That looks gorgeous. They look so they are the rectangle and square cushions that we did for the yeah. autumn fairies. It's gorgeous. Oh, so obviously you'll be liking the spring fairies that we've had. And then there's now just summer fairies, which we'll just have to wait a couple of months for Fantastic. those. Fantastic. Oh, loving well them. Well done. Thank you for the Thank pictures. you. They look amazing. Uh, right, peonies. Peonies are my favourite flowers. I absolutely love them. They're my wedding flowers and they are beautiful. I love so peonies. I've just to see discovered um, three days ago that I've got peonies. Have you? I don't know what colour. Oh, they're going to look beautiful. When did they come out in this, like, July-ish? You'll probably start seeing them. I, I haven't got a clue. Oh, I'm not doing in France. Maybe <laughs> earlier. Um, okay. May. Look at him. Oh, for Alice's birthday. Yeah, I had them 6th of July and they were perfect. So that's why I said July, yes. I don't know, they were lovely. <laughs> he was like, how? How did they last that long? Right, which way? Which, which one, one are we doing? Oh, sorry. Uh, Five, six is this one. I think we have left. <gasps> oh, this lunch. looks gorgeous. Left the oh. green room. Oh, have we? Shall we? Do you want me to give us and go? Yeah, yeah it. fabulous. It's in the grey crate. <laughs> we brought so many Bella's samples. Bella's on the move. She's going to go and grab it. Right. Uh, in fact, let's hold this up because this is again. absolutely huge. So this is the big bag. Is this the one that we showed briefly in the first hour? This it's like what? a big boxy yes. bag. Yes. Yeah. Well, that was with the fairies. This is the peony. Oh, my word. I love it. Okay. And Bella's, we have got a sample, so we'll get it in a second. But I'm look how big I'm on the prices of these panels. That is just £19.99. You've got a lot on there. You've got your lining fabric, your outer fabric, you've got your side panels, your handles, spare fabric there, you've got pockets, pocket linings. So we designed this and then changed it because we thought, right, we are a lady and we have a handbag and we put it on the floor. So we wanted a dark colour yeah. for the base. Oh, that's, yeah. That's so, good. you know, we actually thought about what you wanted. And this is a great thing. As I mean, we've had so much fun designing these panels. Only when you left. actually uh, get them home, follow the instructions, you know, we've given you the diagram. This is a brand new panel that we've designed and Bella's got the designs. There we go. This is so all it's the about purple to one. There we go, look. Oh, beautiful. And obviously, so you've got that base at the bottom that you can see. Yeah, your nice box bottom. Okay, and yes, uh, you can literally, obviously. Well, again, you ha you've done this without any um, interfacings in there. So if you, I quite like having a bag like this folded up within a bag. Yeah. That I always end up buying a bit more shopping than I intended. And to have a nice bag like this instead of a carrier bag that's screwed up in your bag. Definitely. Brilliant. And this was what Bella did. She actually added the interfacing. Yeah, so if you want it more structured. So you can have it more structured. Can. This is the fairies one, which you'll check out the website if there's any left. Of them, but it's the same principle, so you can actually turn it over. Love it. Uh, and I think, did Nicola do this one? Right, did yeah, that is literally I, about to allow. No, I did that one. Did you say you've got it in the pink as well? Uh, Have you got it in the pink? No, it's sold out. Okay. Pink and lilac charm squares and a peony feature panel. Oh, which one? The charm squares we have done. Oh, this is lovely. So you can see here, all front and back, this time with a zip. 
Um, is that on my side? This one here. Thing? Oh, fabulous, thank you. 40 squares in the peony. This is going to be so popular. Isn't that gorgeous? But do you know uh, the lady who sent in the photograph early on of the beautiful quilt? This is where quilters, you know, who work with five inch squares, you can do so many blocks, Deb uh, Debbie, with a, with a, a five inch square, because you can do your half square triangles, you can do flying geese, you can do so many different... Flying geese. There are so many different <laughs> names of different blocks. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, I thought I was doing well with what I'm learning so far, <laughs> okay? You know, just give me a few more months. Cool, like... square triangles, all square triangles, you can do them all. But this is going to be a really great foundation for anybody who is, you know, a wizard quilting up lots of different blocks. Five inch squares are key. But really we, key. what we found about this particular panel is the colour just pops. Yes, it It's does. come across so well. And if you have a look at the detail that you've got in the flower that we've got here, right down to the shading and the center. It's yeah. actually worked so well when it comes to um, using the peony collection with the purples. And we've actually fitted in some ombres in there as also yeah. some what we call solid colors because we're learning as we go, aren't we? Yeah, definitely. I'm just having, I just want to show you. Um, if you just have a look, Pinterest is a brilliant place to go as well. If you put quilt patterns using five inch squares, I mean, you can create literally designs galore, yes. hundreds and hundreds of designs using squares. So if you get yourself a couple of these, just even if you get two of these panels, you can make an amazing quilt. You can make so much Love with it. it, as well as doing like what we've yeah. done. We've done a quilted cushion. Looks that great. That was Bella's first sip, wasn't it? It was, yes. <gasps> Brilliant. <laughs> And that, that looks fab. That looks really good. <laughs> Love it. Uh, right, we've got the other colourway. Whoops. Which is for the pink. Thanking you. I look at that. Oh, look, even with the text, flir, peony. Oh, honestly, when you get this home, there's so many different details that you will notice as you get it back with the ombre fabrics, the lovely stripe. And then you'll find cotton. that I've put the faux foiling in as well. Love this that. As well. yeah. A little bling. A little bit of bling. And we've, we've kind of... As we do every month, we're learning new things. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we're already planning next month's super duper ranges of panels, yes, aren't we? Which is really exciting. So <laughs> we, we're finding it as we're learning our journey as sewers. Um, and it's all about time and what yeah. you can spend on it. And this is why we, you know, you as much as we have a lovely team helping with samples, we like to make sure that everything works. Yeah. Oh, it's going to look fabulous. Whatever you're making with your five inch squares, go for it. It's only £14.99 today. So we have used those squares in a second with the next yeah, item. In the bag. Okay. So this is the peony. Look at that. Oh, I love this. Again, with the beautiful quotes on. Friendship isn't one big thing. It's a million little things. Yes. So look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Now, yes. using just this one here and the squares, Bella has quilted this bag. Beautiful. So you've got, there you go, the front and there are the charm squares. Amazing. So you've got everything all coordinating with your uh, nice pink lining as well. I mean, as we said, these would be brilliant for cushions, for the fronts of bags, for the storage tubs. There's lots of ways we've used these feature panels yes, just in the definitely. few examples today. I mean, there's so much, and the, the purple is so vibrant with all the. De I know, I love that's purple. very clever. And the pearls as well. I can't believe how you've transferred that so well onto fabric. I try so hard with this. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, what we're going to do now? Everything is there now. Everything is underneath us on the website. So we are going to do a full sort of recap okay recap if that's okay of the, of new, the new ones in. so a 10 minute crazy <laughs> uh, for anybody who missed out on that first hour go on ben shout codes at me six four thank you the hour that we're on now spring birds six four <laughs> they're over here <laughs> We'll try and go as quick as we can, Ben. You've got to shout codes at us, and I'll um, I'll try and find them. We've got them, we've got them, we've got them. Gorgeous. Oh, beautiful. Your Isn't spring that birds. <laughs> we will go quicker. 
So as you can see, you've got the four different squares on there. We've gone with the pink and the blue color tones. And on this one, what I've done is I've taken the almost like the dark stage down because I was thinking it looked great when you actually put it in a quilt. You've got the fold over extra on there. And with this, you'll find it goes with the uh, 40 squares quite a lot. Fabulous. Right, so we've also got H09. It must be on your end. Oh, no, I've got it here. This one is the oh, it's those the lovely, lovely lemons. Birds. Lemons and greens. Do you have lemon trees? Um, not that I know of yet. I found, I I found a fig tree. Oh, did you? This is amazing. I find it, you know. How exciting. It is exciting. Um, so this one, yet again, what we try to do is do four different images that we've got on here. And we have got the lemon and that lovely olive green look on there. Beautiful. Brand new in today. And look at the lovely, again, foiling the gold on the on the, uh, the, the, the teacup. Looks so beautiful, doesn't I it? I do like the bling. <laughs> yes. A Bingo. Bingo. Oh, this is the 30... So, the postcard panel. Yes, we're going to rename this 30 rectangles, but I think postcard panel will be a great name for it. Uh, we had great ideas earlier on. Lots of people were we're going to be using it for passport holders or purses. We had people who were going to be using it for flaps on bags. What other ones were there? There were. You could uh, make um, book covers. Book covers, that, that was, was it. it. Cushions, adding it into your yeah. quilt. She gave Bella you made this different cushion sizes. using it. She did that quilted foe, the quick quilt effect. Love that. She created what I call my conservatory cushion. I think it's the first time we've ever done rectangular panels like this, though, ever. And you've just seen how easy it is. If you do a four by three, you've still got your lovely square. For, oh, we've um, been told that's yes. enough. Next. <laughs> Two eight. It's like a game, isn't it? Snap. I haven't got it. Got it. You got it. Bingo. So this looks like, oh, look at that. <laughs> this is our gorgeous uh, cushions. Envelope cushion. So you've got your front and then you've got your two for the back and then a bonus one as well. So you've yes. got spare fabric to use there. You just thought, why not? We don't want to just leave it plain. No, so you might as well give us extra great. designs. So and that's in that lovely colour again. The so lemon, it's all going to yes. match in. Then look at the detail. That is the detail in there, isn't it? So it's the brush strokes. These look like they've been hand painted. But they've all been hand, hand drawn. drawn. Have they? They've all been hand drawn, and then we put it on the com as in on the computer. Yeah. So to give you all the detail. <gasps> Love that. Nine five. Must be your yeah. side. <laughs> I've just realised I've still got my three-year-old put stickers on my nails <laughs> yesterday, and I've still got them on. If you get to see them, they're lovely. <gasps> yeah, so chic. Right, this was your bird house. Bird house, house same kind of. So you, you do the two cushions, two cushions. Like we just saw those lovely cushions. Okay. Yes. This will look lovely, the two together. Oh, I, I mean, it's, it's the detail on the back, isn't it? Yeah. We always use planes and solids on the back. Right. And like you said, Bella, exactly. You want them to look luxurious. luxurious. It elevates it, doesn't it? And for a beginner sewer, you don't want something that looks childish. Do you know what I mean? Like, even when you're starting out, you don't want something that looks Listen, really basic. If my own husband didn't think that I'd made a cushion, OK, that just shows you the quality of the fabric that yeah. you're getting well, and it. the design to give you that wow factor straight away. Yeah, brilliant. Um, EP. Thank you. It's your end. I'm winning. You're winning. <sighs> ah! This ah is why is it taking me so long to open it? There we go. The, Sorry, this quickly. This is a tablet cushion. It's the one that's on the front of the desk there. You can see it already made up. You can balance your tablet on the top and it's all nice and squishy with pellets and with um, toy stuffing. Did you say yeah. that you put in yeah. there? Yeah. Then put that in there. Fabulous. And it's fab. That's great, isn't it? You don't get you don't get the tablet though. No, that's, <laughs> <mine. laughs> that's really useful. Uh, and as you say, we all have a uh, different device, a, a different tablet, don't yes, we? Definitely. It can be a nice gift for somebody. And we do have them in two other ranges from this morning as well. And the, all of the instructions are printed onto them. So if you haven't made anything like that before, go for it. Okay. So then we have this one, which is just our. 40 squares. Oh, 40 squares. Remind me, how many of the designs do I get? You get 20 different ones, two of each. Perfect. Okay, and you can see that the scenes, you've got the babies 
in the nest and then obviously you've got them in the bird house and of course I had to put a teacup in there okay <laughs> and yet again you've got the detail that matches all of it and it goes across the whole range it's really good that you've got a, a mixture of you know different scales of print as yes. quoting it, it adds interest to the eye doesn't it when you've got lots of different, you've got solids and polka dots and all sorts, gingham prints on there. That's lovely. There we okay. go. So then we've got the same in the pinks and blues. You liked this one, didn't you? I did. This I, would this, be good first baby as it, well. Absolutely. I think this would make a really nice little change in or play mat. You know when you've got a new little baby taking them out in the spring and summer to be able to just have a lay on the, in the park? It's so pretty. I mean, yet again, it all matches with the other coordinating elements that we have, the feature panels. Uh, GQ10 on this side. So this is the brand new variety pack. Panel. These are game changers. I think I, I wouldn't be surprised if these have been the most popular actually, because you've got a mixture of everything there. Yes. If you've never bought from you before, this is a good way of trying it yeah. out actually. So this has obviously it's smaller main features. Okay, you got six of them. We got four of them, and then the two of the actual patterns of the fabrics, and then you've got the ten across, and then you've got the strips across the end on there. So, I mean, this is so versatile. You can make lots of little projects with this. You could do little coasters and you can do wall hangings, all sorts. There'd be lots of, um, lots of people grabbing those. Yeah. I've got the same again, I believe. Oh, no, you know, this, this is, is the bag. Bag, bag slash dress. dress. Yes, Jenny, <laughs> you have converted me to say now, every time I see a tote bag, it can be turned into a dress. That amazes me. And when you bought the dress through, I was like, oh my gosh, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a designer dress. So Imagine you, doing it in the birds. I know. So this is quite cool, everybody. <laughs> so you have got on here um, one luxury bag, as Bella would say, okay? But also you can split it and you can make it stretch and create up to three bags. Brilliant. Instructions are there for your reversible tote bag, really, isn't yep. it? So now, now, going back to all the first that on hour. on your side. So we have got, like, from the quilt right down to these gorgeous, I can reach, Bella's new panel. This one's QV um, UU61. So these are those lovely vintage. Yes, the vintage florals. Flowers. Okay, so you've got it in mint or would you say um, almost like um, the greener vintage green with the purple. They're your big feature panels, but we do also have, and we did say it would be a great idea if you can afford to do so today, for less than £45, you can get the feature, you can get the 40 squares and, and the variety, variety pack for under £45, which for me just baffles me. This is QCUU12. They're your 40 squares, which go with that feature panel. And that makes it very, very versatile to be able to have lots of possibilities. Because let's face it, if you know something's really, really popular, like the Spring Ferries, we bought them back, but yes. you've got so many designs and you're planning so far ahead, the likelihood of us bringing these back is slim. It is very so slim. So you need to grab them whilst you can now. Um, then, then we also the, the have variety the same yeah, the, the variety. variety. So then it'll work with those. So then it's upside down, there we go. Your strips, your squares, and your feature blocks. Yeah, so that would work. So those three would work together with these ones. Ideal. Go for it. And if you get all three of those, it's still costing you less than fifty pounds, which amazes me. Amazing. Right, we got three minutes. Okay, you, quickly. You. So we're going to go with the pink squares. Yeah. Right. And then we've got yet again with the forty squares. You've got the twenty designs twice and as you can see it'll go with the next one which will be the feature panel that we we'll show you pkuu59 for your squares which is like the equivalent of your charm pack and then this is lzuu27 okay and look at that gorgeous pinks vintage pinks vintage greens that will go together and you can create it with your variety panel this is bxuu10 for your two and a half inch strips, your five inch squares and your feature squares as well. I would absolutely grab all three. I can't recommend that enough. And then we have got, oh, we've got two more. We've got our lovely toiletry panel. Okay. And it ends in 7.9, DMUU 7.9. These and are huge. Huge, huge. You can create 
a water bottle bag, you've got a makeup bag and a toiletry bag. And we've got the samples here very quickly. It's like one of those games. Art the Generation game. Is that this? <laughs> okay. Hope you can remember every single one of these codes and every one of these <laughs> no, items. No, I can't, OK? But then we've got it in a different colour. We've got the lovely China blue, so it's a lighter option. Same principle, you've got them on there. And then we've got two more panels. I want to be on your team on Supermarket Sweet. You've been brilliant. <laughs> two panels. Well, I've been told I've got like a minute. Uh, we need to show the you tablet the tablet holders. holders. And these are just fabulous, everybody. You've got two colour tones. That's in the lilac. And your instructions are included. They're printed onto the panel. That's in the lilac. And then Ben's personal favourite is the lovely mint green. Yeah, so we wanted to give you two options on that because, I mean, they're great. I mean, you said you'd put them as a doorstop, but I mean... <laughs> Sorry, I hope that hasn't offended you because they are beautiful. Two no, no, nice no, no. It doorstop. was funny because we are doing some doorstops right. next. That's really lovely. Um, and I love the colour tones as well. They're beautiful. Again, all match in with your vintage rose collection. Right, we did it. We've, We've done it. All. That was a quick pit stop <laughs> through everything. But definitely go back through underneath us on the website if you're watching on any replay and have a look what is available. You're back off to France tomorrow. Just I am. Um, I'm back here, though, with Belle and I back here on the 4th of May. 4th of May. Fabulous. May the 4th be with you. <laughs> yes. And we'll see, you, um, we'll see you then. Thank you ever so much, Bella, as well. Thank Lovely you. to see you. Thank you for your demos. Thank After the break... You've got to watch Dave Green yes. because yes. Bella's just invested. She just bought one on her website. She was like, right, I've just got one of these machines. I need to now know yeah. what I'm doing. So um, she started putting in magnetic class and everything. We're going to yep. go through everything with Dave. So stay tuned. He's going to be here for an hour and a half special. So all your questions will be answered. We can go through absolutely everything that you need to know. So stay where you are. Thank you ever so much. Bye. We'll see you after this. <laughs> Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app. Head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. Not only is Sewing Street live from 8am till 1pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Sewing Street app, now Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754, which means there are more ways to watch your way with Sewing Street. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Sewing Street, we only charge one P&P throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is £3.95. Charges may differ for outside the UK. 
or upgrade to our premium option for £5.95 on certain items. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Did you know that we can deliver to over 20 different countries worldwide, spanning four continents from the UK to Australia? Check out our website for the list of countries and delivery costs. Sewing Street, stitching the world together. And we'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Bye. Did you know that you can continue shopping 24 hours a day, seven days a week, even after we've finished broadcasting live? Just head over to www.sewingstreet.com for thousands of sewing supplies available from top brands. You still pay only one PMP with split pay available on certain items and an easy checkout service too. Plus, you can get expert advice and tips from our Sewing Street hub and UK customer support is available 24-7. So head over to sewingstreet.com and continue your sewing journey. Did you know at Sewing Street that on various products we offer split pay? That means on certain items you can spread the cost over two, three, four or sometimes even five interest-free monthly payments. Just pay the first instalment when you purchase and you're away. So shop your way with split pay. Shopping with Sewing Street couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.sewingstreet.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your sewing room essentials to fabrics, sewing machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Sewing Street app. Simply head over to your app store and search Sewing Street. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Sewing Street. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Sewing Street app. Head over to your app store now and search Sewing Street and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching on the go with Sewing Street. Hello, welcome back, welcome back. Do you know what, today's been like this lovely seamless blend from one show into another because we've been talking about the green machine all day with Debbie and uh, I believe you've actually been doing like workshops out in the green room. Yeah, in the we've green been doing room. magnetic clasps and press studs and everything else like that out brilliant. there. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I must say, Dave, welcome back because I have seen, since the last time that we met, the amount of people that have come up to me and like, I've, I've got a green machine, I've got a green machine. And it's um, with dressmakers, yep. it's with bag makers, it's with people who do home furnishings. It's not necessarily um, people who sew for a profession, it can be people who are hobby sewers, yeah, but absolutely. also people who do sew for a living use the green machine. Yep, and, and people who are, are traditionally used hand tools and things like that mm -hmm. have then seen this in action yeah. and seen how much easier it is. And each time we come on, we sell out. So uh, oh, I yeah. keep bringing more and we Thank keep you. selling out. So. Yes. So for anybody who has never seen the green machine, don't worry, because we've got a whole hour and a half special with Dave. So we can answer all your questions. We can go through everything really thoroughly. We can do full demonstrations. So please, please do get in touch with us while we're live and interactive. Because as Dave has said, every single time this has been to air, and it's been six weeks since we last saw mm -hmm. Dave, it was for our birthday show. Um, it completely sells out. So today is the day. If you have been maybe watching those shows or if you've been on the fence or you're thinking, right, I've never seen this before, get your questions in. 
So, first of all, we're going to introduce the Mega Bundle. Now, personally, I think that is the the one to go with because yes you can buy the machine on its own today but then you're going to have to go and source your bits and bobs whereas yeah. you've put together a mega bundle which is going to be a great starter pack it's a great starter pack it covers the absolute basics we've chosen the right sizes that everyone really needs to use um and it's just got everything there that you need to get started so once you get it Take everything out of the box and away you go. Okay, so the silver colourway is in. T tell us, first of all, what is the green machine? <laughs> I mean, it's it's a weighty bit of kit, isn't it? It looks very industrial. If I were to see this in a shop, for example, I would be like, oh, I'll steer clear of that. I don't really know. It looks very, very, you know... It's not that scary. Industrial. It really is your friend. So, yes, <laughs> it is very sturdy. It's very heavy. It's five and a half kilos. You don't want to drop it. Okay. Um... But it's built to last. You'll buy one of these, that's it. That's all you ever need to do. The green machine itself is a press. Um, what makes it and sets it aside from everything else is the variety of die sets that you can get with it as well. So it's versatility, how we've created the dies to have a, a range of functions okay. um, and to decorate everything that you're doing and add some pizzazz to things. Fabulous. So, yeah, I mean, I, I personally for... Bags, if ever you've sewn a strap on a bag and you've got to do like a little square with a little cross going through to, to make it more durable by using rivets, by using, uh, you know, different snaps, it's going to make it one look more professional, but two last longer as yeah, well. Yeah, and, and, and a lot of the times a lot quicker to do as well. And how easy is it to use? As I say, it does a very sort of industrial, the, the spring itself, it is spring loaded, isn't it? So the press itself, yep, so, you don't so, need to be... No, Popeye. no, not at all. So, so literally, when you get the machine, um, the only thing you need to do is you take it out of the box and you put the handle on. Okay. So the handle's the only thing that's detached from it. So you put the handle on, um, and there's a small bolt that goes through. Once you've located that, you'll then get with it as well this foam handle here. Right. Just makes it nice, a little bit easier just nice. to push <laughs> down. Great. Yeah, exactly. Um, and when you come to put that on, just a little bit of washing up liquid just around the rim, and that slides on really nice and easily, okay? Brilliant. And then that's the there. Um, and then that's it. And then once, once you've got that then set up, so position it really where you want to, you can lift it and put it yeah. where, somewhere where you want to if you want to. And you can, if you really wanted to, bolt it down as okay. well. So if you have so a designated a permanent fixture. work room. Yeah. I, I've got a feeling that this is something that you might buy today as a sewer and a crafter and somebody else in your household or your family <laughs> are going to be using it for all sorts. So, Mega Bundle, what do we get? So, there are a number of different colours, but ultimately... You will get, what have we got there? So you Thank will you. get in the various different colours, 100 of the rivets. Mm -hmm. You'll get 10 of the magnetic clasps and 10 S-spring press studs as well. And then along with that, you'll also then get the, um, the dies to then go along with those as well. Brilliant. So a die set for the rivets, a die set for the magnetic clasps and then for your S-spring press studs, plus then also your hole cutter that you'll use for all three of those. So if I buy the machine on its own, it comes like this, basically. You don't get the die cut, the uh, the, the hole cutter, do you? No. So, so your best, I think, personally, to get your bundle, you've got your hole cutter, you've got your dies, and you've got the three probably most popular... Yeah. Fastenings or, you know, the, the rivets are very popular. A lot of people put rivets in once they've got a green machine. Yeah. So, yeah. so certainly the ones that you'd start off yeah. with. Um, that you'd use on lots and lots and lots of different products. And then we've got some additional bundles that we'll show you later on that will add some extra pizzazz. Now, they are $149.99, and that is your mega bundle today. This is the one, as Dave says, that sells out time and time again. The benefit from getting it today from Sewing Street is that it's on three-way split pay. So all you need to pay today is that one post in packaging as well, and it is a weighty bit of kit, as we said. So if you've already bought one of the panels with Debbie Moore, you have paid your PMP. So all you pay today is $49.99. If your PMP is paid, you are not paying any more for the postage, even though this is coming from you, isn't mm -hmm. it? Uh, so, and, and I can imagine it costs more than $3.95. It does cost, it does cost a little bit more, and, and you'll get it within a matter of days as well. Fantastic. I mean, it's all ready to go. Three split pay, $49.99 interest-free split payments. I am welcoming in your questions and your queries. We're going to see this in action. We're going to show you each of the elements as well, how to change the dies, etc., how to look after it. Is there anything that I need to do to 
maintain it because obviously there's nothing sort of computerized it's something that you buy once and i suppose that's it it's yeah ab absolutely buying. so something that we do get asked fairly often there isn't really a lot that can go wrong with it mm -hmm. um it, it's simplicity is is one of its great benefits very very occasionally you may just want to put a little bit of oil around that shaft just to keep it nice and free but other than that no, that's it it's plain sailing I love my green machine. No more loose fittings or dented hardware as I don't uh, as. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Get back on the screen. I don't know how uh, I ever managed before I own one. It's a game changer. Yeah, I want messages like this as well, because it makes our job very, very easy when we just have loads of messages of I love my green machine. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, so. Shall we see it in action? Yeah, absolutely. How do I set it up then? So it comes in the box, I'll put the handle on, and then I need to put the dies. Yes. So, so if we start with this one, so the first die that you're going to have to use is this hole cutter. Okay, so let me just show you the hole cutter. So this is a three millimeter hole cutter. Okay, so that comes with the um, brass base. Okay. okay, and then a three mil hole cutting blade. And as I said, the three mil hole cutter you generally use for anything that's got a post. So that covers the rivets, the magnetic glass, and your S-spring press studs. Right. Okay, so the base die literally just drops in like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then this will then just screw in to the top there. Okay, and then if we get some material. So on this, now, what, 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 sort of, what sort of what sort of fabric is this that you're going? So we, we can use a variety of things. Nice. So so that's a yeah. really thick, yeah. like PU. So we've got some cork there as well. I've got some vinyl. Is there anything you use... can't really go through fabric wise? Um, fabric wise, you're you're pretty okay. Really, really fine fabrics. Um, you'd want to sort of bulk them out a little bit, yeah. maybe depending that's on what it is that you're using. Okay. Um, but no, there, there really yeah. is no limits to what you can do. Fab. Yeah. So what would you like to use for a starter? Oh, I want to see this because this is actually probably the most yeah? sort of, I would say that would be very testing to do, to put a hole through if you didn't have a green machine. Yeah, absolutely. If you have an awl or something. You'd, yeah, that you're yeah. going to struggle with that yeah. one. So the thing to remember is be really gentle with this hole cutter. Okay, it's, it's sharp, it's delicate. Yeah. It's not sharp that it's going to cut you, okay. but it, it's fragile. And if we stamp it down, we're going to damage it. Okay. okay, so we just bring the blade down nice and gently, just so it's got a little bit of tension there. And then we just push through so we get that okay. nice little click. Yeah? yeah, give that a turn, make sure it's free. And there we go, we can see, oh, where are we going? Um, bring it back uh, over to, to you. There we oh, go. Yeah. So we've got a nice hole there, yeah, a nice clean hole. And you didn't use a lot of pressure there, did you? No. No, just do another hole again so you can just see so, Dave, how, look, how so picture literally, picture. Oh, very nice, Holly. Yeah. Very little go, pressure. Go. It's Fantastic. really, really nice and, and simple. And that's made a really nice clean hole as well. Yep. You're not stabbing it with your scissors or you're all trying to make a... Um, no, and you don't even have to grip the handle hard or anything like that. You can just lean in. Right, so anybody, you, you know, who has it. got yeah. those sort of dexterity issues or struggles Absolutely. with certain pliers, then this could be a, 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 yeah. an answer to it. Absolutely. What would you like to fit? Um, right, let's go rivets first. Rivets. Now, how many rivets do you get in the kit? So you get a hundred rivets. Now right. these, these are... These are silver, by the way. We have also got the bronze and, and the, the gold, gold which well. we'll introduce as we go forward. Okay, so so these are double cap rivets. Yeah. Ooh. So we have... There you go, you position that. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Um, so we have the rivet there with the post and then the one with the cap. Yeah. Now these are eight millimetre in size, and that means that the post length on them is around about seven millimetre. Now mm -hmm. the benefit of these is when you use double cap rivets and when you use them with the green machine, those two caps you can push down so they actually end up touching each other. So no matter how fine your material is, yeah. you're gonna get a really nice tight fit. Lovely. Okay, so now we've got our holes. We're gonna change that die over. And we're going to use our rivet die. Mm -hmm. So, and the dies are now, they're cut out specifically for that size of rivet. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that means that we get a nice, tight, clean finish and the, the rivet isn't dented at all yeah. when we go to put it in. Okay, so we put the post through the material. We put that in there. If we do it this way. 
put that cap on. Okay, that has a little bit of a click. We find that, and then we just push, push that down again, and again, just enough there. And there we've got our rivet. I mean, that without is... Without any dents, without yeah. any problems at all. Because your alternative would be maybe using some sort of bashing hammer, bashing hammer. them, and, and, and then you'd end up potentially scratching or damaging the top of your rivet, whereas that has given it a really lovely clean... Well, I, I, I'm presuming this is used in industry. This is something yeah. that you would use so, in so professional. Th th this machine would be used from home crafters all the way up to fashion houses and industrial places yeah. as well. Yeah, absolutely. And so that is now sturdy. That is fixed. That's the one thing that I would say is make sure that you're happy with where it is because this is something that is going to give you that... That's the reason we love it, is that it is sturdy. But yeah. it's going to be very difficult to get that out. That's, that's it now. It is very difficult <laughs> to get it out. It is possible. It, I mean, occasionally we do get asked, I put it in the wrong place or I've done something else with it or I didn't realise that's what I wanted to do. If you get some wire cutters, yeah. and as long as you can just get it underneath that lip there, and then you can just cut that through. So you need to cut through that post. Wow. Be very, very gentle with it. OK. Though. OK. Uh, now, should we go on to another colourway? And we could do one of the yep. S-springs or the magnetic clasps. Just to remind you, the silver is absolutely flying. That will sell out first, is my prediction. We haven't got endless bundles of these. We've tried to stock as many as we can with Dave, but just be aware that... Repeat shows like this are brilliant because we have a lot of obviously new people who have never seen the machine before, but we also have a lot of people that have potentially been watching, sitting on the fence, might have a birthday or might think, right, I've watched enough, I'm definitely going to go for it. And I think it's one of those things that actually I realised when Hayley West was um, showing me hers and she was saying, I didn't realise just how much I would use it. I knew I'd use it for my bag making, but actually I'll use it for this and this and this and this. And I thought, yeah. It becomes your go-to. Yeah. Yeah, really, really does. I was just watching um, Bella doing her demo, putting in magnetic snaps, and it just looks so professional as well, doesn't it? It gives the, it gives the perfect finish. Yeah. And it is so, so simple to do. Um, and, and with the magnetic class as well, you know, that they're, 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 these are double cap ones as well, so they're really, really versatile. And you pick really fantastic quality mm. ones that obviously go with the right dyes as well. Mm. Um, we had a message come in from Bev in Bristol. Love my machine. I would recommend labelling them all up so you know what goes where. Dave was very helpful when I needed advice. That is a great shout, and that's exactly what Hayley West did. She got one of those boxes. Do you know when I say the... Um, hemline spool boxes i'm sure she used mm -hmm. one of those that she put all of her different rivets and things and then had i've got a label maker and i love it <laughs> and she literally labeled yeah. her dies so she knew exactly which ones yeah it's perfect yeah. <laughs> absolutely if you ever do get confused or get them muddled up then give us a call we'll help i, you I think every single show hayley west is here she finds some excuse to get a green machine out, doesn't she? It's sitting behind, she's like, let me just show you actually, because I, I am going to use it on this. And doing buttonholes on, if you're doing a shirt, how many buttonholes are you going to have to do mm. to do the magnetic snaps or, you know, it's brilliant. Really so much easier on her jacket. Okay, so the next colourway we're going to introduce is the bronze. You can see it on your screen, exactly the same price. If you do want to get a mixture of colours, have we got some of these kits as separate or is there a chance to get extra silver or extra bronze on yeah, their own? Absolutely. On the Sewing Street website, okay. all of these components are available to buy separately as well. Fab. So you can top up from there. Well, that's what I'm thinking. People yeah. who bought this months ago, people who have bought it already and thinking, right, I'm now using out or using all my silver, I want to get just the silver kit, you can get them underneath us on the website. So... The bronze, once again, just to recap, you get your machine with the handle, with the soft grip. You also get the whole cutter die, all of the dies to go with the rivets, the S-spring studs and your magnetic snaps. Look at me. Good. You even said to me, do you remember all of this? I was like, yeah, I do. I do. It sunk in the last time, Dave. Um, can you show us, please, the S-spring press studs then in bronze? Yep, Thank no you. problem at all. OK, so this time I'm going to use uh, a bit of back to cork fabric yeah lovely. okay so again what we're going to need to do is to put on or put in our three millimeter hole so i'm going to double that over okay and again can i buy different holes as well you know like the different hole punches so if at a later date i want to do i don't know like eyelets on tarpauling or something like that if you want to is that something that you're going to be able to bring forward Yep, so we do um, hole cutting dies from um, two millimetre all the way up to 20 millimetre. Oh, grand. Okay. Yeah. Um, as I said, the three millimetre is 
the most common that you'll ever have to use. The only time that you'll really ever have to use another hole cutter is if you're fitting eyelets, because then the size of the hole adjusts with the size of the yeah. eyelet. And yeah. we'll show you that later. Fabulous. Okay. So I've now got two holes, mm -hmm. okay, with one with one cut effectively. I'm just thinking this can is something that's going to grow with you and you know you've got all of the bits now to get going in the three most popular components but I mean we've got Diamante um, option we've got loads to bring you today extra kits but I love the fact that you've picked probably the most three requested the most three most popular hardware bits. Yeah. Yeah, so, so as I said, th these ones will be the ones that will be your your go-to. Go so your right press stud comes, is it four or five elements so, to so it? So we have four elements to a S-spring press stud. What's the difference okay. with an S-spring press stud? Is that something that's... Okay, so there was, the traditional press stud was like two open rings and it's like a, a compression fitting, mm -hmm. okay? Um, then these were invented. So the S-spring press stud on the back of this part here, the socket, if you just, I don't know if you'll be able to see that, uh, there's just yeah, another spring yeah, element yeah. in there. And then what that means is that then grabs hold of that stud, mm -hmm. which means that while it's closed, it's a really, really nice tight fit. But if you want to take it apart, there's that give in that spring element, which means that you're not pulling on your fabric. Okay. So these are fantastic for your shirts and your jackets mm -hmm. and things like that. Whereas the traditional press stud are really good if you're using tarpaulins right. because you want them held down tighter and you're going to be less likely to keep undoing them and putting them back together. I'm with you. Yeah. yeah. Lovely quality. Okay. So with these elements, so there's four, four components there and then there's going to be four studs, uh, sorry, four parts dies. of the stud dies okay. as well. Okay. So if I just rearrange these, so we've got these in the right order okay so this is your post and then that would sit on top of that die there mm -hmm. okay your stud then just fits in and snaps into there mm -hmm. okay your socket the same way just snaps into there okay and then your cap is that got like a magnet in it or something no or no, no it just it's fits. just how we've designed it it just grips <gasps> onto it okay, okay so because these parts screw in we don't want those to keep dropping out right okay so we put the first part in so we want our cap and our socket will go together and that's going to stay in there even though it's hanging upside down yep it's just enough grip there just to make sure. So you don't want to be fiddling around trying to put the things in. And now, you only need to screw them in each time. It's you don't just need to over tighten it. It's just okay. enough just so it stops. Now, what we want to make sure is that that cap is on the presenting side of our fabric. Okay. Okay. So we make sure we put that on. We just push down. Okay. And then that side's on. There's no dents. There's no oh, damage. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah. And then we do the same on the other side with the other components. If you make to sell, or even if you're gifting it to somebody, you just want to know that it's not going to come apart, it's going to be secure, it's going to look professional, but also it's going to work. Um, lots of people getting the bronze option as well. I love the bronze, actually, because I think it goes with the majority of your, your fabrics, doesn't it? Okay, okay. So, so then you've got the... So this is now, this is now the... Um, the stud and the post that we're putting on. So again, so we just put the fabric over the post there, bring that down, give that a push. Okay, that's now securely on, and then... How quick and easy is that? And that's it. Do you know what I love? That there's no puckering around the edge, it's all nice and smooth. And it's just very quick, very simple, and that will now last. You will never have to change that again. So how many of these do we get? How many of the S-spring press studs do we get in the Mega So Landle? you get 10 sets of the S-spring press studs, 10 sets of the magnetic class, and 100 rivets. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Right, so I think it's only fair that we give the gold uh, a bit of a show, and we could do the magnetics <laughs> with, the, uh, with the gold, if that's okay. Uh, well done, everybody who's checked out on either the silver or the bronze. These are now your gold Mega Bundle, but I need to warn you we started with limited stock on the gold so just be aware that these could sell out very very rapidly it comes again with your machine it comes with the hole punch it also comes with the corresponding dies to go with your s springs your magnetic snaps and your hundred rivets what's the old no in my ear for ah oh, there's a lot of you have got these in your basket 
three-way split pay as well, £50 split pay. Uh, remember, you don't need to pay any interest on that and you will receive it after that first payment has been made. Uh, Dave's got these ready to go. You'll receive them in the next few days. Three-way split pay is brilliant. I think that's a, a great benefit. I know you often probably will do a lot of trade shows and events and yes. things. Absolutely. And so you can show people how amazing this is in like 30 seconds as they're walking by. But what an amazing chance to sit here for an hour and a half and actually put it through its paces, answer any questions. You normally probably used to talk in a million miles an hour at people to be like, right, you've got to make this, yep. this purchase quickly. <laughs> but I suppose a lot of people do say, actually, yeah. I can quickly see that this is going to be really useful. It's not setting up loads of things. It doesn't do a million things. It just does that one thing very, very well. Yeah, yeah absolutely. But, yeah, so it is really helpful. And this is exactly the opportunity. So, you know, message in yep. to us and then I can take you through step by step. And then the beauty of this is then, because it's recorded as well, we can then watch it back. Yeah. Fantastic. Right, so the magnetic clasp, again, you've got the four different parts. I don't need to worry about sourcing these dies. They come as part of the mega bundle. They do right? indeed, yeah. Okay. So when you're using the magnetic clasps, so we have um, a male and a female uh, magnet, and then we have the two rivets. The two rivets are identical, okay? Um, but the, the male and female, so we've got a uh, male part to the actual um, snap, Mm -hmm. and that will go on the female die, okay? So that fits in there nicely. And then the opposite there with the male and the female of that die as well, okay? And then we stick in these rivet caps, okay? Just again, nice and securely just get held when we push those in, mm -hmm. okay? So they won't fall out as well. So first of all, what we're going to do is to cut our hole again. So just that little push through, and again, we've got our hole. Have you found a lot of people who, you know, have bought these from sewing work, uh, shows or crafting shows that then husbands appearing over thinking, actually, I could use that for this? Or are they as useful for other crafts as well, basically, or it, other hobbies? It is probably one of the most common things I get told is that a husband wants to steer it or it's found its way to the garage or something along those sort of yeah. lines. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. So, again, we're just going to put this these in. So, as I mentioned, we've these magnetic clasps, the beauty of these ones. So there are different types. The traditional ones, um, you'd either sew in mm -hmm. um, or they'd have yeah. the prongs on that would have the washer that you'd have on That's the back. That's what we have, isn't it? Yeah. Um, now, the problem with those is that if you're making a bag, you need to make sure you put those on before you put the lining on. That's so true. Because you need to you actually to hide those. Back, yeah. Absolutely. So the difference with these is you can put them on at the very last minute because the rivet, the rivet head on those is really nice and you can oh, okay. present that as yeah. well. Okay. Oh, well, I know your uh, friends with Emma Brassfield, yes. she's got one of these, hasn't she, and loves it. I mean, anybody who has, we've all been there where you put on a... a a magnetic clasp and you think, ah, you can see it on, on the inside yeah. of my line and it doesn't look very nice, no. but this is this is your solution. This is absolutely it. And so you can wait until the very, very end of your design and go, okay, am I gonna put on an S-spring press that or I'm gonna make it a magnetic clasp? Absolutely up to you. Okay, so again, what we need to consider is that we want the rivet, we want that on the presenting side of the fabric, okay? Because that's the part that everyone's going to see. Okay, so that's that one on. Yeah. Uh, I love how, you know, little effort it is to press it down. Like you said, actually, the key is not forcing it down. You've actually got to take it steady and nice then just simple. giving it a little press at the end. Yeah, let the machine do the work yeah. for you. And it's also worth pointing out as well, this bench is really high yeah. as well. So when you're using it at home, you've actually got a little bit more leverage there as well. So it's even easier than what even I'm making yeah. it look. Yeah. So, Okay, so again, the same process again. We want the rivet on that presenting side there. And you'll see that that magnet's so strong, it actually pulls the die out as well. <laughs> okay? They are good quality. Go. I mean, that is fab, isn't it? And that's finished. And again, both sides, no scratches, no dents. And you'd be happy to present that 
-hmm. on, on the, the, the lapel of your bag or something. Oh, absolutely. Sort of like. If you're professional, if you're selling your products, you don't want to be like, oh, actually, I've, you know, I've dented that or it's hammered it or it's, it's, it's got all, you know, scuffed and scratched, whereas that is absolutely perfect, still as it was in the tub. So, again, to remind you, with the gold colourway, you're getting 10 pairs with your um, S-spring prestos, 10 of your magnetic snaps and 100 of your rivets ready in the kit along with your green machine, the hole cutter and all the coordinating dies. Message in. Oh, here we go. This is a good one. Why are you not on air today, Julie? Two words, buy it. Brilliant. I love that. Proof's in the pudding though. You must, it must make you very, um, you know, Confident when you come in here and you say, Look, actually, just ask the Sewing Street customers. There have now been hundreds and hundreds of our customers that have, have bought and all love it and are using And, and are telling all of their friends as yeah. well to come and watch the show, see it in action, and then buy one themselves. Well, I'm not going to lie, I didn't know whether this was going to be. I don't want to use the word like gadget or, you know, I always find gadgets a little bit sort of gimmicky that I think, Oh, it might be something that um, you watch and you think, Oh, I've got to get one of those. It's actually good to know that every single person who I know has bought one is using it. Mm -hmm. is, they have got it out of the box yep. and they are using it. Um, hi, will the green machine make holes in my husband's leather belt? Absolutely. So again, going back to, to, to this material we was using earlier, that, that's quite thick. But one thing with these hole cutters is almost the thicker the material, the better those blades will work as okay. well. Okay? okay, so it's when it's very fine that, that you know you, you might have to fiddle around with them a little bit more. I mean, really fine, but on these thicker materials, it's just an absolute breeze as well, and totally the opposite to how you'd use if you're using the hand tools of the hammer. Yeah, I'm thinking leather belts or um, buckles on shoes. You know, straps on shoes. If you want to make an extra hole in a in a shoe strap, mm -hmm. this is brilliant. Let us know what you're using for, other than bag making or, you know, dungarees and things like that or snaps. I want to know out of the ordinary things that, you know, what... <laughs> Let me know. OK. Right. If you want just the green machine on its own, we can facilitate such a thing. Remember, you are going to then need to source your dies and your accessories, your hardwares. But if you do, just think, well, today... I'm getting my, uh, my green machine just on its own. That is your hand press. Does it come with this or not? No, it doesn't come with the it, little it, foamy. It comes with the foam handle. Oh, good. So you get the green machine with the foam handle. We want everyone to be comfortable. Yes, fabulous. So you will get your, uh, your, your handle as well. £57.99. But as I said, you will need to then obviously source the correct dies for it. Hence why Dave Green has put together um, a, a fab bundle for us. Did you call, is, is this a green machine because you are Dave Green? No. No? Because no, there's a the blue machine as well, isn't there? So but the, you can't bring it to us because your name isn't, you know... Dave Blue. Yeah. No, we've got somebody else for... No, I'm joking. <laughs> um, so, yeah, the blue machine we're hoping to bring on onto our next show. That's, that's a, a button. Button, ma button, button making, making machine, it. yeah. Brilliant, yes. Um, OK, hole cutting die set. So if you are getting the machine on its own and now you're wanting to add the hole cutting machine, then this is the one that comes with... That's this one here. OK, yeah. so, your little base. So you'd buy the machine and then you just buy that on its own. £18.99. £18.99 and you're getting your... Remind me, three millimetre? Three millimetre hole cutter. Three millimetre hole cutter and the base as well that just drops into the bottom of your green machine. OK, now... Before we go on to the newness, because I'm so excited, can I give you a little sneak peek so you can start shopping on the web if you want? We have got, oh, Kat, where are you? Or I can show you on the overhead. There we go. We have got three, well, what would I use these for then? Are these eyelets? So, so these are our diamante oh. eyelets. Um, they're oh. great. Um, they're a great size for drawstrings on bags and things oh. like that. Yes. Or just for mere decoration. I they're love absolutely them. beautiful. Look, uh, this is like your little baguette cuts in there and then you've got all your sparkles on this one as well and then this one's just like sort of cut that it, uh, it, it, it looks like it's, well, it's all mirrored, isn't it? It's beautiful. They are fancy. They are brand new. They're coming up. Not yet. You have to wait for those. You're going to have to wait. And they're in a full box full of lots of them. Can we please do the die sets on their own? Yeah, absolutely. Gold magnetic clasp. Oh, so not the dies, or do they come with the dies? Yep. 
Oh, so great. Can... Thanks, Dave. So you've got the magnetic class with the right dies. Yep. So, so <laughs> we've got, uh, here we go, magnetic class with the magnetic... There we go. So magnetic class with the magnetic die set. So you can buy that as a bundle on its own. Well, maybe you thought, right, I'm going for the silver colourway, but I want to do gold magnets, mm -hmm. negative snaps on a shacket that I'm making, the Tallulah shacket, for example. Then this is perfect. £26.99. So anybody who's already got their green machine, we're going to fly through these. But if you do want the gold individually, go for it. If you want the gold rivets, which dies are uh, th that go with the rivets? There, there go. you go. If you bought the machine on its own or you already own the machine and you've got the, uh, the bronze, for example, and you want the gold rivets. Yeah, good idea. Every time Dave's here, just get yourself, treat yourself to a new die set or a new, you know, hardware. Spread the cost then. £24.49 and that's for 100 rivets. That's for 100 rivets, yeah. It's a nice colour gold as well. Mm. Nice, really nice. Um, S spring press studs and the coordinating dies. This time in the gold, you get all of your parts for ten magnetic snaps to go. Uh, sorry, yeah, yeah, to go within your. Uh, no, sorry, these are your S spring press studs, aren't they? Your S spring press studs. Sorry. To go within your um, green machine, twenty two pounds ninety nine. If you've got your starter set in silver or in bronze, and you just want to get your S spring press studs in gold. Add these on as well. You don't get any of the, uh, the the extra bits and bobs with that. It's just simply your dies and your snaps. Your S string presta, sorry. <laughs> um, I was almost seamless then. Right, <laughs> let's do the silver individually. Magnetic clasps. We've got time to do this today, you see, because yeah. we've got a day for an hour and a half. So just to make sure if anybody's rooting around on the web like, oh, I can't quite find what I want. Ask your questions, get them in. Remember, you're getting 10 sets of your magnetic snaps along with the coordinating dies. How is it that I know that it's these dies that I go with my snaps? I suppose, like you say, I can label these, can't I? You can label these. I mean, once you start trying to put these together, it is um, reasonably obvious. Oh, so okay, with the cool. magnetic class ones, you can see they've got that one's got a yes. little bit, that's got a little indent. That's only going to work with those ones. Right, okay. brilliant. Um, so they go in the bottom. Is they drop right? in the bottom and then these part, which is for the rivet caps, um, they'll then screw into the top. Now, th these are 14 millimetre uh, magnetic class, but the 14 millimetre refers to the actual snap part itself. The right. rivet head is 12 millimetre. OK. OK, which Brilliant. is a great size for a bag. Fab. And then we've also got in the silver your S-spring press studs. Sorry. Yes. You want to do the rivets? Rivets. <laughs> Oh, he's been ever so... I told you he's needy today. He's been on holiday day for 10 days and he comes back and he thinks he can be really deaverish. Bossy. He's very bossy. <laughs> he said, I am. I am bossy. £24.49 for 100 rivets. I'm trying to see if I've got anything in the uh, studio that's got, um, that's got rivets. I'm thinking, you know, on... Um, uh, dungarees or on um, bags, on straps, on there's loads of places on jeans. Yeah, on, on your jeans. Absolutely. And it's just reinforce, isn't it? Really, if you you might have them on pockets on. So yeah, so when 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 you're making your um, uh, straps for your for your handles on your bags, absolutely, you'd want to use rivets on those. Um, if you put in a lapel on a shirt or something like that, you may yes. want to use them there as well. Um, but as I said, also for decorative purposes as well, they're really really nice. £24.49. I'm just looking at my new flares to see if I've got any rivets. Um, uh, yes, go for those, a hundred of those. And then my favourite, the S-Spring Press Studs. No more, right? Does anybody need a comfort break at home? No, we're powering on through until one o'clock, if that's all right with you. Are you all right? I'm Keep good. going. I'm good. <laughs> Thank you for asking me, though. Thank you for asking me, Ben. So you've got your coordinating dies with those S-spring press studs. Because I like an S-spring press stud. <laughs> Everyone has their favourite. There ain't no press stud like an S-spring press stud they're singing in my ear. Right. <laughs> Let's go for the bronze colourways. Magnetic. No. Magnetic. <laughs> <laughs> right, 26 99 
I'm loving because I did soak this all in. I was ready. We knew exactly what's in what tub. I'm going to bring my label maker next time for you. £26.99. These are your magnetic snaps. You've got 10 of them in the lovely bronze colourway. If you manage to get the silver starter pack um, or your mega bundles and you're thinking, right, I just want to add one pack of the bronze in, this is your chance to do it. You do get your coordinating dies in these packs, uh, remember, as well. £26.99. Or if you've got the green machine on its own, and you got your whole punch. Grab these. Twenty-six ninety-nine. Rivets. A hundred rivets. And your two coordinating dies. Are you constantly looking at new dies that you can sort of? Because you do you do, is it you who sort of designs them so, and so, yeah, so produces the dies? We, we design all of this in the UK. Yeah. Um, and yeah, so we're, we're constantly, I mean, we welcome feedback. Tell us what it is you'd like to be using it for. At the moment, the green machine, I mean, this is a small selection of what it can do, but there's 40 different dye types that you oh. can buy for the green machine. Okay. Um, and then when you add in all of the different sizes within those, that's over 200 different dyes that you've got available to. Wow. You. And we're just trying to increase that. That's amazing, isn't it? That is amazing. And what sort of... Um, Outside, because I was asking for exotic uses, what sort of uses have you found that people come back to you and say that they use it for that aren't like the obvious um, bags? So, making? <laughs> so we, <laughs> we, 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 we've got a, uh, a university student in her last year that's approached us and we're sponsoring this year, and she is making a whole dress out of spiked studs. <gasps> So we're looking at the moment around 10,000 studs that she's putting up and each of these have been put on using the green machine Brilliant. and it will look absolutely so, amazing. Uh, do, you, uh, do you do those spikes? Uh, yeah, we do those and there's a, uh, there's a dye. Oh, we've got to get these in. <laughs> have you seen that designer that has them all on the shoes? Yeah. Oh my gosh, you could have, yeah, you could do it all on your shoulders, on your uh, leather jackets or denim jackets, they'd look amazing. Mm -hmm. We've got the, uh, d the eyelets that are coming up, which are going to look amazing if you do want to make your designers, uh, you know, your designer-esque pieces. Uh, Esspring press studs in the bronze, please, Dave. And then we will, ah, yes, somebody's asked, do you have any rose gold, Dave? We, we have rose gold is in the uh, rivets and also in the magnetic clasp. Amazing. Uh, and they're yes. available separately. We will do those next. We'll do those next for you. Uh, okay, right, let's go for it. Thank you for your question. So they're over on your side if you wouldn't mind reaching them. So we've got the yep. rose gold magnetic snaps. You're getting how many of these? So you're getting 10 sets of those. Yeah. And then a die set. Oh, you get your dies. Brilliant. So you can buy, you can buy these as the bundle like that, or you can just buy the, the magnetic clasps on their rows so you add to your colours. Ah, that's good to know. So I'm not I'm not getting multiple of these if I've already no. got my green machine. But if you have just got the green machine separately, we're catering for you as well and giving you the right corresponding uh, magnetic snap dies as well. Okay, that's great. So underneath us on the web, if you want any of these individually, they will all be underneath us to, to add to your stash. And then we've got the 100 rivets. Brand new, sorry, brand new uh, Diamantes coming up next, by the way. They're coming up next. There's your rivets in the rose gold. I do love the rose gold. Remember, the only way of getting the rose gold is in, you know, this bundle or individually. You can't get them in any of the mega bundles. Mm -hmm. Right. The most popular way to get the green machine today has been the silver mega bundle. Let's quickly revisit that before I show you my new biz. So in here, just to remind you, you're getting all of the dies that you need to go with your rivets, your magnetic snaps and your Esprit press studs along with the green machine. Don't worry if you're just tuning in. We've been live with Dave since half past, so we, we will do another demonstration on it. But we've got some really exciting new eyelets. I must say, I love a little bit of bling. And it looks, you know, very sort of industrial. You've got your, you know, those work, uh, those things that are going to make your, your projects very sturdy and durable but i also love that it can also make everything very very pretty, pretty. <laughs> very very attractive very sparkly so tell me what we're going to get in the new set of diamante eyelets okay so with this bundle you are getting 
Um, these are six millimeter diamante eyelets. So you're getting a six millimeter hole cutter nice. and then a six millimeter diamante eyelet die set as well. And then your eyelets themselves, you're getting 50 of each in gold, silver, gunmetal. And they look lovely on the reverse as well. Mm -hmm. They look really nice. So if you are putting these straight onto, like you say, to, to use as decorative on a garment, they will look amazing. But if you're doing any bags and you're going to put a drawstring through or, you know, cord, leather cord or anything, then these are absolutely just really ideal. Set them off lovely. <gasps> and I love just them. Make something, it makes your product unique then, you know? You, don't, you haven't been over on Jewelry Maker, have you? No. Do you know, this would be really good for jewellery makers. I just thought, I'm imagining like a cuff bracelet with eyelets that you then lace up, or I've got um, a, a belt that's got sort of eyelets that, that's then got a, you know, a sort of laced up. If you do like wedding dresses or corseted sort of backs, this is absolutely ideal. And how beautiful are they? Three different designs, three different colours. You're going to get them all in the pack and they're 39.99. Right, so... I was going to say, I don't, I, I've got my dies, haven't I? Mm -hmm. So it's not like I need to buy anything separately to be able to insert these or look at what I've got in my stash. How, what is it, can we show this in action to see how it is that we set this up? Because these are going to be great, aren't they? They're flying out, by the way, absolutely flying out. If you've got them in your basket, check out. You get a kit of 50 six mil eyelets. Okay. So again, we've got our hole cutter. So six millimetres this right. time. Oh, so that's handy for your stash anyway, isn't it? That you've yeah. got a six mil hole cutter. Absolutely. So it just helps increase what you're doing. Right. And then what I'll try and do is I'll replicate what we have here so you can see how quick and simple that was to do. So we'll have just three holes. And again, we're just waiting for that click. It's a good tip, actually, to swivel it round before you open it up, just to yeah. check that you're happy with that it's completely... Um, Made that hole. I love there it. There we go. Three holes. I mean, how would I even put these in if I didn't have a green machine? Are there different sort of hand tools? or I, I don't even know. I've we, never seen them. We've only created these and then the green machine. We're not aware of anyone else that's actually supplying those either. Oh. So they, it, it, they've really come off of the success of the Diamante rivets that we'll show you later as well. Yes. They've been so incredibly successful that we wanted to find other ways of, of adding some more bling to what it is that people are doing um, and making crafting a little bit more exciting and fun. Definitely. Okay, so then within our three holes, we're going to put... So these work slightly differently um, to what would be a normal um, eyelet because the washer on a normal eyelet would be the, the part that you'd keep on the back side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Whereas with these, the washer is actually the part that's diamante. So we want to be showing this part off. Yeah. Okay, so I'll make sure I get that all the way around. That's the silver. The silver on there. The gun metal on there. Let's do these one at a time. Okay. So we put the washer onto there. We make sure we put that diamante onto there. Yeah. And the, that's not going to damage the diamante part of it. No, absolutely. I'm not so, pressing so, it and it's going to damage, you know, I'd be worrying that I'm going to damage my little gems. No, so we've actually designed um, the die so that as it comes down, it actually doesn't affect the actual oh. diamantes at all. That's why you have to have the specific die each time um, that you're buying a new piece of hardware. So just make sure you get that perfect finish on it. And there we go. And there's th the three again. That is brilliant, isn't it? Oh, these are going to be so... I am thinking really lovely, pretty um, drawstring bags with, like, lace for bridal bags and all sorts. Because I do love eyelets on bags. I think they look really nice when you've got your uh, nice cord or a denim jacket. Yeah, they've got all sorts of ideas in my ear. But... Um, yeah, these would be perfect. <laughs> but corsets, corsets have looked really, really stunning on something like that yeah. as well. Something you really want to show off as well. Absolutely, absolutely. Right, so just to remind you, they come with a little storage tub as well. So you can keep your corresponding dies with, uh, within there. Um, if you have bought the Green Machine today or any other time that you've been watching the, the shows, this is the first time that we've had these beautiful Diamante um, eyelets. 
just so you're aware, way over half of our brand new stock of these have gone and checked out. If you've got them in your basket, I can't guarantee that, uh, yeah, I can't guarantee availability at the moment. Aren't they beautiful? And they look great on the reverse as well. They look really lovely and neat. Um, so if you are using these as sort of functional items or whether you're using them as aesthetics, they are going to look really, really lovely. We have got the Diamante rivets as well. We've also got the... Um, so do you know the little... These ones? Snap poppers. Snap poppers. We've got those as well. We've got those as well. $39.99. Keep going through for your Diamante eyelets. They're your six millimetre. I will keep you updated on stock over the next couple of minutes, but if all of those check out, then they have sold out. Good luck. Go through. Okay. So, yes, please. Snap poppers. Just because, I mean, I see these day in, day out <laughs> on baby grows. I'm sure you would. These are brilliant for kids' wear. Yes. What, why is that? Why, why do I see these all the time on... And I'll, I see them here when they put them on, like little baby grows to open them. Is that right? Is that what I'm seeing? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So, so with, with these, they're just a lighter, smaller version of you, okay. like a press stud. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. If I wouldn't put those on my baby no, grows, they're, they're too big and bulky. Yeah. Um, whereas these are very nice and light, um, and these are uh, open ring snap poppers as well. So if you've got a design in the fabric that you're using, then these will, will come through as well. You'll what see colours have we got in there then? So on these we have uh, white, yellow, uh, pink, there's a baby blue, red, and then black, and then we've got um, your standard silver as well. Fabulous. And then all the corresponding parts and your dies in your storage tub. $39.99. Again, amazing price, isn't it? Especially for that next sort of level, elevating your makes. Um, and if you are working on lighter weight fabrics, any tips? Because I know you said this is great if you're working on thicker fabrics, your leathers, mm -hmm. your corks. If I am doing baby grows on, say, like, you know, a, cock a lightweight cotton, yeah. any tips of you know, handling the green machine and, and putting these in. So, so no, so the, again, the dies will do the work for you. Um, so you can't sort of overpress them or anything else like that. These are specifically designed for that lighter. So you don't need to cut a hole first beforehand. Um, there's little spikes on there and they'll actually pierce through the material right. and then catch on to the component on the other side as well. So they're really nice and quick and simple to put on as well. And they come with the two dies all ready yeah. to go. Do you want to see it in action? Yeah. Go on, we've got time today, haven't we, to do everything? We might as well. Keep your questions coming in. I also want to hear your feedback. Anybody who has got the green machine, what do you love about it? How are you finding it? What have you made? Send in your pictures. We've got 45 minutes, so, yeah, message in. Ben wants to hear from you. He's being needy. <laughs> no, he's all right today. OK, so <laughs> with these, hmm? there are... Oh, I'm picking up the wrong parts here. He's going, tell them I'm not needy, tell them, tell them. <laughs> Where have there you been in the last six weeks then? Have you been um, doing any shows? Have you been about? We, we, haven't, we haven't done any shows. The next show that we've got coming on is the Knitting and Stitching show at Alexandra Palace. Oh, it isn't until October. So, right. But there's lots of other things going on. Lots of new products that <gasps> we're trying to research at the moment and bring on board. Yeah. Okay, so um, there's four components here. Um, but we've actually only got two dies. Okay. Okay, so it's really, really nice and simple, this one. Okay, and we're going to use a lighter piece of, of fabric. So this is just a bit of cotton that's interfaced as well. Yeah. Okay. Um, so the bottom die, um, and then... Would you always recommend interfacing something? Because, you know, uh, when I've seen, you know, people putting in magnetic snaps or, or they've, they have used squares of interfacing when putting in hardware so would you still recommend to do that with the green machine um it's really down to your design the green okay. machine it, 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 it's irrelevant really it's down to what it is that you want to do the green machine's versatile enough that it will sort of cope with what you're doing okay. and and that's why we you know with these dies so you'll notice on on something like this we, we design it so 
that you can um, center everything perfectly and this little part here sort of depresses in ah. so that adjusts the pressure so as we push down we're getting the right amount of pressure there and similarly on here this silicon is dual purpose that's not just to hold that in place mm -hmm. that, so again that as we put more pressure on that then takes that pressure so we're not overdoing it so right. you know that will cope with if these were strong enough to go through leather, it would cope with that. Otherwise, it would cope with something really nice and thin right. as well. Okay, so we're going to put that. We're going to put that into there. And this time, so we're going to put this ring just over that centre post there. And we want that ring to be on the facing side. Yeah. So we just position that where we want it to. And you were uh, essentially then... Place crushing those little spikes down is that that's right? it so those yeah. spikes then go through that material and then they go right. into the back of that okay and then we do the same on the other side as well so we put that onto there okay a lots of these bits and bobs always on our sewing street website as well that if you know i'm buying a green machine i'll be able to find different are you so, you're bringing stock back to us each month aren't you that Yep, so yeah. all of these components uh, are available directly from Sewing Street oh, as well great. and are already on the website. So whatever you're buying, so yes, start with the mega bundles and then you've got your dies, but anything that you want to top up for yeah. individually, yeah, you can just yeah. go to Sewing oh, Street and great. buy those straight away. Okay, and then we do the same on that side as well. Okay, and then that. And look at how lovely that is as well. For a lightweight fabrics, this is absolutely ideal. It doesn't necessarily need to be for babies' clothes, but for, you know, for nice blouses or um, for anything that you want. And nice purses, smaller, lighter weight purses. Yeah. These are really, really handy. Really good for purses, yeah. And, and you get how many of each colour, sorry, Dave? So on the each of the colours, you're getting 20 of each of the colours, apart from the silver, where you're getting 120. Oh, my gosh, brilliant. So that is going to keep you going, isn't it? That is going to keep you stocked up. £39.99, another one that is back in stock. Um, I'll remind you, every single time Dave has been here, we've had sell-out shows galore, and we've got, remember, people restocking today. It isn't just new people coming in being like, oh, I'll try that out. We've now got a lot of repeat custom a lot of people who are coming back and restocking uh, speaking of new customers if you've never seen the green machine before let me just revisit that first mega bundle you just mentioned it if you have um, got the silver in your basket be aware this is going to be the first to sell out I think there's way too many of you have got it in your basket you've got the green machine the hole cutter all of the corresponding dies to go with your S-spring press studs, your magnetic snaps and a hundred rivets. All of that with your machine as well, $149.99. We have also put it on three-way split pay for everybody. So if you want to make the most of that 0% interest split payment, speak to the customer service team, or if you just click the box on the web, um, it will automatically set that up for you. No credit check needed. You don't need to uh, uh, wait until you've paid all three payments to get it. There are so many of you who've got this in your basket. In fact, I I I'm being honest here, Dave always sort of oversubscribes us and says, look, basically have as many as you sort of want and we can deal with it. If everybody checks out of that number, then 20 people are missing out. There are so many people who have got this in their basket. So many. I think people just expect, you know what, this is probably going to be here all the time. Mm. I would absolutely grab it today whilst you can, especially if Dave's here. We, we do have a really good number of stock, but, oh... I think it's because, like me, I mean, I am only here sort of six days in the month, and every single time I'm here, the so green machine the green is machine. mentioned. Just now, in the green, in the green room, <laughs> Deb, in the green room with Dave Green. Uh, we're going to call you, yeah, the green machine, Dave Green. Um, as soon as um, I arrived in this morning, oh, you've got Dave on. We, we know each other. I've just bought the green machine. He's going to show me how to do this in the, uh, before I go on air. So, yeah, Debbie Moore was using it. Um, Hayley West, last time I was on with her, and she was like, do I have time to just do a quick demo of the green machine, please? As we were doing something completely different, but she absolutely loves it. Um, would they... Oh, they would be ideal for envelope backs on cushions. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, really, really good. Brilliant. Yeah. Um, I really are... 
I, yeah, I know. Isn't it great? Ollie's just said, I love the split screen. It's fabulous. Ollie's just created that for us. Thanks, Sewing Street and Dave, making everything really clear to see. If there's anything that you want us to demonstrate again, of course, we just wanted to show you on both cameras, Dave, that he's not going, Ooh, whilst it's, you know, on the close-up shot. You can see both. Um, I'm tightening up old denim jacket shirts and, uh, and jeans. I love my green machine, Jean. Jean, have you got these? Because if you're tarting up denim jackets and shirts, these are the brand new Diamante eyelets that we've just launched today. And these are ideal for that. And I like the fact that you can upcycle. It doesn't need to be sewers actually that are necessarily buying these. It isn't no. just people who are constructed. You could have garments that are already made for repairs, for all sorts. So recycling, upcycling is a really big part of um, the community that we, we supply these to because they can take something that they've had in the back of the cupboard for, for years on end, repurpose take it, it out and actually repurpose it and bring it up to date, make it modern and make it a fresh piece of a fresh garment. Uh, you know, we are we are all about that, aren't we? Especially in today's world, we're you know, aware of, of sustainability and uh, then I think I've lost your talk back, by the way, Ollie. Um, but this is your chance to now have a look at what you've got. Anything that's broken, if you're thinking, oh, well, that magnetic snap's broken, this is your chance now to, to maybe fix a lot of things as well. 149.99, just very quickly, in the silver colourway, remind us, Dave, for anyone who's just tuning in, what it is that we get. Whilst I swap my talk back. So with the silver, so we get 100 rivets, 10 of the S-spring press studs and 10 of the 10 sets of the magnetic clasps as well. Um, you'll get your three mil hole cutter, your S-spring die set, your rivet die set and your magnetic die set along with your green machine and your nice foam handle. Susan in Hampshire has messaged in. She sent two messages. <laughs> Why can't you see them? Oh, send them back. Send them again. Please, will you send them again? Because we want to hear your message, but we can't see them. Ben's saying it's not coming up properly on his screen. Um, yeah, we want to know how you have found your green machine. We always get endless positive feedback on it. Just $149.99. Right. So, eyelets. If the blingy ones are a little bit blingy for you, we also have your planar option yes. so your your classic eyelets so, so these would be your traditional eyelets again in six mils so great for um drawstrings and everything else um this time you then get them in um the silver the gold the gun metal and yeah. also that bronze option as well which is really really popular um and again along with that you get your six mil hole cutter and your six mil this is just the standard eyelet die set um and i must say if you bought all this individually, it would cost you nearly £20 more. Yeah. You are saving £19.84 pence on this pack, getting it under £40 for you. And you get the case with it as well. Great. Which is useful, <laughs> actually, do you know, because you could... Mm. I would label them, like, on here. I would label them on the lid so I know, you know, what it is. Six mil, mm. eyelets, I know exactly where it is. Because you are going to build up a bit of a stash of these. I bet yeah. it becomes a little bit of an addiction. <laughs> bit of an addiction warning when you get yourself a green machine. You'll be like... Right, what else can I put my eyelets in, my rivets in? I think a lot of people that do their crafting, it's a bit like looking at a menu in a restaurant. They look at all of their, what they've got, and they go, oh, how can I use yeah. all of it at once? Yeah. Exactly, exactly. Well, even just in our designs today, what have we made with Debbie Moore? A cushion, envelope back cushion. We've just had a message. Great for envelope back cushions. We made a cosmetics bag. We made a concertina toiletry bag that you could use the snaps for to make mm -hmm. it. Uh, virtually every single project we could have incorporated. Yeah, the hot water bottle holder, you could have yeah. put them on there as well to bling that up. Oh, you're watching. He was watching. <laughs> £39.99 and that's with a £20 discount today or £98.84 pence discount. Your six mil eyelet set. Um, and look, I love the Diamantes. They are absolutely up my street, but maybe I'm not going to use them on every project. They're for my special ones. Like you say, if you're doing anything bridal, flower girls, bridesmaid dresses, anything with a lace up back, a corseted back. I mean, that would just look amazing. I've got a belt that's like a corseted um, sort of belt. And that would look really lovely. But actually, I'd probably go for some of these, like, unmetal greys. If you're yeah. working on, like, your PUs or your leathers, <gasps> they look amazing. 39 truly professional finish. We got a little bit of sparkle, which we haven't spoken about yet. Here we go. Now, you have bought these in the past, and they 
flew out, I'm being told. These okay. were very, they, very popular first time round. They, they sold out with, within the hour before we finished the show. Oh, look at these. Right. Why do you think that they were so popular, Dave? Um, because they're just That's so pretty. pretty. Yeah. <laughs> um, you can just <laughs> add them to, to absolutely anything. I mean, they look fantastic on denim. If you want yeah. to add some individuality, Aww. you're getting 15 different colours there. Um, so you're getting um, 10 of each of those colours, plus then the uh, acrylic rivet die set as well. And with that one, you'd use these with your three millimetre hole cutter. So that's the one that I get in the Mega Bundle originally. Ab absolutely. These yes. are gorgeous. I mean, one, they're so, so sparkly. I'd put these on white canvas shoes. Mm -hmm. If you've just got a pair of like pumps, plain pumps, imagine jazzing them up. And because you're putting them on and they're so secure, I'd be putting them on my little girls' trainers as well and making them look all jazzy. All so if jacket. you have your sandals for, for summer, or your flip-flops, anything like that, just to bling them up a little bit. Flip-flops, yes. <laughs> I want your Crocs on all sorts. These are going to look amazing. Uh, 39 I love this idea. And they're super secure once they're in. Mm -hmm. They're going to look sparkly all, all day, all night. They're going to look amazing. But, yeah, just to upcycle and repurpose. I know a lot of people who are saying, Vic, I'm not a dressmaker or I'm not a quilt. I'm not a bag maker. I'm a quilter or I make different things. You can bling up things that you already have with uh, this machine and these rivets. They are amazing. Once again, saving nearly £15 on these by buying it in the kit today, £39.99. Now, if I were to put this in with a sort of, you know... Uh, a tradition, it was something you would do by hand, mm -hmm. I'd be so scared that I was going to damage, damage it. Yeah, absolutely. So again, with, with the, um, with oh, the yeah, die set... Oh, yeah, well show us how you put them in. With, with the die set that we have for these, again, they're specifically designed so that you're not going to create any damage, you're not going to... Um, uh, you're not going to damage your garment at the same time. So, so on this rivet, it's slightly different to the rest of them. This one's actually sprung loaded. Okay, um, and again, then on this side, we've we've got the silicon again, not just to hold the, the the rivet cap in place, but actually to take away any any pressure that we're overdoing. See, it's the on engineering, those. isn't it? We're looking at all the nice, pretty bits, but I can tell you get excited by that. You know, <laughs> the engineering of the the dies. Well, as I said, that's what makes the green machine. You know, that, that's what brings it to life. Um, so, you know, we can try and make something that's difficult, something that people are scared of using generally, and we can make it really, really simple for them mm -hmm. and give them confidence when using that as well. These are gorgeous. Go on then. So, right, so... Let me try it on. Let, let's do, put it... Oh, on. I am thinking. I've got something a right fun. boring pair of flip-flops. I'm, um, I'm going to Marbella for a wedding in a couple of weeks. I could be blinging up my... Because she's told me that I've got to wear these stiletto heels... And I'm absolutely going to be putting my flip flops in for the end of the um, the end of the shot. Look at that, by the way. This is the camera move. Oh, split screen, so you can just see how simple it is. But yeah, imagine putting them yeah all the way along my flip flops, my little foam flip flops. It's going to make them look really nice. So, would you like to choose three colours? Yes, I will. Oh, this is the fun bit, isn't it? I'm going to go for. I'm going to go. I love this bright blue and I love this bright pink. <gasps> Those two. Oh, and the purple, please. So each part has the diamante bit and then... And then this little, little rivet dimple. back. So it, it's worth saying with this, with, with the double cap rivets that we've put on earlier... Um, they are decorative, but they're functional as well. And as I said, with those then, um, the two caps you can actually cr crunch down so that they actually then touch each other. So because that post is not absorbed into that receiving cap. With these slightly different, these are a decorative um, piece of hardware. Okay. And, and these little caps, they're just going to grab onto that, that rivet. So um, we don't want to push... We can push as hard as we like, but we're not going to crunch down the whole of that post. They're meant to sit proud, these things. Right. OK? Uh, I must say, has anyone called you Mr Husky before? <laughs> yes. OK. I just wondered if it was an inside joke because Viv's messaged in saying, I've just got in and I've not missed Mr Husky. I need stuff. <laughs> We've got Diane saying, can I get Diamante snaps, clasps and S-springs for the... Green machine. Do you do the diamante, these ones with diamantes on? Um, no. So, so with these, 
Um, sorry, so we do the, obviously the Diamond Sea rivets right. and the Diamond Sea eyelets. That's all we have so far. Oh, but watch this space. You never know. We all have our bling. Uh, hi. Um, I will. It's brilliant. David and Jordan. Sorry. I'm so slow at reading. I'm so sorry. It's on the screen. It makes it really hard. David and Jordan, great if you need help. Oh, are these your team here? Yeah. Um, it's made my daughter's satchel and my daughter-in-law's laptop case so professionally finished. Fabulous. That's from Susan in Hampshire. So, oh, we got you in the end, Susan. This was the message that we had. So, David and Jordan, part of your team, any questions, any problems, speak to Dave. Um, so, Jordan's my son. Oh, lovely. Um, so, yeah, another green. <laughs> right, uh, and then we'll go. Will he come on the telly? Um, yeah, at some point when I allow him. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay. We'll put that one in there, and then I need another cap. No, thank you for all your messages. I was just thinking of other ways. That there's so many different ways. Oh, you, when you mentioned about walking the dog. I thought, oh, imagine doing some of these on really nice, like, dog leads and dog collars, all sorts, that they're just to bling them up. They're going to look lovely. We've got a pampered pooch, you see, a little uh, Maltese terrier, and Bella would, oh, we'd love a little on a lead, just putting some diamond rivets. No, I have, no, it's my mum's dog. We're not getting a dog. No, 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 no. Do not need a dog. And so what was the third colour you wanted? Um, it, it, whatever, it's fine. They're all beautiful colours. <laughs> there, so We've got the pink, the purple, pink, and the blue, pink, please. Purple and the blue. Hmm? Let's get that into there, and then the back. Oh, this is where I need your help, Vicky. I've got fat fingers. All right, there we go. <laughs> okay. Uh... Yes. There's three colours for you. There you go. You could see how lovely they look. Oh my gosh, even from a distance. Um, they are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. They are like lovely jewels, aren't they? They're going to look amazing on any garments, any clothes, denim jackets, bags, all sorts. And you can use these still, even though you called them sort of more decorative rivets, they're still going to be great for on, um, you know, if your bag straps, if you want to... Yeah, you can still seal with them. Yeah. I wouldn't put a lot of weight on them. That yeah. would be all, though. But, yeah, absolutely. Fabulous. Right, there are diamantes. Ben, what are we recapping? OK, everything is now listed underneath us. Do you want to just show the website so we can show you where everything is? Only if that is all right... If I'm being a diva now, if you go to sewingstreet.com and click on watch live, there we are. Any questions? Now is the time to ask whilst we're live. Now everything you can see, there's nothing on, coming up on today's show. Everything is listed. There you have got your eyelets, your snaps, your rose gold. You've got your rest springs. And they're all also, did you put the list them all, run them through individually then, Ben? He's even ran all of them individually for you. So look, the cutting die set, the three mil holes on their own, the green machine on its own is there. And then they're your three key mega bundles. They're all there. 149.99. Stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> he says, I can't stop. It's on automatic. It's just going to keep going and keep going. I can't stop it. Um, right. There's today everything for today's show. The foot is all jammed. It's jammed. Are you actually joking? I don't think we can... Oh, dear, there it is. It wouldn't stop. OK, green machine, mega bundle. If you have not yet bought this machine, don't take our word for it. The amount of people that have said... How many are in baskets? 54. 54 people have got this in their basket. If you are on the fence, message in. Why are you on the fence? If there's anything that we can help or answer any questions, what are the most common questions asked when you're at the show? If somebody comes up to you and you're showing them, what do people generally sort of ask? Um, I suppose how thick a fabric that they can go into. I mean, um, this is a really thick 
That's a, that's a really heavy you. piece of vinyl, that is. I yeah. mean, that, that, that's, you know, and as I said, you know, but we can go, that, you know, that cork is really nice and flexible and fine. And it works just as easily on that uh, as what it would with, with this really heavy PU. And then even heavier leathers as well. And what about if I've got interfacing and I've folded it over and I want to do it, you know, as in like layers, if I'm layering yeah. up fabrics, well, is that okay? As I said, so when we do this, so, you know, very nice and simple, we just cut through. And that's it. And then we've got our two holes straight away. I suppose there. you're not really going to you're not going to break it. Have a go. Do yeah. more to let. If it's you know you'll know if all oh, right. Okay, I'm not going to do ten layers of cork. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah. you'll know at what point it's not going to go through. A a neatly. Absolutely. So um, as I said, the, the the main thing with the hole cuts is you don't slam it down. So okay. I think people that are transitioning from hand tools you know, to something like this, they are used to getting the hand tool and then whacking it with mm -hmm. a hammer and then thinking that they've got to apply that same sort of technique to, to a green machine. This is a, a, a solid base here and that blade, you know, is very fine. So as we come down, if we do that, we're going to chip and shatter that blade. Um, so we treat it with gentle care and that will last a long, long time. Which is great to know. You mm. don't need to use brute force. Mm. You do not need to eat all your spinach and be Popeye to be able to use this. It is literally for all of us to use. And for anybody who struggles with handheld tools, uh, if you've got dexterity issues, as you said, this desk, as you can see, is actually a really high desk. At home, you'll be using this where you can use a lot more of your sort of body uh, weight onto it and have even you know, less effort than what you're using on mm -hmm. there today. So just to remind you, you get your machine. It also comes with a nice little comfort grip handle. It comes with the hole punch and the dies that coordinate with your rivets, your S-spring press studs and your magnetic snaps. Just to remind you, when you get it home, it will come in two parts. How yep. easy is it to put the handle in? So, so when you receive it in the box, um, there's this handy little guide here that just shows you step by step with images, just what it is that you need to put it together. Right. Okay. And then on the other side of that as well, it shows you the range of dies. And then there's a handy little QR code so you can register your two year warranty as oh, well. Oh, you get two year warranty? Yeah. Fantastic. Oh, I'm just looking at all the different things that we're going to be able to do. <laughs> yeah, Jean, snap poppers, we've seen. We've seen a lot of these, to be fair. We need our stud. You need studs. Have you bought these star studs to us before? So, no, we haven't. <gasps> we need these ones. Jeans definitely. buttons, that's quite a popular one. Jeans as well. buttons, yes. A variety of those that we can use. Yeah, I'm just looking at, I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> Turning on with the buying team now. Yes, we'll have those. What are cam snaps? So cam snaps are um, similar to our snap poppers. They're, they're little coloured plastic snaps. And again, you might have seen those on your daughter's clothing yeah. as well. Right, yeah. okay. So they're really useful. You also see those oh, yeah. on um, quilts and duvets yeah. and things like that. Yeah. yeah, oh, brilliant. See, this is what's great about the green machine is, yes, you think, OK, I can put my rivets in, I can put my magnetic snaps. Oh, no, 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 no. Even though, yes, it is something that does one thing and does it very, very well, because of the range of dyes that you have, there are so many possibilities on, on what you're going to be able to use this for. Any questions, please do get them in. You also have lots of tutorials on YouTube, I believe, yep. don't you? Even though we've done, you know, an hour and a half special today, which you can watch back at any point, you do have, you know, support on... on Absolutely. So, so um, yeah, so on all of the dies that we have, there's a step-by-step -step guide on YouTube, um, and we're looking to hold um, sort of regular um, TikTok lives and, and things like that. TikTok? So then people, so that people, and that would be Jordan doing that. <laughs> um, that's his claim to fame. But um, but then, yeah, so he'll be doing those as well. So being able to interact and, uh, and people can ask questions and he can demonstrate those as we go along as well. Fantastic, fantastic, right. Lots and lots of support. For the last um, 20 minutes of the show, should we go back to the start? For anybody who has not seen this in action, we just want to show you how easy it is to uh, to to use. So when we're setting up our dies, any tips on you know how to sort of organise yourself? Um, so I mean, a, a box would be really really helpful. Yeah. Um, yeah. We'll look at seeing if we can bring something in, uh, maybe like an organiser for the the next show as well. But yeah, absolutely. So try and make sure. So w when you receive the dies as well, they'll come in a little packet, and that packet will have a, the, the sticker on with the description and everything else. Okay. If you can get into the habit of making sure once put you've used back. the die, put them back, then things don't get lost. I mean, that that's the real thing. But as I said. It, it's very difficult to, 
you're unlikely to mix up the dyes if you ever get yourself in a state though send us an image and then we'll point out which one's for which. Yeah, we've had a lot of people uh, messaging you saying how helpful uh, Dave and the team are. Uh, is there anything that is, uh, you know, nearing up selling out that you want us to, to recap? The silver bundle, the silver bundle. Please remember to check out. There are way more of you have got this in your basket than we have availability. There's now over, oh, there's 27 people that are going to miss out on this. 28, lots of these going in <laughs> baskets. 100 rivets. 10 of your S-spring press studs, 10 of your magnetic snaps, your machine. The, two, the other colorways, don't forget, are also available. So there is gold and there is bronze. Sorry, I've got the bronze one there. There's your bronze. The bronze, once again, comes with 100 of your rivets, your S-spring press studs and 10 of your magnetic snaps with the same machine, all of the dies that are coordinating with it as well. Plus, don't forget, today, three-way split pay. When Dave is here, we're very lucky that we're able to offer great split pay as well as these big... Well, you are actually making savings when getting them in the bundles, aren't yeah. you? So it's worth going for it. This is then your gold. Gold colourway once again. 149.99. Please be aware that you may find sort of replicas elsewhere that might look like this machine, but they are not this no. machine. I must say that because we're all guilty of it. You know, you look at things and you end up going into a bit of a rabbit hole. You are Dave Green from Green Machine. <laughs> like, I mean, this is something the, that... The, this is the original. So the original. Said, the, the, this is five and a half kilos, um, cast iron. Um, it's made with quality products. It's made so it isn't going to damage you as, as much as damage anything that you're putting on as well. Um, it comes with a two-year warranty as standard. Um, and yes, you're quite right. There are copies out there. Um, the, the ones we've looked at are generally around sort of three kilos. They're, they're made of an alloy um, and they break very, very quickly. Um, and a lot of our customers have previously bought one of those. Mm -hmm then regretted it because it's broken oh, and then come and bought, bought ours anyway. Buy so once, buy you're right. just wasting that initial yeah. spend by, by buying cheaper, first of all. Yeah, absolutely. Um, have a look again on our FIFA reviews. There's so many um, fantastic independent reviews and I've loved hearing your messages. But as I said, it's, it hasn't been just today that I've had messages. Every single time I've been on air since I last saw Dave, the amount of people that have messaged saying that we've got these. Um, I've got a few messages. Can you use the four mil hole cutter with the Diamante rivets? Do you need, well, you get your three mil with it, don't you? So no, you don't get the three mil okay. with, with this one. You could use a four mil, that would work absolutely fine. The post on those is three millimeter, but your head size um, on those is eight millimeter. So as long as you're going smaller than the head size, otherwise the whole thing will drop through. Um, but just beware that they will spin round quite happily. Um, because they don't clamp <coughs> up um, like a standard rivet. But right. four mil would be fine. Um, Christine, because I said, do you know with these, you could bling up nice uh, dog collars and dog leads and things. And Christine's just said to me, Vicky, you could make dog collars and dog leads with the green machine, add rivets to make the loop, add a hook, make the holes, add the buckles with the rivets too. You only need your leather or webbing. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Fabulous. Fabulous. Um, and then let's just again revisit the brand new Diamante eyelets. What size are these? Remind us, sorry, Dave. So these are six millimeter Diamante eyelets. And you do get your six millimeter. So you get everything punch. that you need with those. So you get a six millimeter hole punch and then your six millimeter Diamante eyelet die set as well. So as long as you've got your green machine, you're ready to go. And they are designed that they do not damage the diamantes. You've got them in the gunmetal grey and the silver and the gold. They're all within your kit. $39.99. Pack of 50. Right, 20 left. 20 left and 52 people who have got it in their basket. It's going to be another sellout show today. This is kind of your final call now. I know we've had a nice leisurely hour and a half of Dave. But now in that last... 10 minutes or so, this is where the baskets go wild. So just be aware, if you've got anything in your basket, go for it. They're all slightly different as well. This one's got like little, uh, well, you've got the gold, obviously. And then this one's got your sort of gunmetal grey. And then this one in the centre 
It's just texture. There's no actual little stones on that one. It's just so, mirrored, isn't it? So, sorry, I should have explained. So, you can have that that way, or you can. Oh! That's got, actually, then the stones in there as well. Oh, is that? You just so, put it on the wrong so, way. So, so, well, not the no. wrong way. It, it's another way. It's another way, another <coughs> kind of having it. It only really works with the silver. I should have explained that. My apologies. Oh, Can actually, no, I think over? it works with either. Oh, OK. But, Look! They're reversible. <laughs> so, oh, well, I'm, I'm if not... That if that suits you, Vicky, that's fine. Well, <laughs> I was just thinking, you know, we're all, we're all going to do it one day where we go, oh, I've done it the wrong way. I'm really annoyed at myself. I've put my eyelet on the wrong way. It's going to look lovely either way you do yeah. it. It's going to look lovely. So your silver, you've got... There you go. You've got your sort of channel set sparkles as well. They look amazing. 39.99. Uh, and don't forget, the way that the die has been designed means it's not going to damage those stones. No, absolutely. You, <coughs> you get a perfect me. finish on them every time. Um, and as I said, you know, because of the machine and the way that's designed in conjunction with the actual die set, you're, you're not going to damage, you're not going to over crush them. Um, you're not going to go in at a weird angle. They're not going to fall out later. So if you are creating something that you're looking to sell on as well, you've got no fear of those returns coming back to you as well. Mm, exactly. Or even if you're gifting it to somebody, you want to know that it's there and it's not going to fall apart. Mm. Um, so uh, going back to what I said right at the start is I know hobby sewers that, you know, might sew on a Sunday or just once a week or just sew at their leisure. And I also know people that sew for a living that all use the green machine. It's something that we... Um, we absolutely love as sewers. But now I am thinking, I mean, we're in a building here full of lots of different crafters <laughs> and I am shocked Jewelry Maker haven't snapped you up yet. We've got to get you on Jewelry Maker because they would love this. Hobby Maker, they're already eyeing this up. <laughs> Dave's like, I'll have a bit of this. 39 99 for your gorgeous, stunning Diamante eyelets. Aren't they beautiful? Drawstring bags, they're going to look so pretty. Corseted backs or dresses, they're going to look fabulous. And then imagine using those in conjunction with your Diamante <laughs> rivets as well. Yes, absolutely. Let's show you the Diamante rivets. Anybody that missed those earlier? They are here. <laughs> so many beautiful colours. You've got one, two, three, four. 15. Gosh, 15 different colours. 15 different colours. In your storage tub, ready to go with the coordinating dies, and that is your nice spring-loaded. I thought this would probably be more expensive, actually. <coughs> £14.86. Saving on that one today for £39.99. And then you can top up. Once you've gone through your kit, you can then top up individually on your individual colours on the site as well. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Um, is there anything else that we can demonstrate? I'm just thinking if we can squeeze in one last demo. We've got five minutes left with you, Dave. If we could just show one of those key elements again, either, you know, your magnetic Esprit snap or... or we'll put the silver bundle back in because they will sell out. They will sell out. There's... <laughs> He's like, I'm telling you, Vicky, we don't have the stock to go around. I don't want people disappointed at one o'clock. <laughs> is it not on my first day back? I don't want disappointment. OK, so we're going to go with the S-Spring, you said, yeah? Yeah, okay. yeah. There ain't no party like an S-Spring party. <laughs> OK, so again, I've doubled over my cork there, <laughs> OK? Yes. <laughs> and we're just waiting for that little click. And then we've got our two nice clean holes and we can take out that three mil hole cutter. And look at how easy it is to do this. You don't need any tools, any sort of, what are these called? Um, spanners? Yep, no, it, it's all nice and done by hand. What, what would you call them? Screwdrivers. <laughs> you know what I mean. OK, let me get our fork and Well, I don't know whether you get a spanner on things like that to... You just have to screw it, literally. It doesn't need to be really tight. An Allen key, that's what I was thinking. I love the fact, you know, I'm really... Not very handy, as you can probably tell. But I, I love the fact that having this, I would feel like I'm doing some real sort of DIY with this. <laughs> okay. And I know that Kieran would be using it for something. It's like I, I borrowed a jet wash off, um, off Kieran's uncle the other day, and there's Kieran. I really wanted to do it, and there's he loving this new little gadget of jet washing the slabs. But this is something that I bet if you have got somebody else in your household, they will find a use for it as well. 
There we go. Oh, I've got the wrong cap. There we go. So the S Spring Prestard comes in how many parts, Dave? So it comes in four parts. Right. Okay. So we've got the post, and that goes on to um, this die here. Okay. Um, we've got the cap, and that sits just nice and neatly into that one there. Okay. We've got the stud, which clips into here. And then the socket, and again, that just clips into there. Okay. okay. So we're going to do the socket and the cap. Oh, isn't that a good camera shot? Just you wait, because you can watch Dave's face and see how much sort of effort he's putting into it. There you go. Oh! And then we're going to swap those over. And we're going to do the post and the stud. You're not a talkback, are you? No. Have you got an earpiece no. in there? No. Just as well, I think. <laughs> He's on form today. He's been back off a holiday. <laughs> he loves how much we're mentioning about studs. He's a stud, obviously. Apparently. <laughs> OK, OK. So there we go. So all nice and done. OK. Nicely clips together. So th there's nothing. So a lot of people, when they're using the hand tools, because they're going at an angle or something like that, this will then get damaged, and therefore then the stud just won't clip in. <laughs> But because of how this works, everything's always lined up perfectly and just without any effort at all, we're getting that perfect finish. And that's actually so much quicker than I've seen people inserting magnetic snaps, whether it be the sewing ones or whether it be ones that, yeah, uh, um, I'll put in with then a bit of interfacing and then you've got to get them moving your lining. These can be done at the end of a project choose what fastening you then want, and they all look lovely yeah. and neat. So whether you want to use your S-spring or whether you want to use your, your magnetic clasp, they're, they're just as simple to, to put in. Um, and said, and then the, the, the nicest thing is, is that you can do it with confidence that you're going to get that finished and that you haven't spent all of that time creating that bag, and then you're going to damage it right at the very end. Exactly. Dave, honestly, thank you very, very much. And um, everybody jot down today's date because we've gone through everything and demonstrated it all so you'll be able to watch it back. But you've converted us all. Everybody's getting a green machine. Right, can I just show you? Because, oh, by the way, everybody needs to check out. If you've got it in your basket, you're not necessarily going to get these because we're way oversubscribed on everything. Um, I am so excited. I'm taking all these. I'm having all of these for me and my friends. I feel very excited because I've worked in the uh, television shopping telly industry for 15 years and I've never had my own birthday pin badge ever. I'm so excited. I've made it. You've also got, look, it's got a little microphone and everything. It's so cute. We are giving away one of these with every purchase whilst dogs last tomorrow. It's my birthday show. That's why I'm very excited. Tomorrow, Dave, thank you for wishing me happy birthday this morning. Right. And he said happy birthday. I was like, oh, I should tell you it's today really or tomorrow, but it's, it's next Friday. I'm having it early because I'm away next week. So I'm really excited to spend it with you tomorrow. We've got our birthday bundle deals coming up at eight o'clock. And then Bex is here with, I'm going to be biased, but I think it's some of the best Amber Makes projects we've ever launched. Even Kat is agreeing with me. They've arrived in and it's so exciting. That's nine o'clock. Brand new fabrics at 10, more Amber Makes kits at 11, and birthday sewing machine deals. Oh, yes, it's going to be good at 12 o'clock. Thank you so much for your company. Thanks, Dave. No, Are you thank back you. next month? Uh, I think in about six weeks' time. Fabulous. We'll see you then. Right, check out of your baskets. Don't go anywhere because you've got more crafting with Hobby Maker and Dave Bradford after this. Mm -hmm.